I mean, I thought you meant didn't she? Okay, okay, okay. Hmm. So, no new information. I'm just gonna go ahead. Oh, please, please. Controller, controller. Controller is not working. What is going on? Come on, come on. Come on. Okay. Is it working? It's not working. Excuse me? Oh, come on. This controller works. X and start. X and start. Come on, come on. Pull again. Pull again. <sighs> this is an anticlimactic start to things. Just plug it in. Okay, there we go. I think? Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. So we're back in... What? No, no. What? Huh? Controller's geeking out. Second. Okay, there we go. I don't know what was up. Okay, okay, okay. Come on, come on. Alright. So there we are, and the big thing is that I need to try to find... There's an illusory wall somewhere. One of these bonfires. I'm gonna find a few more because there were a couple of doors in the sanctum itself that I gotta open up. But after that, I'll actually be going back to Iron Keep real quick. Because in there is gonna be the pathway to the next of the two out of three DLCs. The second of the three DLCs. Because we beat the final boss of the first DLC. We beat all three bosses in the DLC. We beat the Gang Squad. We beat Alana, the Squalid Queen. And we also beat seeing the Slumbering Dragon. So we're just heading back to the Sanctum real quick. Yeah, because there were, like I said, there were two bonfires and a couple of doors that I did not manage to open. All right. So apparently there's supposed to be an illusory wall down here somewhere. And that is the big question. If you drop down and after that, it will apparently be somewhere on my right, I think. If nothing else, I can keep trying to tap on some of the walls. Could be worse, could be better. Come on, come on, Dragon Sanctum. Can't really go up there. Okay, cool. Come on, come on. Jump over. There was also a decently sized bloodstain that I lost earlier, so... Ideally, I would also like to try to get that. Not here. Not there. Ah. Also a... Drake Knight over this way. Hello. These are pretty interesting guys to fight, honestly. Especially since I've gotten decent at backstabbing them. Sometimes. Come on, come on. Get over here and... Well, whatever. Die. There we go. Just gotta make sure I don't just die. Tough enemy, try parrying, or just backstab, just slam them. All of those work. Let's just keep on going. Come on, come on. Also, I have solemnly decided that for the bosses in the coming DLC... Well, that's all gone. Never mind. Guess I'm not getting that bloodstain back now. But the three bosses in the upcoming DLC area I'll be going into... They're all weak to bludgeoning damage. So I'm gonna equip a ring that allows me to fight effectively barehanded and then fight them barehanded. Let me see. Shulva Illusory Wall. Let me see. Secret door in the crown of semi hidden switches. Hidden bonfire, third and dragon sanctum. Where is that crap? Uh, let me see. So they jump down there. Then along the wall. And down. So that was more or less where I got to. 
Okay, broken staircase. And two left turns. Oh, this, whatever. Black lines on the wall. Oh, it's that thing, whatever. Okay, cool. Well, in that case, I'll just go back. So maybe I just wasn't paying enough attention, or I missed a queue that was there, but the real question is... There were a few doors in the first part of Dragon Sanctum, which simply just did not open. Or at the very least, they would have been triggered by switches, which I just did not find. Guess I could go back, beat up some more of the Sanctum Knights, and just poke around again. The big thing about that, though, is... Yeah, there was that other mechanism to turn. It's probably a switch somewhere in the spike pit that I just didn't look at because I didn't give it enough time running away from the knights and uh, trying to avoid dying on the spikes. Especially since those spikes do destroy items. Which, yeah, certainly something. But. The next DLC is going to be the Crown of the Old Iron King DLC. The Old Iron King is actually the only one of the three mentioned kings in the DLC is who actually just shows up in the base game. But of course, since you already fight him, you don't fight him again in the DLC. You just go to other new places and fight other new bosses. Though the area is supposed to be connected to the existing Iron Keep you going. Oh, okay. Come on. It's just... Oh! You weren't aiming at me at all. Oh, whatever. Please. Yeah, I'm just gonna flatten you. Hi! Oh, what? Die. And one more. Annoying, annoying, annoying. Whatever. Not that much trouble. So what else? Oh, and there's also a no invasion icon on there right now. Probably because we... Well, almost certainly because we already beat the boss, and that's why. So go around here, keep going down, get on this staircase. Oh, hello. Come on, come on. Jump. One, two. Oh, that didn't do it. And what? Oh, what? That makes no sense. It's just... That is the weirdest, jankiest, and most obnoxious thing about Dark Souls 2. That sometimes the lock-on just inexplicably doesn't work, or... In certain cases, like, doing attacks after a roll, it reliably doesn't work. But I suppose the whole rolling attack thing might be... might have been deliberate. So that if you were rolling around while other enemies were moving, you could aim your attack more directly for the sake of better positioning. But it's... Still, a very notable market difference from other previous Souls games, and in my opinion, at least not one for the better. Well, whatever. I know where to go now. All I have to do is not mess it up. And maybe, if I'm lucky, there'll be some treasure or something by that bonfire. But that said, it doesn't seem to link up to that other passageway I was seeing. A little sort of columned balcony. I might need to jump down into too. We'll see. It's very, very complicated. It's interesting how there are a lot of completely optional and not intuitive, non intuitive secrets. You go all the way to the final boss of the DLC and beat it to a pulp and still miss a number of things in the sanctum. Again, this place literally was supposed to basically be a trap fortress, kind of like. Sins and Dark Souls 1, so it makes sense in world, but it doesn't make it that much less frustrating. Yeah, you know what? I don't really care. I'm just gonna run past them at this point. It's not my problem anymore. Come on, come on, come on. And are they? They are chasing me. They're still chasing me. It's crazy. So I'm just gonna jump down, make couple of left turns, I believe. And hopefully, there's going to be some kind of black line on a wall, what I've heard. But it's not this, I don't think. Weird. 
Come on, and oh wow. That was certainly a roll catch. We go around here. There should be a black line on a wall somewhere. This doesn't. Yeah, this is just more empty treasure chest. What? Uh, uh. Why are you just absolutely massacring me? Well, of course, it's because I ran and tried to avoid you, but you don't need to spend too much time saying obvious things. But where is that bonfire? I don't think it was down there. Can't really get back up there now. Ah, there's so much crap to deal with in here. Uh, annoying, annoying, annoying. It's not that, I think. It actually might be that spot. Bonfire trying left. Okay, so it was that. So they just made it a lot less obvious in the scholar version. Hi. Oh, please. This, I think this is it. I see some lines on the wall and... There we go, there we go. Come on. Come on. Let's just go in and light this bonfire. And what are you going to do now? Okay, and now they're gone. So this was kind of pointless. Gorgeous view and short try pure luck. Yeah, more or less. This was absolutely ludicrous. So, anything left? And it's still pointing out in this area, maybe just because there's still a bonfire there I needed to find. But it's just kind of a first part of Sanctum. That is, well, whatever. Whatever. How would I get to... Okay, I guess I'll just go back to Tower of Prayer and try going through the first part of Sanctum again. really keep my eyes peeled for switches because it's there's that door that other rotating door it wasn't immediately obvious how I'm supposed to get over to any of those locations well whatever oh well I'm just gonna run a little maybe fight you over here if you chase me oh wow so one of you will chase me all the all the way the other is Seemingly not particularly concerned. Another backstab. Okay. Oh no, you... Were you waiting? Okay. Do your thing. There we go. Another backstab. And yeah. Again, again. It's nice that everything here is pretty significantly weak to dark damage. Just keep going with my... Actually, you know what? Why not? How much a dark orb does to you? What? Eh, it's not horrible. Could be better, could be worse. May as well just stick with the sword. Hi. Jump. And I guess the spear ones are more vulnerable to being poise broken. Not complaining, but it is kind of weird. So the sword ones and those other guys are more or less unknockable, but... Hmm. Hi. Go down here and well, whatever. Oh, hello. Oh, ooh, ooh. Hmm, alright. Okay, well, alright, and roll back. Simple two hits will do it. Jump, and frankly, I really did not need to jump. But we have plenty of Estus. Don't really have to worry about wasting anything now. Let's just go back. Hit you. Oh, okay. Come on. Guess the damage wasn't too crazy. Just go smack, backstab, and not poisoned yet. Those poison codes really are annoying. Hi. Oh, actually, and hitting them with a strong attack while they're totally. totally unaware of my presence. It actually works very, very well. Oh, that- Oh, this is! Oh, that's really cool. What I had to do all this time was... Hit a switch on the ceiling over here. Wow. Okay, I should have probably known that this was a door, but... Hindsight is 2020. Oh, this is actually just a... Just a chest. 
That's cool either way. What's in here? Oh, five Twinkling Titanites and three Petrified Dragon Bones? Mm, so we have 18 now. Get a lot more from the other parts of the DLC. The question is just what I'd actually like to craft. Because the final boss of the next DLC gives a really, really cool katana. The issue is, is that I'm not sure. I'm not sure whether I'd actually be able to wield it before I end up beating the final boss. So it requires 30 dexterity to use. That would be really, really good against the final boss, because the final boss... Well, it is a multi-part sequence. But every enemy in the sequence is pretty significantly weak to lightning. So if I put lightning on that sword, because it responds really, really well to infusion, it would work really, really well. And since it deals slash damage, it would also work on some of the bosses in the final sequence that are specifically weak to slash. Which there is at least one. So it would be a good choice. The big thing is that I would need to level up 19 more times, and I'm not sure I'd actually have all I need for that by the time I'm done. Eh, yeah, we'll see. It's not that deep. Come on, and... Oh, we almost failed that jump. So in here, there was a switch. Is there going to be one up top over here, or... Okay, that does not look entirely like a door. Hi! Okay, and just... Hit. There we go. Smack you down. And is there a switch somewhere up here? That's the question. Hi! Okay, just come on, come on. Get spiked. There we go. Yeah, it's just... Should be at least one more switch here in the Sanctum. I don't see it. I don't think it's on the spiky staircase. Doesn't look like it. Okay, now we just worry over, run back, trigger the spikes, and oh, you were too fast. Annoying. Okay, another backstab. There we go. Okay, so somewhere there's gonna have to be a way to unlock this door. There's no switch around here, it seems. I don't see any guidance stones. I mean, guidance messages. It's going to be a matter of looking through more of the rest of the sanctum. Or I could just look up where that final switch is and save everyone a lot of trouble. Okay. Alright. Hmm. Oh, it's... Oh, that's interesting. I didn't see that before. That's not a dead end at all. That message psyched me out. Up. Now that is a much better message than the dead end one I got before. To be fair, there was one that said up to, I believe, but paid more attention to the dead end one. There we go. And now, okay, skeleton ahead, weakness switch, therefore circling around. Yeah, okay. What's in here? What's in here? Probably just more upgrade materials, really. And, oh no! That's where you get the puzzling stone sword. Oh, that's cool. Glad I didn't miss out on that. That thing. Mented Whipping Slash. Only found deep within caves of the gutter. Magnetic Stone. Because, yep, this is ultimately the gutter. That, oh, really good deck scaling, but hardly any stat requirement. So when you do a strong attack, it whips it around. Hmm, okay. Let's see what it's like two-handed. So this is what... Fencer Sherry used. So that spinning slash is honestly not all that good, but that's not bad. Okay, I'm glad I found that. I actually read some time ago that yeah, it was in the Sanctum, but I forgot precisely where to look. So the other... The other switch should probably be decently close. We'll see. Let me... Oh, I should have gone the other way. Well, whatever. So yeah, there should be a switch probably up top or on the ceiling, given how this has worked in the past. And yep, I did open that chest. Good. 
Mana Priestess. And at least a couple of those soldier guys. Hi, hi. Oh, goodness. That's just... Oh, but we couldn't backstab you that time. Okay, so it said something about a switch. Oh, and there you are. Hi. Come on. Job and swing one more time. So chaining a heavy into a light is not that easy, but chaining a jump attack into a light isn't bad. Visions of switch. So it should be... Oh, it's actually right behind. And yep, you do need to aim. There we go. That was fun. There we go. So it should be the one up there now, opening up. That really is a cool mechanic. Makes you really actually get use out of bows and the like. Does feel very Zelda, among other things. Some more bonfire. Okay, there we go. So, we got everything we really needed to here. Just a couple of extra hidden bonfires for... Honestly, kind of crazy that I did all that without the help of the additional bonfires. Okay, Sanctum Crossbow, so that's what the knights would have been wielding. And does it deal poison at base? That's the question. Sanctum Crossbow, and it scales with... Oh, it deals dark at base. Let's see. Strong attack fires dark bolt, so it's automatically dark. On Destined Ritual in the Great Depths. Sanctum receives Nary a victor. Huh, okay. Well, let's just go back to Agel's Eagle's Agel? Agel? Eagle's Idol over here. And then we can go to the Iron King DLC. Okay. So I'm gonna you know, I've got so many effigies. Let's just pop one. So, first dragon. Not all that necessary if I'm not even wielding a weapon. So, we're just gonna. Fear dragon? Uh, no, I think Ring of Blades would be the best option. Then we'll just get rid of this, rid of that, rid of most of this. Probably keep some hexes on there for. Just to make sure, but nah. Now I got. Our barehanded power stance. This is pretty good damage, too. Let's see, real quick. Yep, 3 3 3. With nothing equipped. Thanks to the Vanquisher seal I've put on. Just need to go back and. I want to see, real quick. And yep, that will spin that around, but since we flicked the lever, it isn't even spinning fire anymore. So, pass this one last ironclad soldier. And after that, we're gonna reach Broom Tower, I believe. Hi. Swing, 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 and one, two, one, two. Even on New Game Plus, or Bonfire Intensity 2, more accurately, it's just four punches and therefore two combos. Takes them down pretty easily. It is nice to be able to specifically target enemy weaknesses. Just gonna go through here, around the funny lava pit that I actually only fell into once fighting that guy. So that's where Old Iron King shows up. He isn't actually a demon proper, but he looks like one. This is just a teleport, don't need that. What I do need to do Oh, oh, forbidden is the path to the ancient king's domain. With water dry and path amiss, woeful temptation is dismissed. Tower of the old Iron King resides a child of dark. Trespassers will face adversity, befitting a monarch. Old Iron King. Tower of the old Iron King. Water dry. Temptation. Okay. Let's go and... Wary of woman, therefore not here, because the child of dark here is Nadalia, the Bride of Ash. And she is a pain to deal with. She's not actually a standard boss battle, but she will still get in our way nonetheless. Braver required ahead, yep. Okay, oh, we can go 
around. Is there going to be a bump on these? Chilled from far away. Rough or dead end. Oh, so just like at the start of Sunken King, these are the places where you can put your summon pool in. Put your summon sign down and get summoned inside the DLC. So the key that lets us in here is the heavy iron key. These are unknown lands. Piece of iron shaped like a key. Altar deep within the iron keep and through a door tower that the old iron king used to produce iron. An earthly weight of this chunk of iron is a reminder of the iron king's own immeasurable strength. And it isn't getting used like a standard key. There's no message being given, but I can actually go through now. Oh, oh. And, oh, elevator, elevator. Nice. Let's go up. And that interesting flower sun motif. Hmm. Do you find it interesting how... Oh, but there's a... Can I have to fight something immediately? Let's see. Oh, no, that's fine. I said death ahead, therefore good luck. Oh, and we walk on the chain. That's actually... So that's where they got the idea from. For Elden Ring from. This is a nice lava-filled area, but it does look to be somewhat far away from Iron Keep itself. But that over there is... Oh, and that's very mechanical. Broom Tower. Okay. Yeah. Honestly, it reminds me a lot of pictures of Volcano Calderas. So I think we're gonna get invaded soon. I think. Oh, and there we have it. Be wary of friend. Someone gonna show up, and I can't seem to reach those guys down there. We're hitting them in one swoop, therefore revenge ahead. He's a lot nicer. Smelter Wedge 6. So that's where we get that. Are you ready? You can't attack me from behind. The big thing is that the smelter wedges use them to destroy these ashen idols that form the remaining body of Nadali and the Bride of Ash. Ashen idol. The consequence to Nadali, who having renounced her flesh, entrusts her very being to it. And they power up enemies nearby. Someone should invade around here. Praise the sun. Here it is. Oh, come on. Bloody expensive, but stay calm. Can I lure him back? Yeah, there's gonna be an assassin invader. And I'm pretty sure that I can't actually knock him off. Beanpole. Okay, I thought he might have shown up unannounced, but no. Okay, well, whatever. Are you gonna show up? Are you gonna show up? I believe he was called some kind of assassin, but no, I think this is actually... We're fine here. This is deep underground for the teleporter. Maybe this might be the peak of the Iron Keep Volcano? Possibly. This is Throne Floor here in Broom Tower. But this is still showing up. I wonder if it just takes time to update or if there's still something that I have to get there. There's nothing that would even come to mind. Yep, yeah, we got Broom Tower over here. Lots and lots of stuff too. So, four, seven bonfires there, and five in here already. Wow. So I wonder how many are going to be in Iron Passage. If there are five here already. Well, okay. How far in Joy Ahead? That doesn't sound ominous at all. And try rolling, and then Visions of Joy. What is this woman ahead? Is there going to be a... Oh, hello. So that's going to be one of those Ashen Idols. Oh, nice. Dark Pyromancies. Okay. So you are supposed to kind of leave one for the very end. Item then Hrafer Life. Oh, okay. Smelter Wedge. Sure. And... As you can see, now it's going to blow up. Get something now, or... Oh. Oh, yep, we get one of the souls of Nadalia. I think you can... 
maybe consume them individually. It's a small fragment. Dahlia, renounce her flesh, one room tower. King Shisat, old Iron King, no longer there. Forsook her own soul and clung to the heirlooms of the king. Only a fragment cannot be used in this state. Can't even consume it yet. Okay. But once we get all the pieces, it will combine into Nadalia's soul, which needs to either make an okayish chime or a decent, unique dark pyromancy. Hmm. So this is one way to go, but we could also go the other way. This is kind of labyrinthine. So what would be down here? Is this going to automatically go down if we... No, it's not. So if we drop down... I did it. Okay, old growth bomb. Nothing we really need. Mm -mm. So how much of this is just going to be dropping down? That's the question. Oh, if I had gone on top of all these boxes, I might have been able to go the other way around. Well, whatever. Could be worse. Hmm. I'll figure it out. Are there other smelter wedges? Oh! I hear some chanting. That is... Oh, well. This is new. Hi. Come on. And, of course, as they are... Armor guys, they are exceptionally weak to... Oh, and they've completely turned into ash. So just walking on them or rolling through them. To be fair, I might have been able to survive this fall. Maybe. And of course, if I really want to, I can always just... Teleport back with a feather. Enemy ahead. Oh, hi. That's just... Come on. Oh, what? Oh, please. Out of the... Oh, no. You are... Crazy. These dual axe wielding guys. Come on, come on. Jump. Smack and oh what what? Ooh. Okay, so that jump attack is actually pretty strong. It's just a matter of reliably pulling it off. Jump and what oh come on. Please get out of my way. Get out of my way. Speed, speed. Speed. Oh, come on. Oh, I got one. So I just need to immediately punch these guys down as soon as, as soon as they start crawling out of the ground. All right, all right. Guys, is this Natland? Ambush ahead. Wonder if anything special will happen if I go through all these little human-shaped piles of ash. Probably nothing. So we can take a ladder down there. And that, okay, going on top of this chest wouldn't have done anything appreciable. Go this way, what are we gonna find? Oh, hi! Come on, come on. Oh, please, please. Okay. Just have one sword. One, there we go. Yep, no weapons. No weapons this time. Only, only these hands. And also, I did receive a challenge from a friend to try fighting Fume Knight without actually destroying the Ashen Idol at Fume Knight's arena. Which, I'm not sure if I'd have the DPS for that, but we'll see. Always love a good challenge. Go around and Black Wheat Balm. Anything down there? Oh, we can just go around once we've gone down a level. So what is at the bottom? It goes way down. <laughs> Message, sniper spot. What would I be sniping? Oh, plus seven scythe. It is cool when they give you leveled weapons. I know that the third DLC has a highly leveled priest chime, which, to be fair, I already had a level of priest chime. I could have just waited, but I wanted to use it on ancient dragon so where is good on there oh uh -oh. i don't even know if there are any mimics in the dlc that's the thing oh another tie night slab they really do just throw a treasure at you left and right in the dlc areas not that i'm complaining but so where i assume going down here would just send us to the same location as dropping wood yeah it seems like it don't think I've missed anything. So there is going to be an idol somewhere. Wait, that actually doesn't seem like it. 
Interesting. Okay, well, come on. Oh, and yep, they are much stronger. Okay, come on. Oh, and they're covered in ash. Okay. That's a cool way to show that visually. Well, oh no, oh no. Don't like that, don't like that. Heal, heal. Mate your attacks, and... Oh, good lord. One, two, and... Out of the way of that, out of the way of that. Ooh, please. Uh, so is this the one I want to weave? So the big thing is, is that... You're supposed to weave one. Because if you don't weave one, then... You won't have a smelter wedge at the end to use on a few nights. Idle. To power him up. Wouldn't give him the ash, but it would heal him. So, I'll think about it. And running out of Estus. What? Another? Oh, come on. Luckily, we can stay far away enough of it. The buff should wear off. Come on. Just. Oh, another? What? What? Oh, come on, please. Or actually, I guess not. Come on. Uh, am I going to be able to get these guys with... No, I'm not. Okay. Hmm. So I guess this is... Not one I can afford to get rid of. So I guess maybe I'll keep... I should have left the first one. There was no enemy there. Nothing really getting in my way, but... Eh, whatever. Time to keep going. What is that other way down, though? And I'm wondering what's there, but... We'll go there after I've already got my blood stain back and gone as far as I can in. Mm -hmm. Yep, and this is... Prevent a bit of fall damage, but... Eh, whatever. How many... There you are! Punch! 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 Okay. So either it's just for the lack of reach of my fists, where they are invisible for at least a spell when they're coming out of the ground. Hi. Punch. Punch. Okay, there we go. And, oh goodness. Two of you. Come on. There we are. One, two, one, two. Oh, what? Oh, the reach on that is really causing me problems. Come on. Oh, and still got hit. Oh, yeah, just... What is going on? Try rolling. I don't think I'll do that. I wonder if that strong attack combo would. Yeah, you'd just slide off the roof, wouldn't you? And fall all the way to your death. Hmm. Right down there. I wonder how Iron Passage is in a spatial sense. Hi. Oh, well, interestingly enough, it does stagger, but. which could be useful. But it's a matter of actually. Surviving long enough to get hit off, so I probably have to wait until they point new. Hi. Interesting. Wave. Yeah, that blood scene's lost. This is not a good way to fight. Hi. Come on and just Oh, you're you're punching too? Oh, this is a fun fight. This is gonna be insane. Okay. It's just Fist on fist. Okay. Hmm. It's out of the way. Oh, please. What? What? Oh, what? Come on. What? Punch, punch, punch. Roll. Okay, fisticuffs. There we go. Oh, no! You're bone fist, actually. Roll. Okay. Ah, bone fist. Mm. So when you go for the flying kick, that's what I should try to punish. When you go for the Hadouken, or... You are! Nice! Fists on fists. Mm. Such a cool martial arts moveset there. And just punch. Oh, well, whatever. And I did manage to get you. This is... Very cool fight. Mm. Moveset is a bit slower than mine. I just gotta hit you out. You go for your flying kick. That's when I punish. Because I can decently combo you. Hmm. So what are you doing? Just gotta roll around until you go for your flying kick. 
Mm. Can you catch me? Can you catch me? Just roll, roll, roll. I try to go for a parry. It's crazy. Oh, what? Oh, so you staggered me, but you didn't damage me. Interesting. Fall down. You fall down. I'll come down. I'll punch. Oh, well, whatever. I should have kept that in mind. Heal, heal. Roll. Nice. I'm a cheater. I don't mind. Mm -mm. So I guess he knows better than to try that flying kick again. Hi. Nice. Punch, punch, punch. Oh, well, we failed that. Yeah, and just... Vanquisher Steel, Vanquisher Steel does good damage and can reasonably poise lock him, but it's the mm, lack of a reach there. His attack moveset moves forward far more than mine. Where are you going? Mm, that Hadoken actually deals pure physical damage. There's no magic there at all. I wonder what he must be thinking, having Magigeta. Martial arts fight, too. Yeah, but that... You know, what I have is more of a boxer's moveset. He's got kung fu. And just punch. Oh, no. Oh, well. It's one more hit. One more hit. One more hit. Oh, you actually hit a wall. Can I? Oh, I actually wasn't... Power stance. That's funny. Hmm. Yeah, imagine how much better this would be with Power Stance moveset. Oh, you're not... Double whips? What a clown. Get out of my way. There we go. Goodbye. Farewell. Killed you in your clothes, Bella. Punched you naked. Good job. I'm impressed. Okay. Exactly, for whatever reason. Oh, because I... Because I quit my staff and it broke the power stance. I wonder how much better that might have done if I'd been power stancing. That said, power stance moveset does actually have a lot of end lag. So that might have actually been worse. If I'd actually gotten it. Because it might have... Oh, and what are you? What is that guy? Weird. Yeah, might have made it so I could get caught out easier. But I do think it would have at least let me maybe do more damage. Well, whatever. I won. No use worrying. Hi. Oh, what? 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 Oh, okay. Weird. Interesting. Oh, and you seem to be carrying a smelter wedge. You might drop a smelter wedge, too. Hi. Punch. Punch. There we go. Oh, did you drop anything? No? Okay. Oh, they were just carrying some interesting looking flaming greatsword. Some sort of animated armor. Maybe. Either way. Fun fight. I shouldn't have asked this, honestly. I would have won anyway, maybe. Well, I guess it's, it's a psychological question because it does influence your psychology. Whether or not you've got I need to get that. Let's use the smelter wedge and gonna hit me or roll, roll, roll. Okay, and yep, I'm invincible. As long as that goes up, so let's just grab this actually and wonder if I could find a way to if I climbed up that ladder successfully, I'd be able to fight them one on one, and that would be very nice. Come on, what? 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 Okay, cool. Well, now I'm dead. Alright. Well, I don't think I should get invaded another time before I at least get back to that blood stain. Yeah, running into someone else who was also fighting barehanded. By mere coincidence. That said, given that one of the reasons I'm fighting everything barehanded is because for Lauren again? Okay. Is that so many of the enemies here are specifically weak to bludgeoning. Okay, well, whatever. They might have been using Bone Fist for a similar reason. Hi. Oh, what? Huh? Not enough poise damage to 
Stop you? Weird. Weird. Okay. Come on, come on. Just... What are you doing? Come on. Can I just... Oh, well. Ugh! Ugh! Ugh. Okay. At least you're not... At least you don't really punish Estus. That's good. Okay, but that jump attack got dodged. Hi. Jump and... That didn't do that much damage either. I'm definitely gonna need to S this up after this. What? 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 Come on. How was I stuck? Okay. Come on, come on. Just out of the way of that. You have crazy tracking. So annoying. And just punch. Punch. What? What? Okay. Ah, oh, just lock on it. Punch. Or not. Or not. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Most of the enemies here are pretty slow. Except for you, for whatever reason. Because you can keep going somehow. Dumb. So dumb. Okay, just like that. Heal up. This is not a good way to fight for Lauren, that's for sure. Die, 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 die. And one more. Goodbye, get out of here. So I gotta go rest in the bonfire again. <sighs> okay. An effigy. Cool. Yeah, because that was... If I had actually managed to... If I had actually been power stancing and punched that guy with the power stance punch, I wonder how much better that would have worked, or if it even would have worked better. But in the end, again, there's really no point worrying about it when I did manage to beat him. Okay. Come on. Come on, come on. Yeah, the poise damage on that probably could have kept him going for at least a little bit, but, eh, whatever. Again, it's not essential. There we go, and... Oh! Oh, you didn't die. So it looked kind of like I might have been able to get you down with three hits, but it was entirely illusory. It was in appearance only. Come on, just punch. Roll. Oh, he caught me. Dumb. Funny iron soldiers. One, two. Wait, so I guess... Maybe counterframes made the difference, but still. Hi, what, what? Okay. Okay. And just one more. There we are. There we are. Punch, punch, punch. The iron soldiers. Because it works somehow. Come on. One more. One more. Oop. Okay. The reach, though. The reach really is the issue here. Okay, so we can go down. Got that smelter wedge. To fight some more soldiers. There we are, right? We gotta drop down over here, and then... There's that animated armor guy. Hi. Said, I don't think you're particularly weak to bludgeoning. Hi! Oh, come on. Interesting, interesting, and... What? Ooh, ooh. Please. Okay. One, two. But when you're on the ground, I can't exactly hit you. Okay. Hmm. So, there are four more bonfires here, and... If I ever actually manage to get it, I will. The question is, can I... Oh! This is not the proper side of the ladder. Oh well. Well... I would have gone be able to go up that ladder, except I tried to interact with the wrong side. Okay. Okay. Suit yourself. I should be able to buy at least some of the forlorn armor from Stride now. Maybe not any of the weapons, but definitely the armor. Also, honestly, I should tune some different spells, because... I don't think none of them are specifically weak to magic, but I could at least put on Flash Sweat and maybe, honestly, probably some healing. Got, could equip Warm four times. That would work. Pretty sure that's the only healing spell I can use other than just standard heal. Because I never bought medium heal. There we are, there we are. 
I am actually pretty close to being able to use Great Heal, but that'll still take some time. Oh, but... Okay. I'm not really using a shield, though, so maybe if I wanted to, I could actually put a chime there. It's a staff. I don't need that. I could put in the Pyro Flame. Okay. Hmm. All right. Either way, it has certainly been an eventful time here in Broom Tower. I do actually kind of wonder if the fact that... Wait. Do I have Power Stance up right now? Do I? I don't. Because I... Oh, because you're right. Because I did something with Sunset Staff. But it does seem like sometimes those Ash Pipes will drop something. Weird. Hi. Large Soul of a Proud Knight. Hi. Then just go down there. Go down there. One, two, three, four. But yep. Okay, so actually maybe chaining light into strong, if possible, would work better. Maybe. I'm far away enough, you'll probably go for your jump attack, and there we go. One, two, there we are. The issue is, is that that really locks me in. Not in a good way. Hi. One, two, one, two. Mm -hmm. Fun. Right, and try to aim down, maybe. Oh, but whatever. Oh, oh, dumb. Hit, hit. And I guess you weren't taking poison damage while you were still stuck in the ground. Are you going to give me another Night Soul? No, no. They can give those away like candy, because they're basically pointless at this point in the game anyway. Okay. Come on, don't fall, don't die. Imagine falling through that tiny gap and dying. That would be more than a little embarrassing. Hi. And just... Ooh! That actually didn't hit me? Okay. Come on. Two. There we go. Like that. And... Okay. Don't want to get hit by that thrust. Come on. Die! And one more. We... One more hit would have killed me, but... It's a good thing we didn't take that hit. Let's go down here and... Try climbing back up. See what we can do. Hi. Can you climb this ladder? Can you climb this ladder? Doesn't look like... Wait, what? Can you? Well... Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. It's just... What would be the best way to really deal with you? That's the question. Because a choke point is good. I don't know where I could really meaningfully constrain you. I could force you in. Hi. Punch. One, two, one, two. The big thing is just get one down and the others become like much easier to deal with. Heal, heal. For oh no. Okay. So honestly, I should probably have just avoided that animated armor guy. Didn't need to. Deal with that, at least not at that exact moment. And then I'll probably be much more able to... ...fight them one at a time if I... ...go down the ladder, hopefully. At least I'll be able to hit them before they... ...somewhat as they emerge from the ground and... ...eliminate one quickly so I don't have to fight too many at once. Yeah, you know... ...math. The logistics of... Punching out armor knights. Come on, come on. Come on. Okay. Keep on going. We got one more. One of you over here. Hi. And just... Yeah, so using the stick to manually aim my punches to make sure I'm actually hitting it correctly. It's gonna be pretty important. Hi. One, two, one... Oh, well. Not if... It doesn't let me change my direction. That was really, really stupid. And now I'm fighting three at once. That really sucks. Come on, just... What? I completely miss? You're, you're kidding me. It's nonsense, and how did... Oh, and that Ash guy blocked my roll. That was really dumb. Whatever. Come on, just... Like this. Please just... Uh, 
Come on, come on, just... Oh, please! What? Okay. Maybe if I try to... No, I couldn't hit the jump. I couldn't land the jump attack. Uh, what am I supposed to... What am I even supposed to do? Die. Okay. Yeah, we are consuming assets like Sunny D. Okay. One, two, one, two. But yeah, it's just... They get staggered and move to whichever so slightly forward. But that's enough to actually... Make them completely block, or completely dodge out of the way of my attack. Hi. There we go, and... So actually, one hit and then maybe a strong attack? That could be a way to... Stagger them enough to kill them right as they rise from the ground, but... Hmm. Okay. It's tough. It's not simple. There was the other way down. There is an Ashen Idol over there. That might be the other one I leave, but we'll see. Mm -hmm. It's just one thing after another. Hi. And where are you going to rise up? Okay, you're over there. One, two, and then spin, spin, one more kick, and just, it's like that, I suppose. Hi. Roll, please, and just die. There we go. Oh. Oh, all right. Here we go, and send like the rest. All right. So we managed to deal with that at least, but mm, where to next? If they were really nice, they'd give me another bonfire here. I don't think they'll be that nice. Hi, there you are. Don't gank me. It's not too much. Hi. Okay, and just one, two, then spin kick. Well, that stunned you. Mm -mm. Pick up and a small orange burr. I wonder if their armor set will ever drop. Hi. Okay, and just spin. Oh, so we can actually control the direction of the spin kick. Well, spin punch. A lot better. Oh, dance of fire. And that corrected my presumption that I never actually mentioned that Eagle was the name of the old Iron King. Magus Aegle, loyal follower the old Iron King, so that's his idol. The bullhead was him. Swooping motion across a targeted area, seems to dance, makes its victims dance with it. Alright. Could be worth trying, but we'll see. Hmm. I haven't gotten a lot of miracles from DLC areas. Hi. One, two. Here we go, and... Oh, if I had fallen off, that would have sucked. That would have been hilariously embarrassing. Death ahead, and it's a door I can open. Not right now. So I guess I'll need to go back up. Oh, so this area was basically just fight a bunch of guys in order to basically, at least for now, basically just get that pyromancy. Alright. Hmm. We'll get a bit more faith, which would actually allow me to use heal but whatever we're gonna go back to some other bonfire i think that down there must be it's got to be the other smelter demon right i would think hi just out of the way of that and one two one two oh well all right one more one more one two one two oh one more time oh that was so close you know, I didn't intend to use a life gem, that should be okay. So what is right? That was just the other chest. So unless there's a switch over here that I hadn't seen. So there probably is. Probably is a switch somewhere that I didn't see, but... Hmm. Guess I might just have to go back the other way. No, no, actually, I'm stupid. There's a switch right here. So, we'll see where this takes us. We gotta go next. More Broom Tower. So that over there is another part. Oh, that's huge. That was big. Produce iron. Okay. Praise the sun. So nobody's ever gonna get tired of that. Let's just see. Anything over here, or... Hmm. 
you worry of fire. It's gonna explode when we go through. Oh, interesting. All right. Actually, let's go down here briefly and anything over here. I don't hear any singing. Or ahead. Hmm. Oh, okay. Old mundane stone. Oh, so some of them actually just have set items concealed in them. That makes sense. I am then just out of the way of that and... Okay, another one didn't spawn yet. Oh, actually one did. Hi. One, two, and actually let's just spin, spin. Well, not if we miss. So these ones seem to be a bit more frightening, or we can just push you off a ledge. That works too. Doesn't seem like you dropped anything. All right. In the path ahead, visions of chest. Lloyd's talisman, and eh, whatever. No more chains. So I guess we'll be going down there too eventually. Oh, well, there we go. Jumping ahead, but think carefully. So I guess, yeah, if you were really, really, really good, you can find a way to get in there. Liar. Okay. So I guess someone said it was a mimic, but you can't break metal chests. I'm pretty sure. Melted desk herb. Two soul vessels. Okay. Oh, you can... Oh, water jars. It isn't useful for that much right now, but maybe later. It's gonna... Hopefully we'll find another bonfire relatively soon. By the way, I've got a bit of stuff going. Oh, hi. Hello. Punch. How are you gonna... gonna explode when you hit batter? Interesting. These are powder barrels. Can we just... Oh, okay. Well, we... Chain reaction. Black fire bomb. Good thing we were soaked. Otherwise, that definitely would have killed us. Okay, go down and... Mm. Okay. These explosive barrel carriers are... A fun gimmick. And you are... Oh, you were taking damage from that, and that's fun. Hi! Punch and kind of a pseudo plunge there. Golden fruit bomb. Bug. Oh well, whatever. Hmm. So more barrel carriers. Let's go in. Go back. Go in the fire. Once you get a little closer, you'll There we go. Do my job for me. Okay. So all we have to do is give them a wide berth, and they'll summarily dispatch themselves. Oh, but that is... Oh, that's... there's another one down below. That's what was going on. Sort of... Would there be something I could only access by jumping down? No, it doesn't seem like it. Quite something. Sniper spot. For whom? That's the question. I need to take a quick bathroom break. Oh well. One of you. Just one at least. That's nice. Hi. One, two, and... Okay, I don't think that... No, it does let me fall down. Good to know. Hi, and just... Just like that. Punch, 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 punch. Oh, and you're throwing. Didn't know they could throw fireballs. Okay. I take this. And just... Oh, you get a fun little uppercut when that happens. Over there, and what's over here? We got, oh, a plus eight Cessius. That's fun. Hmm. So go up. Anything over here? No. There weren't any more spawning in. I thought I heard something, but I guess I must have been wrong. Come on, come on. It's through here. Bonfire head, therefore right. There we have it. Don't you dare. Oh, if we punch that, it'd probably burn us up. Let's see. Or not. Either way, we've got enough to actually go back to Majula real quick. And I need to take a short bathroom break. So after that, I will take my short bathroom break. Fun place. Come on. Come on. This will actually allow me to equip Great Heal if necessary. Here we go. Just a little bit more HP. Okay, cool. I will be right back. Enjoy the Majola music before I burst.
back, it's still alive. Okay. Time to go back to the tower and punch more things. Cool. Okay. In that case. Alright, there we go. There we go. We still got our punches up. It was funny getting all those warp drops from random rats. Okay. Come on, come on. Let's just return back to Broom Tower real quick. There we go. Throne floor, upper floor. So yeah, it does seem like the throne is at the top at the start, and we are just descending into the depths of the earth. Do you want to see what's behind? throne over here, which I would assume was the Urswal throne of the old Iron King. Okay, but yeah. Let me just see what the reach is on the power stance punch. Okay, that does seem to be at least as good, if not better. Dexterity ring. I assume that would just be a dexterity boost. Let's see. Dexterity ring... Increases dexterity, oddly deformed iron ring, increases dexterity, great age of iron. To mold iron freely as if you held sway over the forces of life and creation. Something something. Advanced technology. Just gonna travel back to the upper floor and keep descending through the tower. Hmm. So it's going to be Blue Smelter Demon, Fume Knight, and... Oh, it does not open from this side. The classic. Let's get something from in here. Oh, and we got... Oh, okay. I wonder if we'll be able to open this before they shoot at me. Three Twinkling Titanites. Cool. Let's get out of the way and go back around. I really do wonder what I'd like to actually try upgrading with that. We'll see. Come on, come on. That's just... Oh, and is this going to be Smelter? Or open area ahead? And yeah. Okay, it wasn't any kind of boss battle there, but... Let's keep looking. Any other, any other fog walls I see at the moment? No. Hmm. What's over this way? Try dash and then try door. Oh, so those the smelter hammer guys. If I wanted smelter hammer, I'd get it from them. I assume those are going to be elevators, at least eventually. That is nothing yet. Is there a not a lever here that I can pull? So I got to go back down here and then keep looking. Pretty linear. All right, and you are door ahead. Therefore, try range to battle. Hmm. Okay. Okay. And a big old exploding barrel. And oh, when the barrel barrel carrier dies, it actually makes its barrel disappear. Hmm. All right. Fine work. So are these guys gonna stand back up, or what killed them? Pyromancy required ahead. Oh, probably gonna be flash sweat. Let's just use that then. Hi. Are you actually gonna try tossing things at me or what are you doing? Or you could just right. You could just detonate them from a distance. That's right. So in that case, I'm trying to fall down. Radiant life gem. Come on. Don't need that black powder in a moment. So, hurrah for sniper spot, but what's up the other way? That's the question. Oh, I should. I wonder if I'll be able to have a bonfire, because if I'm going to be fighting Blue Smelter, I should actually equip Magic Barrier and cast that. Let me actually see real quick how much... How much does Great Magic Barrier take to use? It takes... Oh, I could use Great Magic Barrier, too. Ah, uh, Okay. And that also does not open from this side. So there are two doors, at least, that I need to keep in mind to make sure I actually go through them. Come on, come on. 
No jumping, no jumping ahead. Mm -hmm. Go back down, and there's got to be something fire at the bottom. Nothing, nothing else. Nadalia is there, or one of one Nadalia. Hi, over there, and just hi. Oh, 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 oh! Don't like that. Don't like that. Come on, come on. One more, one more. There we go. And who's left? Who is? Lots and stuff at me. Oh, you got a bow. Okay. Out of the way of that, hopefully. Flame Quartz Ring plus three. Saw a random one over there. Hi. Maybe you could actually. Oh, there you go. That dealt a good amount of damage to you. Hello. So that was a good idea. Out of the. Oh, oh. Okay, punch. Oh, you are insane. Oh, that still hit. What? Oh, interesting. Well, that's something interesting. Something strange. Smelter soldier guys. Luckily, they do seem to be pretty. Mm -mm. Pretty, pretty vulnerable to bludgeoning. Oh, well, the extent that they can be said to be vulnerable to anything. Quote unquote. Well, I did get one. There's a lever over there. Fashion idol. And now, of course, there. Buffed. Annoying. You die, die, die. And can I climb up there with the ladder? Can't see anything through those pillars of flame. Okay, cool. Another smelter wedge. Goodbye, Nadalia. That is one heck of an appearance. Wouldn't like myself to. Wouldn't like that to happen to me. In that case. There's no way up that readily presents itself, but they've got all these trapdoors. I wonder if this switch will let down those two. Probably not. All it did was open that door up, yeah. So at least two doors, and also that platform over there. Things that quote-unquote do not open from this side. Another one of those animated armors. It is oddly silent here. Oh, there you are. Are you gonna gank me, or...? Hi! Ooh! Ooh! Oh! Oh! There you are! Get up a little, get up a little. But you can't really be... Poise damage! Oh, and now I'm dead. Okay, that three-hit combo is... Certainly something. Alright. Alright. Do as thou wilt. Go down over this way. I guess putting up flash sweat could be useful. And actually, if I'd taken one fireball, I guess I could try detonating some of the carriers from range. But it doesn't matter all that much. Let's go down here. Hello. Hello. Mm -hmm. Go over, punch you down. Punch you down. Fair, it doesn't really seem like you have any significant attacks. Mm -hmm. But actually, using one of the one of the barrel guys to detonate the big smelter guy, probably a good idea. If I can actually pull it off. Wait, is there one down there already? Don't think there is. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it. Hi, just. Go somewhere else, go somewhere else, go somewhere else. Fall down, fall down. Can I make that happen? Can I make that? Oh, the trapdoor just falls. Oh, okay, cool. Didn't expect that. It's just, ooh, ooh. The good thing is that the trapdoor is open now. Hi. Okay. Very least I can get my bloodstain back, but you are. Okay, cool. Bloodstain and just. Oh, oh. How far are you gonna come over here? Come on. Come on. Another combo. What? Okay, there we go. Just a couple more. Did not think that would work. Okay, well, you're dead. So, what is. Enemy ahead and be wary of the ambush. Talk about this one? Is there another way around? Give me an effigy, a few twinklings, a few large Titanite shards, too. But the 
barrel guy down there. That's who I really want to get. Did that? No, no, that trapdoor did not open on its own. But actually, that trapdoor over there. Where did that put me? Glad no. Hi. Hello. Cool. That's what are you? What did you just use? Oh, you piece of. Oh no, they actually just returned to their world. Did they? Is it because I waved at them? That was polite. Okay. Well, you know, maybe they just thought I looked excessively pathetic and would not be a particularly interesting or good fight. Who knows? Who knows? Okay, well, well. Come on, come on. Just, let's just, out of the way of that, maybe. Come on, just, there we go. So bringing them out to the end of their range, actually. Eliminate at least some of their threat. Nice. Let's life gem it up. Don't really need to go all the way through here, but I feel like it. Hello. Oh, come on. Just... There we go. We got you. We got you. We got you. Hi. Just punch, punch, and... Okay. Come on. Who do not kill me yet. So actually, maybe... Uh, I don't think that would make a difference. Maybe trying to... Get them to walk onto the trapdoor and to open it up for me. Uh, whatever. This is another life gem. Okay. I was wondering if switching too early made me not use it and consume it with the animation played, but even if that had happened last time, it didn't seem like it happened this time. Let's keep on going, and are you going to. Oh! What is. What are you? Hello? Where are we back? So obviously it's going to make some of those guys spawn in. But when? Oh, hi. Hello. Oh, okay. Alright. Come on, punch. Before any of that crap happens. Just- Oh! No, no, not good. Where did you come from? Oh, did they actually go through that trapdoor? I can see that. Let me actually go check. So they actually went all the way. And over there, down in the trapdoor. Yeah, it does seem like it. They actually... No, they didn't. Or at least... Okay, you came down. But... Hmm. So somehow it did go down through the trapdoor. And even if that was too far away for it to chase me, it actually got out of its little cage. Interesting. Well, we ran back, and hopefully this should be... Somewhat easier to deal with now. Hi! Oh, oh, okay. Come on. Punch. Good thing we have a decent amount of S's, because this is quickly turning into a battle of attrition. Oh, you're dead. That's good. And okay, that sorcerer went down there somehow. I don't think. Whatever that weird lightning ball is, it doesn't seem like it's something I could use. Visions of a lava. What does that mean in this context? Try ranged battle. Human effigy. Hi! Just gotta punch you. Punch. Wait, what? Oh, and you just... Huh? Okay. Didn't know you could do that. As soon as we wake up, we punch. Punch. Okay, die. Weird. Sniper spot, but worrying it out required a head. Mm -mm. Message. Thanks. That was helpful. Not. Oh, but the... Wait, can I go over there, or... No, I'd fall down here. What if I tried jumping over there? Let's see. It's just over that way. Come on. Oh, yep, I can make it. Pointless. Yeah. Well, you know, a bit of a trick shot. Robert Pointless. Somebody come, gonna come down and hit me, or... I don't hear any- I hear somebody, but I don't see anyone. There's somebody down here, or... Oh, hi. There we go, punch. Punch, punch. Ooh, okay. So who is... 
So one of them is shooting at me now. I wonder how many of those are going to be. Fog gates are going to be meaningful. Hi, just... Oh, come on, come on. Just SS up, SS up. Actually, going for the strong attack might be a decent way to deal with them. So it does deal more damage than a standard attack, even if the poise damage is good, too. And the startup is bad, if I can manage to bait both of them into attacking and then punish with the strong attack. So the travel distance is nice. It does allow me to approach from slight range. That said, uh, even going for three light attacks, because the fourth light attack in the chain, well, the second, the second half of the second light attack doesn't hit, he is actually faster. Mm -hmm. Okay, come on. Die, die, roll. Out the way of that, and soul the proud knight. There is the other guy. Treasure ahead, and. Ah, soul of a hero. Wow. Enemy ahead. Oh, there you are. Oh, just jumping right out of the ash. Okay. And you are going to... Oh, hi. There we go, and just punch. Oh, okay. Okay, alright. You're right to do that. Just spin, spin, and... Yep, we can poise break you. So actually, maybe using... Strong attacks from a distance might be better to advance a little and then poise break. Hi. Hit, 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 hit. What? Okay. Hmm. All right. Do not disappear. Thank you. Die. I could have used a lot of gym for that. Whatever. Gonna be ahead. And are there gonna be any more? Or. Hmm. Just, they don't seem to be making sounds. So what's here? Ah, soul of a great hero. I feel like a great hero for making it past all those guys. Let's just advance a little bit more. There was another fog gate. I don't know if... I don't think Smelter would be there, but it's not... Not a possibility I can rule out at the moment. Oh, okay. Tower over that way. Try jumping. No. Oh, that's stupid. That over there, I think that's... Huh. I'll have to check. Over this way, nothing. Alright. There might be an invader over here. Maybe. Let's see. Let's not fall off this chain. Bonfire? No. Miscreant Maldron the Assassin. Spirit ahead, therefore try something. Try right. Wait, wait. So where is he? We have curse, therefore control. Miscreant and then be wary of left. Oh, hi. There you are. There's something coming up. Oh, so he's literally just sneaking. Hi. Left and then be wary of ghost. Hello. Hello. Well, actually, that attack worked pretty well. Oh, well, whatever. Huh? An assassin with a lance? That's new. You know... When he's running away? Oh. Oh. I don't like that. Are you coming back, or...? Well... Let's see what's in the chest, at least. Two bonfire ascetics. You know what, maybe I'll just go through that fog gate and see if something happens. Seems like he'll be leaving me alone for now. If I find another bonfire, I can at least light it, even if I can't rest at it. And then I could at least teleport back there after he probably ends up killing me. Funny. Funny. Then... Oh, so yeah, bonfire had that right. There were at least three doors from earlier. At least three. Fire ahead and then right. Head and then right. So wait. There is death. Yeah. Four down is... I feel like I'm gonna have to go down there eventually, but... There's just so much in the tower. This is gonna be a way... Another one locked. So at least three locked doors. 
Feet and short jump attack. No scorching iron scepter in inventory. Hmm, okay. Well, that didn't do it. So where can I... So I can light the bonfire, but I can't rest the bonfire. Can I use bonfire? Okay. Well, if I die, at least it'll have to go away. Magic stone. Hmm. Well, Dron's over there. I've barely got anything in the way of Estus left. Three, maybe four locked doors. Well, you know what? Just go back. Hopefully he'll return and we can try to maybe keep him in one place. The issue is that you can't do a backstab with bare hands. That does slightly makes things harder. Since you can kind of run away with impunity. Come on. Dark spirit fleeing. No, seriously. I have never seen that kind of behavior before from any kind of invader. And of course. Of course. So how am I gonna get over there? Do I have to jump over? Probably. Oh, they're throwing some kind of curse pots? Petrify pots? I don't even know what's going on here anymore. Alright. Come on, come on. What's here? What's here? What's this? Silver Talisman. Yes, yeah, something is... ...causing petrification. That is... ...something. Aw. Oh. Miscreant left. Dark Spirit ahead. Be wary of ghosts. Be wary of Miscreant. Can I get at least some of you to come up the stairs? So there's you. Hello. Oh, hi. It's just, what is down there? Or what is causing the petrification? Hmm, well... Whatever. Can't use Aged Feather right now. Can I at least lure you up here? It's just... It's just so weird. Maybe I could at least use a... Ah. Use one of the wedges right now, but even then, it's just silly. Oh, thanks. Hi. Oh, goodness. Let's just use another life gem. There we go, and a few more should do it. One, two. And you can't be poise broken, it seems. Hi. Punch. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> so they're tossing fire bombs at me. And... Oh, no, they... Oh, they revive as long as the smelter. At least this guy does. Let's just roll down, and... And if we're getting petrified, we can... Maybe stay out of the way. So what is causing the... Why well, I'd be wary of pointless... Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm definitely going to die. So what am I supposed to... Oh, no, it's just curse. It's still obnoxious, but whatever. Hi. And... Oh, I'm not dead. Let's just examine this and use the smelter wedge. Because you can't hit me as long as I've got my spelter wedge equipped. Curse, well, I'm dead, but... I don't care at this point. Okay. But what is actually causing the curse? That's the question. By the way, we did get... <sighs> smelter wedge in. So the key... The contraption, the mechanism in Shulva. I've got so many. There's no reason to ever be below max health. That's just in the foyer. That is a very, very short name. Shorter than I would expect. Either way, we can go back, we can fight the assassin guy again. Okay, cool. Maybe the guy who invaded before and then left some sort of personal policy to only fight people with NPC help. I can see that. Is the drip? Oh, they're back? Hi. You know, actually, I want to... Hi. Wave. Welcome. What's their deal? That person has invaded me twice, and every single time they invade me, they immediately just leave again after waving. So there's Maldron. 
the other real invader. Hi! Punch, punch, what? Okay, come on. I don't need that crap in my life. Just, just gonna S this up before you kill me. And of course he's running. They are. It's interesting. I'm not complaining, but it's a surprise for sure. How are you doing? You having a good time? Okay, so it was, in fact, the Ashen Idol that was causing the curse. Okay. Hmm. Fair. Hope it was fun, at least. Was it a good time? Okay, ooh, ooh. Okay, come on, come on, come on, and die, die, there we go. I that was messy, but alright. Why are there pretty weird if pointless? You have any nice food or something? Plunging attack required ahead, therefore, okay. So down here, got you. Hi. Maldron is over that way then. In that case, I will Oh come on. Come on. Ooh, die, die, die. Oh, we're anything particularly interesting. Gotta get my blood stain back at least. Hi, hi. And we can get our soul fragment. Oh, interesting. And you are coming over here too. Hi, Maldron. Are you not gonna run anymore or. Well, now we have to fight you too. I don't like that. Die. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Come on. That guy actually invaded initially. This is an NPC. Invaded and ran away. To come to a more inconvenient position for me. Let's see if I can worm back topside. At least. Come on, come on. Oh, goodness. That's something. At least it was funny. Come on. What are you doing? Oh, please. Oh, what? Oh, good old lord. Well, the good thing is that I have my blood stain now, which means I can... Well, it's farther up the stairs now, which means I can take my time and... Take my time beating those guys up without having to worry to do a bum rush and aggro a bunch of enemies. Just get my blood stain back. Yeah. Full of bottle caps. Oh, wow. Did it break on contact? It's kind of scary. And swing around. Hi. Two. There we go. Oh. Oh, wow. Amori? Amori? Come on, come on. Okay, there we go. And... Oh, oh! When he was two. Okay, let's keep on going. I don't need to deal with that soldier with the bow. Either way, they are annoying enough to fight that every single time I run into them, they basically take a bit of health off me, and I don't like that. That's good, that's good. What kind of punishment would they, would they get as kids for something like that, then? That's the question. Hi! Okay, so you have a lot of poise using that attack. I don't like that. Do not like that. Is he gonna run away, or...? Let's see. Come on, come on, just punch. Punch. You gonna stab me, or are you gonna run away? So if I... If I initially run away, it seems you run away. But if I actually engage you more directly, it doesn't seem like you do. But you... You're so fast at rolling. Oh, goodness. Okay, just punch, punch, punch. So much I can break you. Do not run away, you coward. Ugh. Disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Ah, uh, whatever. Get that blood stain back and then go down here. Get that guy. Hi! Use your firebomb. Let me come down here and hit you. Oh, goodness. Punch you while you stand over here. Don't like that. Don't like that. Ooh, ooh. There we go. There we go. And that guy's coming over this way. I should at least use a life jet before that happens. Come on, come on. And you have a bow. You have a bow and your flaming greatsword. Get over here. Get over here. Okay. Now imagine being four years old and having killed somebody. That, that would really screw you up as a kid. Maybe. Depending on how annoying the person you killed was. Maybe. Come on, come on. And then the final hit. There we go. 
Oh, you're down. Don't worry, that was a joke. I would I would never endorse murder. Or even manslaughter. Let's go down here and punch. Oh, I missed my plunge. Can we just go and an axe thrust? Okay. Final hit, and so you're gonna drop something or Oh, an Alon Great Bow Great Bow plus five. Let's just roll down and see if I can plunge. Come on. Oh well. He got his all of his health back? Oh you're kidding me. That's annoying. So I think I might be able to get the Iron Scepter at the end of this. Possibly. But how did he heal? Should allow me to interact with some mechanisms. Okay, okay. Sounds like your ants are absolute menaces. Not in a bad way, though. I wouldn't like to get on their bad side. Mm -hmm. Just... Come on, come on, come on. Let's just punch, see what we can punch. Oh, oh, oh! And avoid that thrust. That was nearly death. Oh, wow. So did she try to hide it, or...? How did that happen? What circumstances led to that? Okay, so heal, heal. Ooh. All three of these guys on my tail at once. I do not like that. What an absolute jerk. Hate that guy. Oh, 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 well. We can run. How? Immediately on wake up? Go to hell. Oh, goodness. Okay, if you can't tell, I gave myself the self-imposed challenge to use no weapons and no offensive spells during my time in this tower. Oh, well. Alright. Well, I guess that situation resolved about as well as it could have. Come on, come on, and just... Out of the way of that, out of the way of that. Well, the big thing is that... All the bosses in this area are actually very, very weak to bludgeoning damage, which fists do. So it's actually not horrible, at least for the boss fights. The big thing is that fists have very, very little range. Okay, so let's try to beat this guy up as soon as possible. Just die, die, die. Can we maybe poise break you? Oh, oh, come on, come on. Let's see how well we can get you down. Punch. Come on, come on, come on. Just... There we go. Ooh, ooh. Please, please. Life gem. Yeah. Exactly. It's just... Situation resolved itself about as well as it could have. Firebomb fell down and it actually fell down with it. Hi, hi. Come on, just... Okay. Come on. Well, maybe I could go back and try to get a tiny bit of extra vigor from leveling up using the souls I have right now, but... Uh. Staircase is really, really annoying. There are a lot of enemies over here. Come on. Go for an attack and I'll just hit you. There we go, and you're gonna go for a thrust. That still hit me? One heck of a hitbox. Come on. Oh, because it's one of the DLC areas. It's part of the second DLC. This is actually a tower that was created by the old Iron King. It was one of the bosses from before. One of the bosses I actually fought twice. The big demon guy who I fought with lightning damage. And this is the tower where he produced iron. Using the Scorching Iron Scepter, which we should hopefully get soon. We'll see. Come on, come on, just... Here we go, punch! And now... Can I get Maldron to come up here without getting... The other guy to come up here? Let me see, we got the armor, we got Maldron. What are the aggro ranges for both of you? Okay, so we aggroed Maldron without aggroing the sniper. That's good. Actually, actually though... How much are they staying together? How much can I hit you without... Hi. Okay, and just punch, punch, punch. Okay, well, stand, stand a distance. Punching him isn't horrible. 
I'm just coming in here and they're trying to kill me. I would be more than content with a peaceful resolution of this situation. They're the ones preventing that outcome. Okay, so you are lancing. Oh, come on. What What are you... Oh, good lord. So the sniper's slowly coming up and... Oh, he's running again? Oh, you're kidding me. Just whatever. I know you're kidding, but... I came in here. They decided to attack me before I did anything to them. I'm not... I'm not the problem here. Come on, come on, and just kill you. That was very, very close. I... There were no signs up. There were no signs up. That violates OSHA regulations, at least. I, oh, but you managed to... Huh? Weird. Jump attack still hit me even though I rolled. Hi. Uh, that's a big ol' lance. Come on, just... Punch. And, uh, uh-huh, okay. Hmm, fighting you with... Punches is not, maybe, the best way to go about this. Oh, and of course you can go for your lance charge. Dumb. Dumb. Out of my way, out of my way. Just punch. Punch you. That has a crazy amount of startup poise. Annoying. Annoying. So if I actually get back to the start, you basically regain all of your health. That's annoying. You need to find a way to fight you in the right place. Do you, do you have Estus to use? Can you actually use Estus? Come on, just... Now we can punch you, or not. What happened? I hate this guy so much. What did your cousin do? The scepter should hopefully be at the bottom there, but still. Hi, just out of my way. Punch, punch. Ugh, ugh. So if they're in two hands, she managed to do it. Hi, just out of the- oh, good lord. What?! Kill yourself! Take away her iPad. Take away her iPad. He should do it. I don't care. I don't care if that was mean. He deserves it. Okay. Well, then you could steal it. And steal her iPad. Anything to prevent cringe. Okay, well. In that case, maybe you could hack her iPad. I don't know. But it's just... The Lance guy is just absolutely impossible. Please, die. Okay. And how are you gonna... Okay. They got stuck. Well, sure. I just didn't know how you would respond to that if I said that. You would call me a prude or something. But... In addition to that, it's also just cringe, so... Come on, come on. There we go, there we go. How much can we... Ugh. So annoying. Where does this guy get off? Let's... Get out of the way of that and... What? What? I didn't even know you could do a one-handed charge. Ugh. What are you doing? Obnoxious, obnoxious, obnoxious. Yep. Go down, fall over, and... Hi. And then another, or... Come on, come on. There we go. The big thing is that... The fourth punch in the sequence is in the second punch of the second attack. It knocks the guy back enough that they don't get hit by the final hit in the sequence, which is... Really annoying. Hi. Out of my way. Come on. Come on. Just... Out of the way of that. Out of the way of that. Oh, okay. Come on. Yeah, it... It lacks... It's tasteless. That's the big thing. It's not really... I mean, it is inappropriate, but... That's why kids shouldn't watch it, but... Adults shouldn't watch it either because it's utterly tasteless. It's just... Excessive swearing for the sake of comedy is very, very 
early 2010s. It's very passe. It hasn't been funny to anyone, really, for a very, very long time. So, Maldron, Maldron, and the Sniper. I guess maybe I could try to go away from Maldron and kill the Sniper. This didn't heal. Hi! Come on, just... Can I push you down? I wondered if... If I could knock you down, that would be nice. Hi! Hi. Ugh. Ugh. Well, it's... Part, partly that, but a lot of it is just... If you use them too much, they become cheap. The effect totally goes away. It's... It just becomes a totally pointless word. The effect is dulled, and you just annoy people. It's just... It's just not all that funny. Oh, right. I keep forgetting that's a musical. So are we gonna heal up, or... How are you gonna... So you get over there, are you gonna heal, or... What are you gonna do? Can you heal? Can you heal? Oh, but I... Oh, dumb, dumb, dumb. Let's get behind a corner. Actually, this could be a decent place to fight. Stay away from some of that crap. Die, 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 die. Die. Oh, please. Oh, oh, out of the way of that, out of the way of that. Heal, heal. Come on, come on. So much of your crap, just... Ugh. Go and die. Oh, but now you're... Stupid. Go to hell! Uh, this is at least as bad as... Remember at the very, very start? The very, very start? When I... Okay, I'm not that mean. I'm not that mean. But at the very start, where I spent a mistaken amount of time in Forest of Fallen Giants because I didn't know the right way to go... And there was this invader, Armor Dennis, who was probably way too strong for me at this point and just absolutely brutalized me. This guy is worse than that. Because this guy has strategy. This guy knows what he's doing. Well, I... I'm mean enough as is. I'm telling random NPC invaders to off themselves. I don't think I need to make things worse by telling them to watch Has Been Hotel. Okay. That just reminds me of... I'm sure you heard of the... The Verbal Ace Charlie video commission thing. Peter, remember the time you got killed in Boom Tower? This is worse than the time I played Crown of the Iron King DLC. As you see, I'm trying to fight Maldron the Assassin. I'm suffering. I am also... I gave myself the self-imposed challenge to only use fists. It is... It's going. Uh, come on, come on. Die, die, die. Uh, 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 uh. How are you doing? How are you doing? Yeah, I gotta figure out a good time to come up and visit, but it should definitely be a thing I can do this week. If nothing else, I could drive up in the afternoon when people no longer need the car. And then, after I show up, I could also borrow the PS4 for Bloodborne. The time will come... The time will come soon. Ooh, 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 ooh. Bank account. And there's no money. And it's gone. And it's gone. So nobody down there. Drop down and maybe try to get the jump attack on you. Or not, or not. Punch, punch, punch. The big thing, as you can see, is just... Uh, the range is really, really bad for engaging these soldiers. Oh, for sure. Let's, let's see. Come on. It's that other sniper guy, and that's the thing. That's the real thing. Maldron's over here. Sniper guy's coming too. Thank you for throwing your acid pot. Definitely, definitely. Come on. Just punch. But I couldn't get you when you were down. That's the thing. That's what's surprising to me. Mm -hmm. Out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. And just punch. Out of the way of that. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, don't kill me, don't kill me. Well, it's because it's fun and because it's funny. And also because a lot of the bosses in this area are bludgeoning weak. So it's not just a challenge. It's a challenge that also isn't that horrible for the boss fight specifically. 
And given how annoying the boss fights are, I am fine with that. Come on, come on. Heal. We are tanking a lot of this. Okay, punch. There we go, and... Oh, please. Let me get that bloodstain back at least, and just... Yeah, mm, fighting... The assassin with fists, though. Oh, that is very annoying. He's got a lot of poise issues. And a lot of poise to go through. Hi! Oh, come on. Just... What? What? Okay. Come on. I might have to break my rule here. Uh, other way, almost all my stats are at exactly 28 now, actually. So that's fun. Come on, come on, and just... Oh, oh, no! You can't go for your land structure like that. Get out of my life. It's gonna be painful. It's actually just... Ah, oh, come on. And, oh, the tracking on that. My attacks have basically no tracking, but he aims like an, an absolute shooter. There we go. What? What? You're kidding me. Serious? Let's run. Let's run. Just... Uh, can't use the H feather. Can't use much of anything. Hi. Just punch, punch, punch. Out of the way of that. Out of the way of you. Is there a good way to bait your lance charge? Well, if you go down and you ask to stuff, I'll just punch you. Just punch you when you try to heal. Come on. I do find it funny that he seems to be basically the only invader who can use Estus. At least that I've experienced. Maybe I just got lucky and all the pl all the players who invaded me thought it was dishonorable. But I don't know. Come on, just die. And yes, yeah, you see? I was locked on, but it didn't actually aim for him at all. It's nonsense. Life gem up. Starting to run out. Well, you know, it's just, what else am I going to use these things for? Other than, you know, fighting. Come on, come on. This is just so obnoxious. Come on, punch. Roll out of the way. Okay, luckily well, that actually didn't hit. Probably do the stairs. Come on, just punch. Out of, out of my way, out of my way. We are almost, we've almost got you down. Almost. I'm running through so many life gems. You know, I am just bad, that is true, but also, I am fighting in an objectively silly manner, and... Okay, at least that didn't hit me. So that didn't hit me. How far down are you gonna go? You are not going any farther. Cannot let you do that. Punch, 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 and... Goodbye, get out of here! I never want to see you again. Okay. And we got another guy down here. I think Scorching Iron Scepter should be at the bottom. We'll see. Hi! Out of the way of that, and punch. You took a bit of fall damage before. Is anyone else going to show up over here? But by the way, I think that Scorching Iron Scepter should be what I get from this chest. It's going to be some kind of ambush. Stabbing in the back required ahead. Oh, nice! Okay, cool. Hi. Okay, and... Where are you going to go? Where are you going to go? Oh, baby. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, good lord. I'm going to have to run. Might actually have to start going to those other life gems. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Stupid, stupid. Old Radiant, Old Radiant. Hi. Just out of the, out of the way of that, out of the way. One, two, one, two, and just... Oh, oh, baby. Oh, baby. You are insane. You are insane. Ah. How many of these soldiers can even just get on me? Dumb. Oh, we are barely not dead, barely not dead. A lot of Estus. All I got is this. All I got is this crap. Come on, just out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I am, I am. But maybe you could argue that making difficult decisions for no good reason is its own kind of bad. Okay, there should be one left at most, and then it's... Get the scepter. Is that all of them? I hope. Maybe one just went back in the ground. Okay, it doesn't seem like it. No stone, and... Let's look in here. That is true. That is true. As long as you're deriving entertainment from this, it's all good. Oh, actually, that was just the Majestic Greatsword. Okay, it's all worth it now. Can I use it right now? This is just the Artorias Sword from Dark Souls 1, by the way. So it should be over here, I think. Let me find it. Oh, there it is. It was just so discolored. Gordon, wandering out of Frost, at lost upon his death. Every last one of the prominent swordsmen who inherited this weapon was left-handed. 
Let's see. Let's try this out. And so in one hand, that's for a standard chain, but the strong attack is a spin. If you wield it in the right hand, it doesn't have any special moves in. There we go, and it's pretty standard too, but when you do a strong attack with it like that, you actually... Wait, what? Oh, it's only when you power stance that it does the flip, and that's right. Forgot about that. Let me see those Rex real quick. That's... Oh, but I don't have the power stance Rex for it. Hmm. It's good AR, though. Oh, what did you get? So I guess we'll just... Go back with the aged feather. Okay. So I can go back to Majul and level up my vigor a little. Uh, alright, alright. Come on, come on, travel back to Majul real quick. Level up vigor once. Mesmer and Phase Marvelous Chester. I would respect it. Maybe, given that Bloodborne has actually been out for a while, they would a they could actually give Chester a gun this time. I can't believe we hit level 200 playing normally. Dark Souls 2 level curve really hits different. Gonna go back to the foyer. Close. Oh, interesting. Is there any special occasion that you want it for, or is it just to have? Also, what's interesting is... Uh, I would ideally like to use Bewitched Alon Sword, which is a weapon you can make from the soul of the final boss of this DLC for the final boss, Aldia. But it's going to be a question of whether I'll actually ever get the 30 decks I need to wield it. Exactly, you know. Get something on the cheap or get it on the free. Is there? Try attacking. Somehow I don't get the impression that would be a particularly good idea. Oh! Oh! That that was actually a really good idea. Okay, well. Oh, and that'll burn you, but... Come on, come on. Come on. And then, let's stay out of the way of that. Oh, okay, okay. Makes sense. Out of the way of that, and then... And we punch you down. Punch, punch, there we go. Stop breathing fire for a second, and it's over here. Woman left. Another assassin or an ashen idol. Quite something ahead there for a lesser foe required ahead. Oh, these gate. Oh, there you are. I just didn't see you before. Hi, hi. Oh, but another one showed up. Dumb. Annoying, annoying, annoying. Oh, fair. So that's how they got chosen. Funny. Hit and. So that's still hitting me, but I can at least let some of it burn. Burn them up a little. Hi. And are you going to get hit, or none of you are getting hit? That is an annoying position to place it in. Hmm. Well, in that case, am I going to deal with you? Hi. Hello. Other way of that end. Roll, punch, 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 punch. Ooh! No, 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 no. No! Okay. Come on. I wanted to. The issue is, is that they're... They aren't actually in the right position for me to do that. I wonder what's up with these assassins. Come on, don't backstab me. Don't backstab me. Come on, just... I tried way too hard to brute force that. Okay, so I go over. Go out of the way of that. Go through that fire. Roll, punch, punch. Uppercut. Come on, die. That worked well enough. So all of these are... something gonna happen if I specifically open up all of these corridors? Oh, smelter guy! Smelter guy! Fun! Are you mean to fire? No, you're not. No, you're not. Come on, come on. Oh, well, alright. Alright. That didn't kill me, at least, but still. Hi. Or Estes and... Out of the way, out of the way. You are crazy. So, the weapon that they sometimes drop is the single highest strength requirement, requirement weapon in the game. Thank you. 
I'm glad you enjoyed seeing me experience physical harm. So actually, I could maybe try to let the fire do the job, but I need to really position myself right. Hi, hi. Get over here, get over here. I'm wondering if his attacks, well, its attacks would actually damage the... make the bullhead move. Hi, just keep burning, keep burning. There we go, job done for us. Job actually not done for us. Dumb. Come on. Just... Smelter Hammer would be fun to use, but I will never have the requirements for it in this playthrough. Wait, what? See? See? We actually got the hammer. We can't use this thing. You know, just check this out. It has 70 strength requirement. Even though Dark Souls 2 lets you wield a weapon with one half of the strength instead of just two thirds, I still can't wield this thing. It's still doing crazy damage even with uh, not many requirements. Check this crap out. Also, given that power stance requires you to meet 50% extra of the one-handed requirements, in theory you shouldn't even be able to power stance this weapon at all, but the devs carved out, carved out a special exception that you can power stance it at 99 strength at maximum when normally. Is it? I don't know. Well, either way, we can put these down, which would mean being able to maybe get across more easily, but it's not really an issue right now. Oh, I could have used these to cheese smelter, actually. One of the smelter guys. Because I would have been able to... Oh, but I don't have the power stance up. That is annoying to forget. Could have just had them... Had him hit one of the explosive barrels with his hammer and it would have made things work out. Hi, hi. You don't have any actual attacks. Did I die? Oh, you do have one attack. Silly. Come on, come on. So we gotta go back and open up all those gates. Didn't do it initially because I thought it might let something out and in, but we're alright. We're alright. Come on, come on. Come on. Okay. Yeah, exactly. He said, I can humiliate a streamer. Why would I ever pass up that opportunity? Let's just... Keep on going. Something ahead, unless you're full, whatever. Come on, come on. Oh, and one of them dropped something. I didn't see that. Oh, they're fume sorcerers. Fume sorcerer gloves. Let me check out the description of that, see if we get some deep lore or something. Okay, fume sorcerer gloves and fume sorcerers. Spatch this land, tap the repeat stores of iron. Also, they're never faced with the child of dark, Nadalia. All but the most steadfast of them became servants of the Black Fog. Hmm. There was some sort of brainwashing effect with the dark then. I don't even remember if Ratport is in this game, but if it was, it might make sense for it to be a hex instead of a pyromancy. I don't hate myself that much. I actually haven't used any spice at all. It's kind of cheap, in my opinion. Or actually, the big thing is just that I think I'll stay with this file for maybe some of my own playthroughs later on, and if so, pointless. I know the wiki says that using spice it doesn't actually permanently decrease the damage of a weapon as long as you actually meet the original requirement, but I don't want to chance it at all. I am not going to make my soul spears weak. Dried root, and oh, there we go. Actual shortcut. Where is this gonna send me? I think I've been here. I have been here before. Oh, this is just the other way back to the bonfire. <clears throat> I do want to do Lies of P eventually. The big thing is that I want to start my Elder Ring playthrough on stream right when the DLC comes out. So it'll be nice, fresh, and people will want to see it, and I will want to play it. And that way I can avoid as many DLC spoilers as possible while still benefiting from whatever balance changes they make in that one big patch. Because the big thing is just... Okay, okay. So, we know six of the damage types. If you have Liza P, I would be willing to try it out for a little bit. It does look really cool. But the big thing is that... 
I wonder if they would ever add this tower over here. Is this going to be blue smelter? Let's see. Visions of rolling. Okay, this is almost certainly going to be blue smelter. Oh, wow. That quick. Interesting. Just doing a bunch of skips. Let's see what happens in here. In this place again. This has got to be smelter. Oh, I should have equipped magic. Oh, this is not smelter. Not yet. Interesting. So something's up there. Actually, in that case, I might want to go back. Because there were a few more things in... A few more things in the tower that I kind of missed earlier. Well, among other things, there were three or four doors, as well as that iron scepter thing. It's actually... We could... Let's get rid of warmth. Equip... Let's put on Great Magic Barrier two times. This is gonna be good for Smelter either way, and then... Normal heal and a Great Heal. Okay, well actually, very little has actually used fire damage so far. Fume Sorcerers were using Lightning. Okay, let's see. So, Kythus Shine can't be used for Miracles. So I'll just keep that on and actually take the shield out. There were three locked doors, a trapdoor that maybe led to something. A fourth that might have gone somewhere. Critical hits. Don't have a key. Okay, but big thing is I'm a, I'm sure that you've heard of Mr. Coffee. You heard of the six out of the eight new weapon categories we're getting in Elden Ring. Okay, I should equip that for Smelter. Because we know we have big katanas, a new kind of greatsword, dueling shields. Martial arts, throwing weapons, and reverse grip swords. But what I'm wondering is whether they might add some of those to the base game somewhere. Uh, maybe if you don't have the DLC, but certainly if you do. Because, for example, in the trailer we saw both throwing knives and explosive throwing barrels as types of throwing weapons. The big thing is that the Crystallians have three types of weapons we can get two. We can get the staves, and we can get their spear. We can't get their chakrams, but there aren't chakrams in the game yet. I would assume that the chakram will probably be added somehow, but I wonder if it would be added to the DLC area and maybe made a draw from a Crystallian boss that you might act actually automatically have added to your inventory if you fought the requisite Crystallians, or maybe just a drop added to the world. But, if they want to make a meaningful amount of the new weapon categories, I'm not sure they could fit every single one just in the DLC area. That's the thing. And this over here is... What are you? What are you? And this is... What's that? You are crawling. What are you doing, even? Okay, well, I'll get out of the way of that, and... Weird. Oh, well, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Let me actually see what it's like to two-hand this. Come on. So, oh, oh, okay. So two-handing it, well, it didn't really hit, among other things, so. Power stance again, get behind these guys, hopefully. Come on. You are rotating quickly. Come on, come on, just die already. Die already. One, two, one, two. Come on. Oh, well, that rotation was fast. Come on, come on. Out of the way, out of the way. Spawn chain. Oh, you got a explosion? Oh. Okay. Those oil earrings are interesting. Okay. So, oh, maybe if I was actually using pyromancies, I could just set them on fire from a distance and let them blow themselves up. I do wonder if anything special will happen when those oil earrings burn. Probably not really, but we'll see. Come on, come on, out of the way of that, and please hit. Oh, there we go, there we go. Explode, explode, explode. You get over here, maybe. Hi. Creeper, oh man. Okay, well, that worked well enough. Hi. Explode, explode. Or don't do that. What would happen if I actually managed to get all these lit up? There we go, and... Alright. Okay. So we got a few more petrified dragon bones, which actually means we've got 
20 now. So we could upgrade multiple boss weapons decently if we actually felt like it. Mm -hmm. Big thing that comes to mind is chest ahead. Doesn't really seem like it. Ah, York Spear is good. Big fan, big fan of Vietnamese Buddhism, I see. But as I was saying, ah, York Spear is good. Big thing is that Quicksword Rachel, is she coming up top or? Can I maybe get her to stand in the fire? That would be funny. Another invader. So annoying. So where are you going? Where are you going? Are you going to come up the ladder? Or where are you going to try to find me? Do I see you? Do I see you? I don't see you. Mm -mm. But down here is... Could I roll down inside there? That's the question. Probably. Maybe. Who is... There you are. Okay. Will you come up the stairs? I think you will. Hi. It's actually... I just keep kicking you down. Oh, it doesn't seem like it will actually go up the stairs. Smart. Come on, come on. Ugh, oh, this is annoying. At least I could maybe wait for your weapon buff to expire. Oh, that'll take forever, though. Come on, come on. Let's just deal with you this way. Hi, just punch, punch, and just... You're not too bad. Got a lot of defenses, but that isn't horrible. Hi, hi. Punch, punch. Don't have a lot of poise, that's the big thing. Heal out before you come in and hit me. Nice and tanky. Nice and tanky. Oh, actually, let's just punch you down before you... Oh, poison, poison. Not fun. Mm -mm. Okay, rotten grease. Hi, punch, punch. At least I can reasonably stun lock you. Not like the assassin from before. Ugh. This is a lot more difficult than Sunken Kin was, by far. Also, I didn't know, but the reason that my sword broke against Sin was that melee hits against Sin actually corrode your weapons. Because he has an acidic body. I really do wonder, if I lit all these sconces, what would happen? Something special happen. Hi! Hello. You can just... Stay out of the way, you, maybe. One more Estus. Can't be too foolhardy, but whatever. Yeah, yeah. It does. It definitely has a lot of flavor to it. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Not that much. Mm -hmm. Actually, enemy ahead, but pointless ahead. So what weapon would be decent as a way to light those sconces? Let's just use Black Knight Greatsword for now. It's a fun weapon. Hi. There we go. Oiled up. Nice. Very least I can actually. I do like that, as opposed to other places requiring torches, you can actually can use anything that deals fire damage to light stuff up here. Just fit Iron King. So let's just unequip my greatsword again and go through here. Enemy ahead, but pointless ahead, and who are you? Oh, but. I could have used these to actually light these up on fire by getting them in. Or I can just light you up and then you'll explode now. Hi. Hello. Hello. Mm -hmm. So, do they actually give souls when they detonate? Let's see. Okay, they do. Worthwhile enough. Point was ahead, try right. I don't care. There are dudes in here, I'm blowing them up. So do I see anybody? You're in there. Hi. Oh well. Follow me, follow me. I'm gonna set you on fire. Okay. Keep crawling, keep crawling. You're actually coming out this way, or we're slow. Well, whatever. You can at least make it out of a door. The other guy did. Come on, come on. Okay. Please, 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 please. Sit in the fire. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Gonna explode her. There you are. We got close enough to blow you up. And one more, one more. Creeper. Oh man. 
Uh, get closer. Are you, you're not stuck in the door, are you? Are you? Don't tell me. Come on, come on. Oh, well. Maybe you... It seems like you might have actually had to jump out to actually leave the door. Well, whatever. You're gonna explode now. Not my problem anymore. I just jumped... Oh, what? Okay. That was unexpected. Cool. What What is the relevance of the Blastoise emote to this situation? I don't follow. I do like Blastoise, though. Blastoise is always welcome. Good thing is that Rachel will not come back to accost us. I don't have to worry about that now. <sighs> okay, okay. We are going to go back. I appreciate that. That's legit. You are the fan of green. Or blue, depending on the localization. Pokemon special fan. Okay, right, we got a power stance again. Oh, and they actually stay lit. That's nice. Come on, come on. I do wonder what kind of relevance Blastoise might end up having in the ZNA, Z to A, given that it was one of the Megas in Kalos, one of the biggest Megas. Okay, okay. Come on, come on. In America, in America, given that in every Western localization of Red and Blue, I mean of Red and Green, they made it Red and Blue, they changed the names around, so he would be he would be blue and she would be green. There we go. Well, the only thing that said that was the American Twitter account, which well, the European Twitter account, which you can only take that so much as a sign. Well, I don't know. They did it for marketing reasons, which are not exactly my purview, but I wouldn't call them dumb, either. What do I get? I want you to explode. I want you to explode. There we go. Okay, explode. Explode. Keep dodging. Keep dodging. Come on. I'm just out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. Come on. Come on. Now you're burning. Now you're burning, too. Hi. Oh, what? Okay. Now, now. Are you gonna, you gonna explode? Are you gonna explode? Explode. Oh, please. Explode. Stand up. Explode. There you go. There you go. Come on. Come on. Just gonna do one more. One more. Thank you. Hi. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, they did. But I was good enough at running away, so it all worked out in the end. Let's go down. Get the other ones to blow themselves up, too. Okay. I'm definitely gonna have to roll into there, almost certainly. To roll down from the top level to make that ladder work. Oh, 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 the doors, the doors reclose themselves. That's actually really nice. Otherwise, that would be very, very dead. Hi, hello. Oh, oh. Get out of here. Get out of here. Go through the fire. Go through the fire. How well are you gonna pathfind? Come on, come on, come on. There you go. There you go. Okay, cool. Come on, explode and just. Oh, that didn't do it. Whatever. Come on, come on. Just out of the way, out of the way. Stand up, explode, stand up, explode. There we go. Oh, that that hit me. Okay. Well, we have a good amount of Estus. Oh, well, hello. Explode. Thank you. Then we got this guy over here. And this is... Oh, I already went through here. So how many are there left? This is... Oh, this is actually... It's a loop. There's nothing new. Hmm. This one is... Here. Well, I don't care. We are going to open up another door. Yeah, exactly. Changing doors gives you more of a chance of buying... Of winning a new car. Behind. Twinkling tight night and... I hear something. Recollection. What is that? Come on. I think that's a hex? Let me see. Let me check that out. Inventory. Spells. Let's see. Yep, recollection. Oh, 35 and 30. Can't use that. 
a collection of the creator of those spells. It's kind of like affinity slash affinity slash pursuers. The question is, the question is, is it the same as that spell that those sanctuary priestesses were using? Because what's interesting is that the sanctuary priestesses are pretty explicitly connected to the Amana priestesses and tribe of Amana. Is why they look somewhat similar in terms of headdress. I think they might have actually changed it or specified more. The Scholar of the First Sin changed a number of item descriptions, but uh, the Lord of the Dragon Charm explains that the Windelt sect of clerics descended from the people of Shulva. Let's see, how far up are we going to go here? Send me up to the next level, or... Oh, hi. Oh, well. That did enough of the job. Explode, explode. Hi. Just stand up, explode. There we go. Maybe if I killed them normally, they'd drop gunpowder. By the way, go back up. But if I was just willing to actually use a fire weapon, it'd be a lot easier to set them alight, but... No, no, that's not how we're doing this. Let's just see if we can precisely roll down and... There we go, there we go. This might lead to that treasure chest, we'll see. Hi! Hello! Come down here. Can you actually get down, or are you gonna fall? Let's see. Come on, come on. Let's see. Punch, punch, ooh, ooh. Because it doesn't seem like you can really hit me from here. Oh, please. So I'm probably gonna have to jump to get over the gap, but... Uh, uh. Yeah. But if you're still here, Coffee, I've decided that when I play Bloodborne, I'm going to do what I normally do. Well, of course I'm already going to be running equal stats, but I think by the end I'd like to have all four of Tonitris, Chikage, probably Boomhammer, actually, and then Holy Moonlight Sword leveled. So I have a weapon to target each element, ideally. Well, for Pointless... This is... All of that for a dried root. You have got to be kidding me. No illusory walls. Yeah, because... With Bloodborne in particular, an equal stats build isn't as crazy. Because it has 75% of the stats of every other Souls game. Other than DS2, in which case it has 66% of the same stats. But... So... Ladder in here... Ladder in, yep, ladder in here. Yeah, because a lot of enemies, especially, you know, all beasts are pretty weak to fire. So being able to target the elemental weaknesses will be nice. The big thing is that, if I recall correctly, Orphan is very weak to blood tinge damage, or at least very weak to bleed. And that would allow me to use Chihage to make that fight a lot more doable. Particularly, if I recall correctly, it takes... And then dash. Yeah, and these are basically s standard sewer pipes. It actually is very, very technological. But it takes double damage from bleed, if I recall correctly. Oh, hi. Hello. Key ahead and then... Oh, this is where the scepter is. Interesting. Okay. Hi. Come on, punch. And you're going to start exploding. That's all right. I'm okay with this. Good enough for me. Hi! And just... Stand up, explode, explode. Hi. Explode. Explode. Decent enough damage. Let's actually... We could just punch you down, right? Yeah, we could. Okay, die. Oh, what? Oh, no. We could actually very, very narrowly... We lived on one H... Basically one H... Oh, come on. Oh! You have got to be kidding me. That was the dumbest way that could have gone. Okay. Yeah, Chigage is really, really cool. What's really funny is that one of the primary mods in the mod pack I'm playing right now with Larry, Dawncraft, is a Bloodborne weapon and mob mod, which has very, very inflated health pools. But in exchange, the weapons can be upgraded to really, really crazy damage. Just at base. Yeah. This... 
it's hard. And if this is any sign, the third DLC is going to be even more of a struggle. Yeah, Frozen Outskirts is going to be the death of me, maybe. We'll see. Come on, just stand over here while you burn up. But the big thing is going to be... Uh, well, the big thing with the mod pack is that... Oh, come on. Actually explode, why don't you? Thank you. What? What? Okay. Come on, come on. Stand up. Blow up. There you go. Yeah. Big thing with the mod pack is that the way it uses... has a stamina system connected to... The mod it uses Epic Fight mod, which makes the combat a lot like Souls. But the stamina system is basically hybridized between that and a mod that adds a Zelda stamina system from Breath of the Wild. Kind of Skyward Sword, but really just Breath of the Wild. And it is really, really annoying because the way the Zelda mod stamina system works is that it's based on the weapon type you're using with a scaling factor based on the base damage of the weapon. Enchanting won't make it cost any more stamina, but upgrading it using the Bloodborne mod will, which means that the Bloodborne weapons quickly become completely unusable. And the reason why is that upgrading them increases their base damage, which means that they start costing insane amounts of stamina just for a single swipe. Just can't use them at all. Because Chica is in there, and it even has its self-damage buff mechanic, but because... because it increases its base damage, including in the blood mode, just can't do anything with it. It costs multiple wheels of stamina for a single attack, a single basic swipe, when you actually have it leveled up. Which is very, very obnoxious. So as it turns out, the best source of DPS in Dawncraft is actually just putting lots of lots and lots of sharpness on knuckles, actually, which are kind of a silly throwaway weapon that Epic Fight Mod Epic Fight Mod adds, which you aren't really supposed to be using, quote unquote. But it has really, really low stamina cost and is really, really fast. Therefore, if you put an enchantment on it, it's given that the way that enchantments work in Bedrock and Java is very different. Because in Java, which is of course what we're playing, enchantments like Sharpness are just a flat increase to damage. In Bedrock, they're a percentile increase to damage with a bit of a flat factor. But what that means is that in Java, you want the absolute fastest weapon, is, weapon possible, because that'll make your Sharpness go much, much farther. There's really no advantage at all to using a bigger, stronger weapon. Because it means that the enchantments you put on it will be of very, very little utility. But, since you're dealing so many hits, you really have to make sure that you have durability measures in place, like mending or unbreaking, so that the fists just don't break after you've beaten up one enemy. The good thing is that, beyond enchanting, the mod pack does have more upgrade systems. In particular, you can add these rarity items that you get from scrapping, these special named weapons and tools that you get from dungeon chests. And when you do that, you can actually give them various sorts of pseudo enchantments. But the big thing with that is that you can... There you are, thank you. That they can actually resist durability damage in a way separate from unbreaking. Or mending, which means they last much, much longer than they otherwise would. Yeah. But either way, I'm glad that I'll actually be able to use Chikage in actual Bloodborne, given that I wanted to use it in the mod pack. One of the bosses in the Bloodborne mod in the Minecraft mod pack is actually Father Gascoigne. The interesting thing about Father Gascoigne in the mod pack is that his whole mechanic is that after a certain health threshold, he'll turn into his beast form from his hunter form. But you can actually just, if you're fast enough or deal enough big hits, you can kill him before he even transforms, which... I think you could probably maybe kind of do in Bloodborne proper. But it's actually pretty easy to do in 
the mod pack, if you do something like, say, heavily enchanting a set of fists, which is, of course, what I plan on doing. Come on, come on. Stay out of the way, stand up, explode. Oh, come on. Thank you, thank you, goodbye. Oh, I could actually, you know what? I should just... If I'm not hitting anything proper, I should just put Flame Quartz Ring on. There we go. That way their explosions won't deal as much, and actually I could just... I should just use Flashlight. I am an idiot. There we go. Well, it's easy to remember doing that for boss fights. Like Ancient Dragon or Sin, but this is... I don't know. I don't really have an excuse. Hi there, hi there. Come on, come on, and just... Two of you are gonna explode, and it's gonna catch some of you on fire. No, all of you are on fire. Come on, start exploding. Start exploding. Hi. Okay, okay. Come on, come on. Another one, another one. Hello. There you go. Easy enough. And three more, three more. Hi. Just stay out of the way, stay out of the way. And... I think one actually died of the explosions proper without blowing itself up. No, nah, I don't think so. Well, whatever, we can get the scepter now. There we go. Interestingly enough, we... It's kind of like the petrified egg in that picking up the item actually... See, I'm sweating. Has a bit of an effect in world. But the interesting thing is... That it doesn't really immediately disappear. That it has another animation that plays... After you actually already have it in your inventory, Refined Supreme Tower. Traps and transferring heat. Kingdom of Ven. All the resources the Enfeeble Lord can muster. Iron producing miracle. It was reborn as a powerful leader. Oh, there we go. We can escape this place. Oh, and that'll maybe let me get back up top? But wait, can I? Oh, I actually have to jump over that. That's interesting. Actually, let me check something real quick. Is there anything else in this room? No, it doesn't seem like it. Hi. A few more of you. Hello. Punch. Oh, okay. Come on, come on. Punch. And there you go. Just explode already. Thank you, thank you. Just put on another flashlight just to be sure. There we go, there we go. I thought maybe I would be able to actually do both the, both the remaining DLCs today. That is definitely not happening. That is definitely not happening. I can almost certainly beat Iron King. Since we're done with Broom Tower, there won't be all of that much left, but still. I really did like how in the first DLC, how we sort of interweaved in between Shulva itself and the Sanctum. It was definitely interesting. Come on, come on. Just, are you gonna explode? Or are you gonna, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Oh, we're actually going up. Dumb. Oh, this might suck. This might suck. We need to punch you down before you explode. Well, that worked well enough. Because you weren't getting off the tower. Mm -mm. Okay, cool. I mean, off the elevator. So that's just... That's just back. Okay, cool. And anything here? No, no, no. We're off for circling around. So now we go back. We could actually just... Eh, it's close enough. Let's just... No, I don't care. Let's not waste any time. Time for the feather. Also, I can use these souls to get another quick level up. Also, I drank too much water and now I need to take a quick bathroom break, so... After I consume a good amount of these souls in Majula, I will take a quick bathroom break. Oh, also quick. A lot of people were saying, and I do kind of agree, that... The leaker who said that Arlequino's constellation was a Black Widow was probably mistaken. And they just mistook the hand holding a match from the group of Fitui constellations for... A spider. I don't know, but we'll see. Okay, cool. Before I explode. Be right back.
Thank you, I have returned. Okay. Put myself back on. There we go. Time to go back to the Toar. Okay, okay, okay. There we go, there we go. Let's go back to Uberum Tower. And a few more over there. A few more bonfires. So we can actually use the Scorching Iron Scepter now. I do find it funny that one of those connected towers, it was just a bunch of fighting. And all you get at the end was the funny Artorius sword. I mean, in the end, it's, it's Artorius, what do you expect, but still. Scorching Iron Scepter, there we go. Hello. Hello. What's happening now? That gonna start the boil or something? I got a steam engine. So where can I go now that I couldn't before? That's the big question. Okay, so we got more. More platforms and more towers. These statues over here. Oh, maybe. Oh, I think. Yep, they're actually raising and lowering themselves now. There's a lot I can do now. Ah, okay. That's cool. Let's just take some of these elevators then. See where I can go and what I can do. This is death, but I don't think that fire is going to hit me immediately. Oh, there was something down there. What is over here? Probably somewhere I've been before. By the way, there were a lot of... Yeah, I've been here before. That cage down there, I'm not entirely sure about. This is cool. This is cool. Another elevator over there in that way. Definitely gonna have to jump down on top of that from a side platform. Oh, but that is... I'm gonna have to jump up midway through. This is interesting. This is very mechanically interesting. Hi, jump. And we've gotten there. This is gonna allow me to... Oh, a crystal wizard. Hi. Hello there. Well, okay. That was anticlimactic. Alright. So I'm gonna have to find a better way to chase it, maybe. The two bright bugs. Well, now we know where we're going, so let's try that again. See if I can chase down the crystal lizard a little better. I might actually... Yeah, I'm just gonna... It's not a real enemy. I'll just hit it with the quick black sword. Just gonna smack it, guillotine it like with an axe. Because the dark, the crypt black sword actually specifically does have an axe move set, great axe move set. Oh well. Just gonna go down there. We're gonna make the jump. I don't think. I'll actually unequip that and make the jump maybe, hopefully a little easier. We'll see. Hi, jump. And oh well, that didn't work. Come on, come on. In that case, I just need to go down and then immediately go the other... No, not immediately. Mm -hmm. This might be a little painful. By the way... Hopefully get something good from Crystal Wizard over there. Hello, hello. Oh, what? Oh, come on. So I do have to jump for that. So annoying. Mm -hmm. I don't think anything else will really be... Other than those elevators, I don't think any doors would have really opened on their own. Hmm. Okay. Okay. How far away do I have to get? Hey, over here. There we go. And where did the blood stain go? That's the important question. Oh, it's up here because, of course, moving platforms don't count as platforms for the sake of stuff like this. And, okay, close enough for no fall damage. That was nice. Mm. Alright. Alright. Jump, jump. Oh, no. Yeah, this, this is gonna suck. Being my way back to that crystal wizard is going to suck. Mm. Again, one of the things that Dark Souls 2 did... Who knows whether it's good or bad to say, again, but 
fall damage is flat based on distance instead of percent of HP. Which means that raising your HP really does increase your ability to survive falls, which it does not in other Souls games. Okay, I thought maybe we wouldn't be able to go up, but now we reached it. My life is... something. Yeah, yeah. But it's different. It's different and it's new. How in that case am I going to get up top of there? That's the question. A lot of things I have to reconsider now that everything's moving. Mm, okay, well, whatever. Can I actually roll in there, maybe? Hi, jump. What? No! Ah. Uh. Why does this... This one singular jump. This one singular jump. It's gonna be the death of me. It already has been, but... It'll be that way again. At least one more time. Ah, uh, come on. Just go on top, go on top. There we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, interesting. I didn't notice, but... When I stand in this little cart, my feet actually sink down a little in the ash. That's funny. Let's just go down again. And, and we gotta wait for it to come up. Go for it on the return hit. Come on, come on, come on. Just... That took more... That dealt more damage than I expected. Well, okay. Come on, just jump. There we go, there we go. And... Crit Black Sword back on real quick in order to just... Guillotine that crystal wizard. Hi, just out of the way, out of the way. Jump, jump, slap. What? How did that? What? How did that miss? Oh, go die. Whatever. Oh. So it has a little warmth effect. When you get close to it, I wonder what that means for its actual specific mechanics. Okay, cool. Well, I'm moving a little more slowly now. That is... Uh, I don't know if that'll stop me from making the jump, though. That's the question. Well, alright. Goes up one way, goes down the other. Mm -hmm. Alright. And that over there, I assume that allowed me to make a jump I otherwise wouldn't be able to make. Why? Just jump and... I wasn't even able to jump. Dumb. In the end, in the end, I don't want to use a human avatar to get any HP back until I'm done with this stupid, stupid jump. Okay. Ring of Restoration. House Austeria. Hmm, okay. Come on, come on. Go up again, go up again. Two handing my hands right now. Hi, just jump. There we go, we actually did it. Grip Black Sword again and. Automatically kept it two handed. That's nice. I just over there and. What? How did it sense me? You're kidding. You've got to be joking. Maybe if I tried to. But no. If I tried to use a dark orb on it, it would just. It would just run away. I wouldn't be able to kill it. I need to somehow just run straight for it. Run straight for it and just guillotine it with a Crypt Black Sword Strong Attack. Bring it down with a big chop. It is kind of crazy that all the bosses are coming in a relatively short succession. I haven't reached any and once I do, we're probably going to get them all because Alana was right before Sin. And Cave of the Dead wasn't too far ahead. By the way, there were a couple in pretty short succession. It does seem like something they do. God damn it. What am I supposed to do to actually kill that thing? <sighs> Don't have anything nearly fast enough. So maybe I could actually try Santiers. One hand Santiers and. See if that lets me just just poke it. Maybe I could see that, but 
Maybe I could actually crafty hold spear. These orbs. That would be funny, but it could work. Mm. We hop down there. Might anything happen? Probably not. Okay, jump. There we go. And same tears. Same tears. Mm. There we go. There we go. Keep that one-handed. One-handed. There we go. Cool. Now we run. Now we run. Oh well, oh well. Hit, 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 hit. What? Oh! What? That running attack was terrible. Oh, go die. So I need to lay off the run input before I try poking, but... There's nothing that really just reliably hits it. It runs away. It runs away off a ledge. So dumb. Ah, dumb, dumb, dumb. There we go. Oh, and it looks like the physics actually got into. There we go, there we go, there we go. Die again. What? What? That didn't kill. Okay, what that means actually is... We go back and we actually bite the bullet and take it to plus five. It won't make that much difference, but it will turn that from a three hit kill into a two hit, two hit kill. Why does it keep turning out that the hardest thing to deal with in the DLC, or at least one of the hardest things to deal with, is actually just killing crystal wizards that show up? It's downright insane. Uh, okay, well, back to McDuff. Rewarded for your efforts. Reinforce, and a few more twinklings, and... I've got a lot of Twinkling Titan. I can, yeah, I can definitely afford to play around with that. Actually, you know what? I could maybe upgrade my... Uh, I don't have the Souls for it yet, and it wouldn't make that much difference. But I guess if I'm getting this much Twinkling, I should actually reinforce some of my armor. Probably. Is it both of this? Is it plus two? So it'd be eight more for eight more for both. That isn't horrible. Could be worse. Big thing is, wait, what did I reinforce with? I reinforced the wrong thing, didn't I? Wait. Oh my goodness, I'm going insane. Well, in the end, I do want to reinforce everything eventually, but... Such a silly mistake to make. I'm going to blame it. I'm going to blame it on... Daylight Saving Sun. Which should not exist. This is going to make me start ranting about Daylight Saving Sun. It's just... Barely anyone farms anymore. Yeah! Yeah! There's literally no reason to do it anymore, and it, among other things, it makes kids less safe lining up for the bus, because they can't see anything. Did I... what did I upgrade? I just forget to upgrade anything? Well, whatever. Cool. Alright. Well, let's go back to the tower. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Alright, alright, we're gonna go kill that crystal lizard and hopefully get something for our trouble. And yep, bumped on the ledge. Uh, I do find it funny that even when you break the rock off of Santir's spear, there's still a little bit of rock left. You can't entirely clear it out. It's always gonna be a little janky and ugly no matter what. Come on, come on. Just run, we just run over, we poke, poke, poke. There we go, what are you gonna drop? Three Twinkling Titanite and one Titanite slab. Okay, that actually was kind of worth it. Honestly. But they're coming up now, so let's just hop on. Oh, that didn't even take any. Didn't even take any health. So. Oh, now you're going up and down. What is that gonna do? 
Where am I going to be able to go now that that's going up and down? There's an elevator. Hardly know her. That over there. Hmm. So I'm already able to go there, I think. So this, this, this. Who will this take me? Oh, well. There was a door over there. Over there. Come on, come on. Something underneath, but I'm pretty sure I could already access that door, so. Right, right, we take Santiers off. Don't need. I guess I could put Ring of Blades back on. Actually, until we know, we won't have to deal with any more fire damage. I'll keep it. Here we are, and. Is this. I think this is new. I think I've been here before. Hi. Just send that through and burn a little. Oh, or not. Hi. There we Oh, interesting. Okay. Alright. Punch, punch. Out of my way. Out of. Oh, okay. That didn't work. What? What? And of course, I went on the wrong side of the door and got blocked. Fun. The big thing was just the intermittent timing of the bullhead made it so that it totally passed over the enemy. Okay, lots and lots of effigies. Time for that. I need more health. Alright, so actually, the big thing is just I want 15 Twinkle Run Titanites to store up. Because the Charred Voice Knights in the third DLC are going to drop a pretty nice fire damage sword that I'd like to use. I need 15 Twinkling Titanites to actually upgrade that fully. But now I've got 15, 19. So I'd be up, I would be able to upgrade my armor a pretty decent amount. So I'll keep that in mind. Be able to take at least a couple of them to plus 10. But then I'd actually like to use the old Iron King's crown as my primary weapon for... That's select too? Okay. As my primary helm. So I'll be waiting. Yeah, eventually I'll keep all this armor put on a different crown. To be fair, this armor does look... This helm does look decently crown-like already, but still. Oh, we can get that. Hi. Hello. Gotta lure this guy over here. Hello, hello. Gonna blow yourself up, or what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Get over here and get a little closer, get a little closer. Actually, you're not coming over? Okay. No, not like that, not like that. Burn, burn, burn. You're gonna burn? You're gonna burn? Are you immune to fire damage? Maybe. I don't think so. Hi. Hello. And one more thrust. Okay, one, two, one, two. Oh, well, whatever. Come on. How are these guys so relentless? Back so quickly, too. Okay, come on. One, two. Can't really poise break it either, sadly. Uh, gotta make sure you go for attack with decent end lag. One, one, and die. There we go, there we go. Come on, come on. Do not blow up, do not blow up. Come on. I do wonder if any of them might be walls I can explode via. You know, basically explodable walls. Kind of like illusory walls, but not really. And these are lacerating knife. Hmm. Okay. Anything else, or so we can break those powder barrels, but still. Anything else? Anything else? Or seems to basically be it. Actually, you know what? There are a few powder barrels remaining. Might be worth trying to detonate them just in the interest of making sure that I don't miss anything. Hi. Go forward and blow those up. Hi. Is that not actually gonna reach inside the... Seems to actually kind of be missing most of them. Weird. Okay, okay. Okay. That should... Yeah, it just totally misses the black powder barrel. Alright, whatever. So can we go on the other side of that previously unmovable door? So you're gonna move over. Try to destroy. We can just lost your phone. Okay, cool. And thanks. Thank you. Anything over here? Alright, alright. 
There we go. As soon as the barrel either blocked my attack, it just spaced things out enough to keep it from going. Hi. And, well, got some damage down, but it won't be everything. Oh well. And all of you are gonna... Oh, so dumb. Out of my way, out of my way, out of my way. Let's just actually try to send this back through and see if I can use that as a damage strategy. Cool. Just out of the out of the way, 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 out of the out of the Oh no. Alright. It was it was worth it to try, but okay. It's just I couldn't get around them fast enough. If I wanted to do that, I should have lured them all the way to the other end of the hallway and then gone for them. Dum dum dum. Oh well. Among other things, I just should have used flash sweat. That's what I should have done. It's just, those guys are bad enough that they just like using flash sweat. It's just, if I forget, I can't use it. Dum, dum, dum. Okay. Well, about three more hours and three bosses to fight. This is certainly a lot meatier than Shova was. Hmm. Good value for money. Well, if I'd actually bought the DLC separately, it would have been good value for money. Hi. Okay. Cool. Let's just blow that up. Alright. And hello. 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 And is that gonna explode you? It, oh, it won't. Okay. Alright. Hmm. So just... There we go. Punch. What? And keep on going. Can we... Oh, well. Smasher's alright. Should have gotten that done earlier, but whatever. Cool. And just make sure that we don't die too stupidly or too easily. Hi. Hello. Bomb carriers. Oh, but it got one of those guys, it seems. Cool. Let's actually ask this up one more time, and... Hmm. Which way do we want to send this through? Well, first I should definitely flash sweat. Now, this is going to burn a decent number of them down at all. Thank you, thank you. And just... How many of you are actually going to get hit? That's the question. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, one of them's gone. That was good. Hi. We were all of you over this way, and then just... All of you over this way. You're gonna chase me, and I can just run past you, and then get you out of the way, and then send that back. Hi. Punch. Punch. Oh, no, 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 not like that. Not like that. Punch. And then just gut you. Get you. Get you. Please. Heal. 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 Okay. Nice. 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 Get that before... Oh, before any of that crap happens. Nice. Die. 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 There we go. Out of the way. Out of the way. And just out of the way of that. Out of the way of that. How can I send that through again? How fast does it take for it to change direction? Oh, whatever. And just burn. Burn. Oh, what? Okay, pancake. All right. Die, 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 die. Die. Heal, heal, heal. Okay, nice. Out of the way, out of the way, and die. One, two, one, two. Okay. Had to tank a bit of that, but we survived. Nice. Annoying little passageway. So what's on the other side? Anything else? Anything else? I seem to have any of those switches. Okay, okay. Just roll through. No, not really. What's in here? It's a mimic. I'm gonna cry. This is... Oh, four more smelter wedges. That's good. So down here there's... Oh, this just... Sends you back to the start of that area. Alright, so where's that key gonna take me? So there were three or so actually locked doors, and a few more doors that just went around the other way. Not be open from one side or another. Okay, well, hmm. Down there is another one. Hi. Guess we could wait until it comes back up. Hello, hello. And just go down over this way, and can we go through here? Oh, oh, nice. What's this gonna be? This is gonna be 
Oh, and there's a warmth effect. Hello. Hi. Don't like that. Don't like that. Oh, goodness. Stay out of my way. Out of my... Oh, but the warmth effect is really, really going to suck here. Mm hmm. All right. Just punch you, punch you. Out of my way. Out of... What? Oh, good lord. Smelter guys are going to be noxious. Let's just... Out of the way, out of the way. Can I actually lure you out of that door? I don't think I can. Hmm. That's just... Is there a way to deactivate that effect? So I'm gonna kill. If I kill that... Pyromancer, I could probably... Oh, well. Alright. I was not expecting that to... Still track me. Tracking on that is... Insane. Let's just open that up. We can open that and then... Kill whoever's inside. Oh, and that's a... That's smelter idol. Ashen idol. Okay, cool. Thank you. Goodbye. That's out of my way, out of my way, out of my... Okay, we can get through, which is good. That was narrowly very, very bad. Hi. Hello. This is not an actual Ashen effect. That would make this fight basically impossible. Couldn't do anything to this enemy after that. And sometimes... Is it not using its hammer anymore? No, no, never mind. Never mind. Okay, come on, and just... Well... The idol's gone, at least. I have more S's now. Oh, these headless guys are crazy. Uh. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Nothing to do but go back up and keep on fighting. So there were three or so locked doors. Two or so locked doors. A few more doors that just could only be open from specific sides. I haven't gotten that yet. I have gotten the scepter, though. Hmm. Okay, well, go down here. Tiny bit of damage from that, but... Hmm. Any kind of ring I could use? That's the question. Oh well, oh well. There we go, and... A bit of lava. Hi. Yes. Oh, nice. Just stay behind you, more or less. That's fine. And out of the way, out of the way. Good combo, combo. Unless I can't even hit you. Come on, come on. Come on, just... Well, no, that wasn't power stance. Hi. Just spin, spin, and... Annoying. That was annoying. Uh, uh. Come on. Smelter guy. Uh, got to be kidding me. Oh! Uh, uh. Uh, let me just ask this back up. Please, please, please. And just like that, and another. Oh, that still hit me? How is this hitting me, too? So dumb. Maybe I would actually be better off not even. No, I need a lock on. That is a non starter. Big thing is that if I hit the feet, I could. For the legs, very specifically. There we go. Okay, cool. Come on, come on. Oh, well, that stopped me. Out of the way. Oh, they can actually be poise broken? Okay, cool. Come on, come on. But it's not easy. And just one more. There we go. Actually interrupted your attack, too. Poor soul head. Yeah. Did get a smelter hammer. Soul of Nadali and Bride of Ash. As long as we're in Broomtown, they will automatically combine once we get all 12. Item ahead. And, well... Is that even true? Oh. It was! Unfortunately. Uh, at least they didn't say rolling required ahead. That way. That was entirely on me. Okay. How much is even left? Because now that we've revitalized Broomtown, we should be able to go all the way to the bottom. I think I see a fog gate down there, which... I assume would either be Fume Knight or... Medallia. No, Fume Knight or Smelter? Well, whatever. And that 
platform up over there is completely unmoving. So it's got to be usable for something. Let's stay still unless it was important. Down there he is. I can actually get inside there. Inside that part of the tower. That's the question. Eh, probably not. Yeah, definitely not. At least it definitely does not look like it. Really hope there aren't any other elevators. I'm just. Oh, there's one over there. Okay. By the way, just wondering what more there might be to find in out. The elevators are running. Backtracking. Gotta love backtracking. Hmm. Oh, but actually, there's something in here. Oh, okay. Well. Oh, and that was what I saw before. Ah, interesting. Hi. Hello. By the way, there's that smelter guy over there. Yes, yeah, so that's definitely, definitely something from before. Hi. Okay. Just out of the way of that, and you gonna go for another, or? No, it doesn't seem like it. Maybe actually, oh, there we go. Punch. Decent amount of damage, but it's just hard to actually manage to hit. Come on, come on. Out of the Okay, good, good. Staying behind it is actually not bad. Oh, but it's got that exhaust. Exhaust fumes. Come on. Oh, okay. This the damage isn't crazy, crazy. Mm. It's halfway down. Really do not like these. Okay. Do not like these guys. Hello, hello. Gonna go for another? Or? Guess not. Out of my way, out of my way. Out of. Ooh, backswing. Oh, come on. It's just. How am I supposed to? Well, the answer is that I'm not supposed to be using my fist for this. That's the answer. Come on. I did a thrust with a hammer, which is kind of ridiculous. That still hit me? Okay. Okay. Oh, but you can actually... Out of the way of that. Out of the way of that. Come on. There we go. So actually punching it head on. Sort of some animations works. And I guess I could have gotten that straight... Straight through. Hi, Flame Butterfly. And... Something had therefore tried to destroy. And it's a... Fall to my death. Let's not make that mistake again. And we got... Oh, life ring plus three. That is basically nothing. And the soul from before. Also, nothing we really need anymore. It's funny that this tower just opens up onto nothing. And tie ni ten tight nitrides? One petrified something and... Plus seven broadsword? Okay, I guess. It's random upgraded weapons of decent use. Is there going to be anything in here? Or... Well, let me actually read the message and I'll be able to tell. Dead end. Okay. Yep, nothing. Praise the sun. It's nice enough. Okay. Thanks. So in that case, we'll go back on that elevator and find that other passageway, which should be one of those doors I couldn't get through before. So, two doors I have to unlock, and I think three doors that just open from some other side. Oh well, hello. Oh well. What if there was... I wonder, wonder if there was anything at the very top. I don't think so. Hi. Hello. Oh, okay, well, time for a flash sweat. Or just letting you burn it down. That works too. But actually, actually, if I punch that, it'll rotate. And, oh, okay, cool. Just old radiant. Not horrible. But it was rotating the exact opposite way that I would have wanted it to. Oh, well. So over here, there's... This way, there's... Actually, I could maybe run through and just what's through here? What's through here? And this is oh, hmm, just something over here on the ash. Hi. Oh, it's Simpleton's ring. What does that do? Simpleton's ring. 
Not the dexterity ring we got. They might all be down here, we'll see. White ring, don't really need that. Simpleton's invisible while we're, while we're rolling. Simpleton's flower. Protection, ingenuity can be fearsomely, fearsomely effective. Oh! Interesting. Well, alright. We're just gonna put... I guess we could put, put flame cords back on. That is helping with the dudes from before. Oh, significantly. Go through here and... Okay, okay. That was just... Yep, so that's one of the... Th three doors? There are only two more doors left that just do not open from so-and-so side. The remainder should be... Two locked doors. There's gonna be some key I got eventually then. Well, I am not going to deal with you. That was the wrong way to go. It's just... Oh, up here we're... Huh? Oh, it was just up to another... Okay, well, whatever. So if I go... Farther up, because there was another elevator going. Actually, it's this one. Or is it? Or is it? Is it? Whatever. Let's just see. Elevator, elevator... Elevator. I hardly know her. Well, no, I was here before. This is where I was just before. How many other elevators are there going to be? Should try to check underneath, maybe. Let's see. Anything here? Anything here I haven't seen yet? Let's see. And... Oh, this was just a drop-down. But this way... Huh? No illusory wall. This is... Another one I can't open. Try pyromancy. Oh, I could probably, probably force it to open by getting an enemy to open for you. I bet. We're actually, actually. Oh, what it does is blows the door up. I think. Let's actually just see if I can punch the door. There we go. And is that gonna make him open it or? Oh, it doesn't open from the side because it was blocked. Oh, that's hilarious. It's two locked doors and one more that I have to open up manually. Okay, cool. That's all, that's all. So actually, in that case, I should just... So that just lets you get rid of the guy sniper spot, tossing firebombs. Nothing really else to it. Should be something up top. I think one more elevator I saw. We'll see, we'll see. Come on, come on. Okay. It's gotta go up instead of down. I thought that might have killed me, but it didn't. Okay, so, yep, there's one over that way that goes down there. Hmm. Try that again. Unless I'm making the same mistake as I did before, which is very, very possible. Let me see. And yep, that literally is the same one. I need, I need help. Okay, well, all right. Mm. I think there was one more door, and I think that that elevator should have let me go up. Possibly. Oh, that's open now. Let's actually go upper floor, room tower. Eh, throne room wouldn't really help. Actually, actually though, I go from throne room, I'd be able to check things more easily, so let's just go back. So I'll end up getting a key sometime later. It's important. Take note of it. Yep. Big gear shaft is turning. Fun. So now, oh, actually. Oh, that sends that over up. Over there. We should. Let's drop down here, nice and fast, and. There we go. We can actually use that as a way up and down now. Fun. Let's just actually go up then and what's here? We're backstepping. This is Vision's a tail. Baneful bird ring. Oh, that has to be associated with Few Night. She did like the raven. Let's see, clutch ring. Stamina lesson blocking the shield, agile swordsman. Way of life born again as a stalwart warrior. Uh oh. It's 
So what that would mean in this case is actually that his shield is good, but it doesn't have 100% reduction for anything. Oh, I just went around some elevators. You didn't miss much. So that is... Huh. Just leads down there. Well, the tower we started... Yeah, we went back because I'm trying to find elevators. Because now that the tower's moving again, I can actually... I can actually go through some of the doors that I wasn't able to before. So I'm just trying to see what I missed the first time around. There are a couple of doors that have keys that are, that are locked instead of just a unit does not open from the side. So I'm trying to figure out how to get through them. Hi. Oh, goodness. Okay, okay. Just checking. Come on, come on. Gotta go back. Gotta go back. Gotta love these guys. No, you really don't. Roll. Oh. Got pancaked. Come on. Die. Well, they're dead. Okay, okay. But after that, I think we reached the bottom and the boss fight should be there. We'll see. Come on, come on, Amgis. Come on. Got a few more smelter wedges too. We got ten in total now. As in, we've gotten ten in total. So eventually we should be able to deal with Nadalia. Just gotta keep track of how many I have right now. I have five left. I do need to make sure I leave one. Just in case fighting Fume Knight without destroying the idol becomes way too much, which it probably will. All things considered. Oh, and that over there. Oh, interesting. I have to reach down there somehow. Is that... Is that behind the key? Yeah, that's behind the key. I won't be able to reach her yet. Alright, alright, alright. Hmm. Okay. Let's just keep on going down. Maybe I'll try to check out some more of the doors, just to make sure I know where I couldn't get through. Hmm. Alright. Drop down here, and I think... Yeah, that's the spot. I'm gonna need to... Can't really drop down there, but... There's a door over there that I can't get through. No, that was actually just a chest. But either way, I do think that's going to be the answer. Going through the locked door once I get the key to go through there. So, DLC has had keys. It's had various key items. It's very... Very dungeon-like. To be fair, these are all kind of dungeons, but still... So there's got to be one more door down there. I'm just going to run through at this point, just to check. I'll see. I'm only there for the verification of information. What have you dealt with that and... It's not, it's not a door, and it's not a door. Come on, come on. Stay out of the way, stay out of the way. Anything here, anything here? No. Nothing there. Let's check this out one more time, see what I can get. Just gonna keep on running, keep on running. Hmm. Alright. So what else is... I suppose Illusory already went through here. Oh, hi! I really do not want to deal with all of you. I really don't want to deal with any of you. Hmm. Anything here, or... Oh, yep. Yeah. Another... Wait, what? So that opens now? Weird. Hurry of fire. Oh, no, I was here already. I went here already. Let's just check that out again. So, yep. Can't go down there just yet. There is one more door. I know that for a fact. Nearly, nearly a fact. Hello, hello. Blow up, blow up. Alright, alright, and there we go, and... Got... More black fire bombs again, nothing we really need, but nice to have, I suppose. So you, you, you. Can we get you to burn yourself up? Maybe not. But how is... They can move their hand over a barrier? Oh, goodness. That's not, that's not fair at all. Come on, come on. Run over, get one up, get one up. 
Well, okay. There we go. That did it. These guys don't seem to drop anything. I've seen them drop anything once. Let's just keep going down and eventually, I guess there's going to be a door. Just, I don't really need to check, I guess. Well, whatever. Well, oh, and we can't use the bonfire because they're coming over here. Come on. Die. Roll. Roll. Punch. Okay, cool. Well, this isn't taking me anywhere. I'm just gonna go back to the foyer and fight whatever shows up. Over here we got a number of elevators. Got that over there. I don't think that's gonna lead to anything down though, but let's try just to be sure. Still locked. Come on, locked doors, and I think maybe it was actually only two. Maybe it was actually only two. I'm probably mistaken. Come on, come on. Just wanna check. Guys, it's it's the fortress of Meripede. So down over where are the big statues and where would they? That one over there. Is there something down there? Let me see. I just want to try to get on top of that guy. There's another platform. I feel like it have to be because there's something down there that they want me to try to try to get. Actually, it doesn't seem like that does anything. Weird. Eh, kind of. Let's. Oh, and we fell down. Oh, but we didn't die. So that was entirely pointless. Nice. Let's go down, let's go down. Actually try going down here. Cool. And then... Then how far down are you going to go? You're going to stop here. Cool. Try behind. Wait. So in that case... What else is... Hmm. Okay. Visions of Despair. And a third locked door. Okay. Okay. Just gotta... We got three doors with keys that we're gonna have to find and deal with. This might be troublesome. This will almost certainly be quite troublesome. Is one of them gonna come up and then go down, or...? Hmm. Let's see. Yeah. Oh! One does go farther down, but... There's a lot over here in the ash, so I'll check that out. I'll get out in the sniper spot. Through ahead, by the way, trio ahead. Okay, okay. Sniper spot weakness poison. Hmm. Anybody over there? Or... Hi. If you come a little closer, you could. Well, whatever. We're just gonna punch you. Hi, hi. Okay. Anything here does not seem like it. Maybe we'll try. Flash sweat again, just in case. So in that case, be wary of fatty. Oh, trio ahead? Actually, what we could do is... Or you back, or you over here, because I do not want to have to fight three smelter demons at once. Hi! There we go. Punch, punch. And not all of them hit. Sad. Punch. Come on, come on. Gonna roll back. The backswing did hit me. Dumb. Oh, but we can just get you stand in the fire, and it works decently enough. Come on, come on. Come on. Get over there. There we go, and can you just stand the fire, stand the fire. Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right. It's not the kind of thing I can rely on at all, but hi. Cool, cool. Back swing, maybe? Maybe. Oh, oh. Okay. Okay. Die, die. Well, one more hit will do it. One more hit will do it. There we go. That was dangerous. Okay. Just put up another flash sweat. What are we going to get as a reward for fighting? Three of these smelter guys. Mm -hmm. What are they even called? Smelter. There you go. Okay. Get back over here. 
Come on, come on. These are smelter soldiers, I think. So if I... Where are you over here? I'll get you to stand in the right position. Hello, hello. Hi. Just let you do the trick for me. Do my work for me. Hi. Come on and just... Out of the way, out of the way. Don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Oh, come on. If you stand in the right spot. Hi. And just start it again. Start that up again. Okay. Get across this, across this line and just... Hi. Actually punch you down. There we go. There we go. So using those for help is pretty significant. So there's got to be one more. Somewhere. Treasure ahead. That is... Oh, two human effigies. What is the last thing going to be? Two twinkling titanite. Five charcoal pine resin. And then... There you are, there you are. Two titanite chunks and a... Two molded dusk herb. And oh, this is the one with the bleed mace. That's not fun. And they still have fire leaking. That's just fun. Why don't we you over here? Hi! Oh well. Hi. Roll. Roll. And just a glee. Yeah, sure. Oh, but you're jumping around. I didn't know you were agile like that. Oh well, oh well. Just. Ooh, ooh. Let's not get hit. Let's not get hit. Come on, come on. Just in case, let's put the flash button back on. Okay, cool. You are trying your best to sound the way of that. Well, actually, you're not thinking at all. Come on, come on. So the mace they have actually can't get as a weapon drop, sadly. Which is sad, because it's pretty cool looking. It does have a nice innate bleed effect. Hi, and just... What, what, what? Roll, roll. Roll. Oh, please. One more should do it. One more should do it. Can we get you? Can we get you? Okay. You burn. Burn up. Oh, come on. Just... One more hit will do it. One more hit will do it. Punch, punch. There we go. Oh, goodness. I have the pyro flint before. If... If it had struck with the right instead of left first, I would have been incredibly dead. And just... Arch soul the name of soldier. Got soul, but I'm not a soldier. Skeptic Spice, and... Let's see. Artisan Short Quagmire Head? Oh, Tower Key! Nice. Detour Head, no, that's not going to do anything. It's not going to help me. In that case, let's just... Go back, we got a number of places to open up with that key now. I think I'll just do that as soon as possible. There is just so much. So we got the key, we got the scepter. Plenty of key items. Go over here, we can open this up and see what's inside. Tower key. Oh, what's the description of the tower key? Let's see. Tower key, broom tower door, endless supply of iron, iron soldiers in an iron castle. And at forging a dragon out of iron. Ooh. That's frightening. I don't like that. Oh, and you are. Do I need a torch for that? Maybe. Hi. And. Oh, it's starting to curse me. So, the idols will either use a firestorm, a healing warmth effect, or. It'll just curse you in a radius. Hi. Hello. Come on. And die, die, die. Keep on going and see where the idol is. It's starting to get cursed, but... Hmm. It's sweet. It's sweet. Nice thing is that unlike a lot of things, you are invincible while trying to destroy an idol, so... You can kind of do a run. Run through. So where is it? Where is she? Let's see her. I am cursed. It's not in here. Definitely is not in here. Hi. Hello. Is the curse build up gonna stop? Which way do we have to go? Come on. Oh, wrong side, wrong side. Oh, and the bow guys are there too. Well, that was... That was unpleasant. 
So I guess maybe actually after I destroy the idol, I should try to human effigy up or something. We'll see. So I have got 25% of my health just gone now. Let's see, go over there, grab a blood stain before I die. Hi! Of course I can just run under them, that's nice. And where is she? Where is she? Oh, clearly behind there. Hello, hello. Let's just go over and use the smelter wedge and probably actually just feather out immediately once we have the chance. Yep, let's do that. And we're good in it. Oh, well, that stopped. That didn't work. Come on. Oh, well, I'm dead. Good thing is, the good thing is, it's gone now. And I don't need to really rush engaging those enemies. There is going to be something on the other side, and I do want to see what it is, but it shouldn't be horrible. All right. Let's just effigy up. There we go. Cool. Mandate to restore it. I expected to be in shorter supply of those than I ended up being. I haven't even had to basically have a ring slot permanently occupied by Ring of Binding like I thought I might need to. In order to, you know, reduce HP reduction from hollowing. So I have enough, I've had enough human effigies. And the HP reduction hasn't been horrible enough that I've really needed to always have full HP. Small blessings. So in that case, we should take a turn in the right direction. You're coming over here. Make sure we don't fight too many of you at once. Hi. Hello. And are you going to spin or no, you aren't? Good. And there we go. But it actually took five. Five that actually connected. I wonder if that's counter frames. Hi. Hello. Another one of the fire guys. Dumb, dumb, dumb. Hi. Punch, punch, punch. Oh, goodness. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Not good. Let's just flash it up. Then just do that again. Hi. Oh, well. Oh, well, whatever. And your shield stays up while you're poking, which is not fun. And you are annoying. Hi. I can actually punch you even while you're still recovering because you're on stairs. Nice. Come on, come on. You annoy me to no end. Yeah, that would normally be a really good opportunity to hit them, but when you have the range of your fists, it's harder to take advantage of. Got our blood sin, we got another piece of the soul. And I think I heard somebody, maybe. Soul of Nadalia and something over here on this sort of half altar. What's over here? And we can't open that, can we? Destroy required ahead. Yeah, well, somehow I don't think that will particularly do anything. But actually, wait. Maybe if... Is there a soldier in here who I could get to maybe hit that? Let's see. Because if so... So... Fire snake. That's cool. Let's see what that does. But nothing else is weak to fire anymore. Fire snake. Another one by Eagle. Pillars of flame in front of the caster. Fire will will its own. Like a snake arriving towards the prey with a mighty strike. And Dance of Fire 2. That has a dark appearance, but I don't think it deals dark damage. Hmm. Okay. Well, either way, we'll just check out all the nothing in here. I know that there was one more illusory wall somewhere in Broom Tower. I haven't found it yet. Get that, get that. Hello. So I'm try one more time to maybe get them to blow up that wall by hitting it. Either way, we can go back up and get a little bit more. Let's mm. just. Yep, we got. How many more? We got four more spelter wedges, which means we have three that we can just use free without having to really worry. Hi. Hello. Try going over here and see what happens. Hello, hello. Just get over here, get over. Yeah, that didn't do anything. Figured, but good to check. And just go back. Hi. And just as soon as the animation starts playing, we can just leave. Okay. Good stuff. 
go back here, and then we can go back down. A little bit more. Actually, let's see. I've got... It would be a little more than a thousand more to level up, but... It's in the interest of never wasting souls when we can help it. I think I'll go back and... I should have sold it here or something for that. Okay. Oh well. Oh well. Now you're over there. All the way over there. It's just soul the hero, soul the hero. Yep, normal soul the hero. Not soul the great hero. Don't need that. And then... Pro Knight should be good. That's pretty much perfect. Talk to you. Thank you. Fully withered. We got Vitality up. Barely any HP, but he's still on the equip load now. Cool. Wonder what that would do for doing it with Crypt Black Sword. This Dragon Ring works pretty well, but. Mm. It's kind of crazy that there are still two bonfires left in Broom Tower. Somehow, somewhere. Well, nothing to do but keep looking. And go back up. And then we're going to want to open that other locked door. Okay, cool. Just got to go through. I wonder what would happen if I actually tried to go in the center there. Surely nothing good. I wonder if those fire hitboxes are actually active. Hmm. Okay, okay. Let's go up, go up. Gonna be another one over here, and should lead me. No, not there. That one is not what I'm taking right now. We're gonna go up. No, no, it was. It was there. So we go up in the cage. Open the one. Open the door to the left and get to the top. And that should lead to this one more Ashen Idol. And a door, probably. Alright, cool. Here we go. Hmm. So another elevator. Hello. And down there is obviously just a deck. Cool. So let's just go up and see what there is to see. Hello, hello. And I can hear it. Prowlers? Hello. Are you a... Is this a... Is this guy a player or a... Weird. Oh, they got Berserker Blade. Oh no, these are... This is... This is an NPC invasion. Hello. Oh, but the warmth effect is... That's hurting things, so we gotta... Put that wedge in. Cool. Thank you. I'm trying so hard to backstab me, huh? Thanks. Come on, come on. Get out of the way. And, well, I attacked too fast for that. Get over here. Get over here. And just one. Oh, oh, oh. Mm -hmm. Maybe a rolling attack might be better for this. We did get a bit of a roll catch, but let's see. There we go. Oh, but your damage is really, really good. Well, ah, uh, dumb. Let's just see. Out of the. Oh, well, that. I thought I'd be able to roll through that. Got me. Yeah, take your victory. Ah. Okay. I do like that Vanquisher Seal takes up a ring slot and makes your fist decent but not good. It really adds some panache, I'll say. Okay, I should actually, yeah, I should get Ring of Blades back on if I'm going to be using my fists. Because that guy doesn't deal any kind of fire damage, so there's no reason. And given that the fists attack fast, but not for all that much damage. Yeah. Ring of Blades is definitely where it's at. 
down there. You know, I'm almost certain that that's a void that would just kill me. But, I don't know. I feel like making sure eventually. So I got this. Yep, okay, cool. Hi. Hello. Punch. 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 There we go. That was alright. Range on is still more than I expected. Hi. Punch, punch. Punch. Okay, as long as we're willing to just tank some hits, just let him come in and punch us some more. Hello. Are you gonna heal or? Hi. Oh, wow. That's a crazy attack. Well, you can die. Oh, but it. I didn't say Invader Banish. Just died like an enemy. Maybe because of the Dolly's whole deal. I don't know. Well, whatever. And this over. Oh, more! There are more? Oh, do we have to kill all of them to. Oh, that might suck. Come on, come on. Just out of my way. So they invaded in a group. Some of them are gonna. Oh, I don't like that. Don't like that at all. Which ones of you are gonna punch? Which ones are gonna. Oh! No, seriously. These guys are just relentless. Can I just try to go down the tower or something? Maybe go down the elevator? Oh, well, not if they gank me like that. Okay, so actually, at max range, you. Let's see. What if I go down the elevator? If I go down the elevator, will you follow me? Can I isolate you that way? Well, it doesn't seem like it. Hmm. This is an interesting fight. I never expected invaders to invade as a group. And I'm wondering if, if I died to one of them before the others all died, would they... Would they all respawn when I died? That's the question. Hi. Okay, cool. That's another one down, and another one down. Another one bites the dust. Hey. I'm gonna get you, too. Okay. So, one of the others is actually standing out of my way right now. So, they're not all that good at rolling, which is some consolation. As long as we're just staying out of the way, we can advance and just punch them. The first one actually was the most intimidating. Especially since the Ashen Idol is there. Another one bites the dust. Okay, I think this is the last one. Punch. 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 There we go. Finally vanquished. So I bet they would have kept showing up. And this? I guess that's Angel. Joy ahead and then good luck. Charmer ahead. It's got good abs. Good packs too. So you had to kill all five of them for them to disappear. Oh, and another bonfire. Oh, okay. Hmm. What is this? Oh, this is how you... Oh. We have tough enemy. This is how you get to Surlan. You actually have to get past Prowlers. The Smelter Throne. Hmm. I was not expecting that. So I actually can't take this. Examine. Alas, nothing happened. Okay, so if I want to get to the memory of the old Iron King, I need to actually go and at least kill Fume Knight first, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Well, that's through. Go back down and do more stuff now. Back to... So this is actually the last bonfire there. So we weren't supposed to come back here until later, arguably. No, this area is not linear enough that I don't think there's really supposed to. That was cool. Killed five crazy samurai with only our fists. Hmm. Yep. But it was out of order. Because we got one, three. One, two, three, and five, but not four yet. So we're gonna need to keep going to see what's left. Tower key. It is. They're about halfway done. They're tasty. I like them. Hope it doesn't bother you too much. A little might be okay. So wait. This is down here, and okay, Twilight Herb. Is anyone gonna come up this way or? Mm -mm. Is that going to be down at the bottom? Weird. Hmm. 
This goes up this way. So I needed that in order to get to the bottom, but there's got to be more over this side. There was another elevator down. Okay, that's good. I might talk tough, but... <coughs> ah! I wouldn't actually want to bother anybody. Yeah, it would hurt too. Oh, and we already... Yep, we already went through here. So actually... So we need the scepter, but I'm not sure whether we actually need it. The tower key, then we just got the crown. Because the crown should be after Fume Knight. Sir Ovan, I'm pretty sure, is completely optional. Completely optional. Oh, so up here and then down there. Let's just go over this way and see what happens. What's over here? Two levels regret. Be wary of inattention. Wait. Someone behind me or... What? Someone up top? There's gotta be someone up top. Wait. Wait. Who is... Or are they? Ring. Do I hear someone? Let's see. Mm -hmm. Gotten a lot of rings in this one, too, actually. This is... Oh, the strength ring. Hmm. Okay. Let's just see. Inventory, inventory. Equipment, actually. Let's check. All the way to the bottom, we got... Dexterity ring, strength ring, strength. Increases the strength of its wearer. Age of iron, freely, life and creation. This is actually... Okay, they're both iron rings. Okay. This ring sucks. Be able to capture him. But my equipment is too high for that to be particularly useful for me. Let's just go down that and see. We have to fight down here. Oh! With a flaming axe? Oh, that's insane. Well, let's put flash sweat on. Hello. Bunch. Bunch. Oh, well. Right, I forgot to power stance. Let's just actually do that then. Up. Or. Worry of jumping off. Visions of jumping off. This would actually be a way to get to. But that isn't doing anything right now. Death. So how could I get to the top level? Is there a way to do that from here? Or? Hmm. Okay. Come on, come on. Maybe it's illusory wall related. I can see that. And just one more. There we go. One more illusory wall in Boom Tower. Drop it down here, another one with a flaming axe. Hi. Out of the way of that. Die, 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 and... Anyone else I can see at the moment, or no? And, yep, crumbling four. Two crumbling fours. What? Okay. Alright. Interesting. Well, you know, I kind of wanted to see what would happen. Kinda. A little. Let's actually just... You know what? We could just get everyone out of the way and then... Everyone out of the way and then just use the feather. Come on, come on. And then animate, animate. Oh, that was clutch. Okay, let's not break that floor. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. A regular homeward bone would not have been nearly fast enough to save me. I only survived because I used that specifically. Uh, so, okay. We're gonna go back down and we're gonna go back down to that funny little area. I love the verticality of this area and how non-linear it is. There's just so much. When I think I can't go down any farther, I can. Sadly, I can't really look up to really get the sense of scale that I'm all I to, but eh, it doesn't really matter. How am I gonna get up to the top? And that's the question. Just... Oh, that's some damage. Oh, whatever. It's just... Yeah. I really wonder if there's actually any way to get up there. It seems like there should be, but still. Hmm. Nothing says anything about any kind of illusory wall. Okay, well, whatever. Come on. Just power stance, power stance, right, 
or I forget. Item. Oh, a battle axe. Okay, so they actually have very standard weapons. I actually like that. Makes sense, given that, you know, they were all basically mass-produced. They are just fake soldiers made using his magic iron generation powers. Let's just go down again, not fall. Try not to fall. Hi! Oh, we actually dodged right through that, more or less by accident. Hello, hello. Let's see. How far down we have to go before that breaks? And just punch, punch, and... Oh, I did not want to fall. Good thing I didn't advance as much as I maybe could have had to. Hi. Okay, cool. Punch, punch, punch. There we Oh, one more, one more. Then, hole. Oh. Yeah, you think? And... Go for a bit more, just make sure that I don't have to fight the smelter with a bunch of dudes. Oh well, oh well. Let's drop down and... Oh, well that didn't work. Dumb. One and... Oh, 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 oh. <clears throat> Annoying. So we do have to fight two. But it, could, it could be worse. It could be much worse. Die, die. Oh, 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 oh. Come on. Oh, what? Okay. Please die, die, die. One of you left, one of you left. Out of the way of that thrust. And punch, punch, and... Strong, strong. There we go. That worked well enough. So, yep, the only thing left is going to be Smelter. Partisan plus six. Not a fan of partisanship. And anything over there? Not really. Range battle, therefore, robber safe zone, but it's not really an option for me right now. Hello. Fists only. Bleed mace. Hi. Just out of the way of that, and good, good, good. Good. Cool. The fist will work well enough, but it doesn't change the fact that this guy sucks to fight. Out of the way, out of the way, and will you go for another? No, doesn't... Well, we miss. That's not fun. So you see, he does this big fire spray. It's, well, probably a molten, molten iron spray, if anything, but it's still annoying. Hi. Just out of the way of that, out of the way of that, and punch. Hit with one. Okay. And just... One, ooh. One more, one more. Oh, oh, and we actually poison broke you. Hi. Just a couple more punches and strong attack. There we go, goodbye. Thank you for ranged battle. So that base is not actually obtainable, but they'll actually drop the same crazy heavy deformed hammer as the ones that actually hold it. Let's just see. So where to now? So the big thing is just, you have to kill the enemies, otherwise you probably can't rush and open the lever. Because you're not invincible while putting a lever down in this one. Big, big soldiers. Okay, I'm glad I didn't have to. Oh, but actually, the ones with the hammers are just headless versions of those guys, so I did have to fight them. Imagine how much harder they would actually be with a head. Hi, oh, but what? Oh no. With ash. Don't like that. Out of the way, and just punch. Punch. Okay. Oh, you can actually fly. That's not fun at all. It's not fun at all. Come on. There we go, there we go. There's gotta be another Ashen Idol somewhere around here then. Where would it be? Inside somewhere that I haven't seen yet? Maybe. Hi. Come on, come on. Oh, more? Oh, you're kidding me. Oh, my gonna... Oh, they did just come back to life, I think. I think they did. Hi! Oh, well. You know, that did the trick, too. Hmm. So the big thing is, I should just go in, run, be a little foolhardy, then... Hmm. Get the idol down so that I can fight them without them regenerating. Yeah, having to deal with resurrecting enemies is not fun. It's like fighting Abyss Bethysmal Vishapurd or the new Geo Bishop Local Legend. I've actually fought those guys a lot of times just for fun. The only team that actually works really well against them is the Zhao team. 
I've tried the Alhafen team, which normally works well with small AoE situations. But it's really only the Alhafen team. I mean, the, the Zhao team that can handle them. It's kind of funny. They're a lot of fun, but yeah, they're... Oh, what? I totally missed that jump. You're kidding me. Oh, good god. Oh, but... Okay, so that idol over there, that's gotta be... Fume Knight. It's a shame that, unlike Zhao, I do take damage from plunges. Either way, I think... Nothing else in the interest of getting more souls. Should probably still try to... Kill everything in... Everything on the way down. Completely empty bloodstain. I feel so accomplished. Eh, whatever. Just jump and don't screw it up this time. Uh-huh. Yep, do that power stance. That's good. We should... Go down there. Make sure we don't die again for no, no reason at all. Right, blast sweat in case we get hit by the fire axe and... There we go. Punch, punch, and then spin. Oh, whatever. Oh, goodness. Whatever. I need to be faster on the draw with that. Let's go down and... Can we punch? That kind of worked. Whatever. And a few more. We got you. Hi. Punch, punch. Ugh, ugh. And you're over there. Hi. Just one, two. And oh, you actually broke the floor down. Fun. And you are over there. Hello. Swing, swing. One, two. Oh, that still hit me. What? What? Okay. Die, die. Okay. Come on, come on. Cool. You are going to fall down, hopefully hit you. Here we go, Kanda. What? Oh, oh goodness. Dangerous, dangerous. Yeah, it certainly was something, but the main reason I was doing that was to try to hit them on the way down with a plunge. Oh, die. Good, good. So much crap to deal with here. At least this. Smelter's left. And if I wanted to, I wouldn't actually have to fight it. Actually, yeah, I don't want to fight it, so I'm not gonna. Hi. Oh well. Oh, and that hit me. Dumb. There we go. Yeah, well, the robots, not the evil. Very least they're not sentient robots. Oh, funny spin. Let's just want to sweat that up and you're gonna snipe me? You're gonna try to snipe me at least? You are. Okay. Come on, come on. Go through. There should be an Ashen Idol somewhere. Where is it? Where is it? Come on. Just open this. Open that and come on. Just out of the way, out of the way and just sorcery clustering. Oh, that, that could be good for later. Oh, what? You actually, you actually came all this way? Oh, come on. That's unfair. So where is that Ashen Idol? Or is it? That's a... Okay, let's go up before you come and get me. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Oh, this goes down. What? Okay. I was not expecting it to follow me all that way. But it's just... Should be another Ashen Idol somewhere around here, but actually... Oh, this is... It's just the Fume Night Fog Gate. Okay. Hmm. So in that case... Might find another smelter wedge around here, maybe? We'll see. Wait, oh, hi! I don't like that. Let's just do this now. There's one in the arena proper. It's gonna heal Few Knight. Is that. Oh, you're still Ashen? Let's see. Hmm, how many do I have left? Oh, come on. Scotta. Out of the way of the bleed maze. We got one, we got one. It's only a Bride of Ash. Let's just try not to maybe awaken another. That would suck. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, that almost killed me. That did kill me, okay. It's just... I'm not even sure whether... Not even sure whether... Destroying that idol actually deactivated. The ash buff on them.
Because if it didn't, I'll need to keep looking. What other way we got? We can use one more smelter wedge before the boss battle. After that, I'll need to keep it in reserve because I do not want to keep having to try fighting Fume Knight without access to a smelter wedge. Because I did get a challenge from the friend who showed up earlier to fight Fume without destroying the idol and having to deal with his health buff, his regeneration buff. It's theoretically possible, but it's not easy. Especially with this. Bludgeoning is one of the best options, but if I'm having to deal with... Okay, this is fine. Deal with regeneration. That would make things significantly more troublesome. Okay, well, alright. Hmm. There you are, there you are. Come on, come on. Oh, hi. Punch. Oh, we did power stance. Annoying. Just out of the way, you. Out of the way, you. Die, die, die. Okay. Flash foot up real quick. Okay. No, not like that. Not like that. Come on, come on. We just gotta... Punch. Roll, roll. Punch. There we go. Die. Okay. Not when I have to fight all these guys at once. Come on. Oh, how am I missing? Annoying. There we go. And just out of the way of that, you're going to go for another. Are you not going to go for another swing? Okay. Cool. Nice. And then we can keep going down. Hello. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Good lord. Just out of the. Do not swing that down on my head. I wonder if they dropped a sword this time. They dropped... Oh, just a small orange burr. Whatever. Then, who is down here? Nobody? Okay. Maybe they just joined up with the other ones and I'll have to fight three. I would not like that. Oh, 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 what? What, what? Oh, oh, oh dumb. Well, okay. Come on, just... Oh, please! Kill yourself. Oh, oh. I should just run for it. I should just go for a run. I don't need to... ...kill any of them, even. Just my own... ...worthless pride. Come on, come on, come on. It's gonna go down, we're gonna go down again. Well, maybe I should have, maybe I should have gone out and put it in the title that this was fist only. That would have been fun. That over there, that's the ash over that way, and... Thank you, I think we'll be fine. I think we'll be okay. I just gotta... Gotta run past him. Instead of fighting this time. First, we should definitely put up Flash Sweat anyway. Okay, cool. Hi. Hello. Hello. Stay away from me. Do not need to deal with all of you right now. At least not right now. Hi. So in that case, well, oh, well, whatever. Come on, come on. Gotta heal, gotta heal. Hello, hello. And just keep on running. See how many of them are going to chase me. Well, there is a blood stain over there. I don't care about it. That blood didn't go away. For all I care. It's weird that that attack didn't hit me. Not complaining, though. Hi. Let's just go through and... Is there anything down there? No, there is not. Okay. Hmm, so we gotta... Pull that lever with the time we have. Pull. Do not kill me. Not just yet. Hmm. So in that case... I wonder if they just stay ashen pretty much no matter what. I can see that. Hmm. Okay. We have one more wedge to use, and there was another elevator down there, I think. Maybe. I'm not sure. There's another way down. 
I just did not really pay attention to. Well, whatever. I can go back and try checking. It's just... In the arena itself, I think there are going to be a few more. We'll see. Hi, hi. Then, just like this. Punch, punch, punch. Hello, hello. Oh, please. Get out of my way. Oh, oh, what? And of course the, of course the fire stopped me from moving. It's so dumb. Okay, so there's... I think there was another way down that I needed to check. Might be another idol or something. Yeah. Should be four more in total, I think. Whatever. Oh, and who? Parvity. Oh, that's funny. That person's a Fate fan. There, because in Fate, one of the servants is Parvati, is in the, Ingo the Indian goddess, but she actually takes the form of an existing character, Sakura. Because they made a rule, it was really just a reason to let them put in regular human characters who weren't servants from previous works. But regular humans can show up as pseudo-servants, and basically the vessel of a god, but... Not a servant on their own. Let me see. Okay. Okay, let's see. So we can go down here. This is where I wanted to go. It is. It is what it is. This is... a location. Gotta go down here. See what there is to find. And then we can see... Fume Knight Arena at the very bottom. Come on, come on. That over there, we've seen that before. That's the part. I wonder if there's going to be a bonfire here. It would be kind of superfluous. Wait, so... It's over this way. This is something. It's some kind of cave. Huh. Oh, this is Iron Passage. Oh, so all the... All the bosses are pretty much separate. Oh, but Iron Passage is basically... It's basically the Cave of the Dead of this DLC. Steel of Lori. Don't care for that. Drifter Swordsman Adil. Let me out of here. Oh, and actually, Blue Smelter is going to be in here. What is this going to do? I'm worried. Come on, come on, and... Oh, 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 hi. Hello. Oh, but what a salamander out to hit him. That's fun. Oh, what, what, what? Oh, please. Die. You need to go back and heal. This could be painful. This is definitely gonna be... What? Okay. Okay. I mm -hmm. think we need to find a way to keep them in that passage for the salamander to hit him. Definitely. Well, at least, at least we have a way. That's the only one in Iron Passage. So actually, it seems like there's a six, seven bonfire quota or something. Maybe. Can't imagine that was all that intentional. Well, alright. Is that going to stay down or do we have to open that again? Okay, we do have to open it again. Interesting. Okay. Hi. Can't really hit you there. Mm -mm. But to go through, we'll have to almost certainly open that up. But also, there's a drop down. Okay, cool. It's cool how they, they have these kinds of mini dungeons as a way to get you through. Hi. Just out of the way of that. If we stay over here, we can just. Yeah, let you keep getting blown up. Oh, but actually, oh, we... The range is a lot more limited than I expected to be right. Dumb. Well, whatever. How close can I get back? How far back can I get? What? Okay. 
Mm -hmm. Oh, please. It's just... These iron soldiers are... obnoxious. Can I just get through? Can I get through? Okay, cool. Actually, they start going back, so... I could maybe use the... Summer. Oh, but actually... It's a limited amount of time for the salamander door to even stay open. Oh, okay. Weird. Okay, okay. Come on, come on. Just... Dumb gank fight, dumb gank fight. Die, die, die. Item? Oh. Orange burr. Okay, well, I'm dead. I didn't need to pick that up. Ah. Well, the nice thing is that there isn't much left. There's a short but painful cave, like me. And then, few night. Mm -mm. That. Maybe a bonfire at the end. That could be nice. Mm -mm. Okay. So what would be at the end over there? Can I keep putting this down to try to get the salamander to keep blasting them? Maybe. Okay, cool. Hi. Just stay over there, maybe. Come on. Just... Oh, okay. Please, please. Can we just... Now I guess it'll come back up, maybe? Come on, come on. Maybe we can only do that once per... Yeah, it seems like you can only do that once per... Please, please, stay out of my way, stay out of my way. Hit, hit. Oh, oh, come on. Got no mercy invincibility. Dumb, dumb. It's just, how am I supposed to die? Okay, you died, you died, and I barely survived. Hi. Okay. Come on, come on. How am I supposed to... Well, that didn't really work. I wanted to chug multiple, but the game did not let me. Die, die, die. Interesting big swing. Actually, staying this far away actually de a number of them. That's interesting. And yep, you can only do that once. So actually, would I be able to get over to the other side with the... Oh, but that triggers that, so... Wait. So would I have to run through, straight through, in order to actually see what I was on the other side of that? I might. That'd be crazy, but I can see that. Die, die, die. So what's in here? What's in here? Arch tide net shard. Well, we killed those soldiers. Could be worse. Hmm. Could also be a lot better. Anything, anything? No. Nothing. So, yep, it seems that if I want to take that route, I would need to just dash. What's through here? What's through here? Oh, oh, no, nothing. Oh, do I hear? Oh, I do hear, guys. Cool. Oh, hi. Die, 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 die. And just probably stay out of the way of that fume sorcerer. Be nice to have a lightning spell like that. Hi. Oh, what? Okay. Interesting. Did you somehow slow me down? You did. Weird. What is... Oh, they have Promise Walk of Peace. That's what's going on. Hi. Oh, oh, what? Oh, and there's a... It's a dark sorcerer in here? Interesting. Hi. Just punch, punch, punch. There we go. Okay, cool. I'm just out of the way of that. Not to do, need to deal with that crap. It's not expecting this. Mm. Oh, well. Oh, well. Just roll. Punch, punch, punch you down, and there we go. Okay, luckily we didn't die. We can survive this. It's actually... Oh, well, we could use life gems for smelter. I think this is going to be... And I do actually have magic barrier equipped. That's good. This is going to be a matter of surviving this somehow. Oh, hi. Come on, come on. Just punch, punch, punch. There we go. Okay. How am I going to get up to that fume sorcerer? Do I have to go the other way? I might have. Dumb. Annoying. Ah, oh, please. Worry of recklessness. Okay, well. That won't hit me. Oh, I should have just used the Estus there. Whatever. Hi. Punch, punch, punch. There we go. What? What? Okay. Cool. Die. Die. And then... Oh, we got it. Is that the salamander? Or... Range battle required ahead. Hello. Hello. 
Oh, please. What is... What is going on here? Just spin. Punch, punch. So actually... Oh, even in this passage, I can't reliably force them. Get hit by all my strikes. Hi. Just... Gonna shoot me, or... We can just... Force you into there. Okay, cool. Hi. Get over here. Get over here and just punch. Ooh, ooh, okay. Come on. You're dead now? Then. What else? Oh, you're coming over. What? Excuse me? How are you just doing that? Dumb, dumb. Die. Die, die, die. Oh, what, what, what? Oh, come on. So annoying. Oh, one, one more. You have got to be kidding me. This area is truly obnoxious. You suck. Die, 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 die. And we got hit by one, but that's not horrible. I'm gonna start burning through these life gens. Almost certainly. How do I get up there? That's the question. Let's so get. Try jumping right. Oh, well, maybe if I. Maybe if I. This is better. Yeah. Uh, gonna shoot me again? Gonna shoot me again? Well, if I get stopped by a great arrow, that won't do anything for me. Let's see if I can get around that. Oh, dumb, dumb. Oh, what? 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 Dumb, stupid. Okay. Come on, come on. Come all the way over here. I need to kill you. This is new and not in a good way. Okay, well, die. And I wasn't even power stancing, right? Okay. Okay, good. I have it. So how am I going to get over that salamander? That shooting cannon thing. It's clearly I messed it up the first time around. I need to figure this out. Dumb, dumb, dumb. Oh, hi. Charge range battle. Well, not an option right now. Come on, please. This I can still roll. Still, what? Oh, you're kidding me. How many are- Oh, you! You mother. Dried root. It's just- What? What? Okay. Just die, die, die. Die. Uh, how many times can you do this? Come on, just punch, 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 punch. Okay, die. Smelter over there. So much garbage. It's just clearly the way I was supposed to do this was just run through. Dodge the big fire salamander cannon thing and find a way to get down, but can't get up here it seems. They are shooting something crazy. Really, really strong. Well, okay. Come on, come on. Just can't reach it. Whatever it is, I can't reach it. I should just write it off as a loss. Go back to the bonfire and uh, actually run through the dashing required ahead. Hmm. Yeah, because it's just if you can dash, you can take the high road. If you don't dash, good luck. It's basically a Sonic game, actually. It's more like a Sonic game than Dark Souls. Okay. No shield, but whatever. Come on, come on. Shortcut. And really, the only good way. Hi, hi. And just out of the way of that, and there we go, and can we do this? We... Yo, there we go. Nice. You actually managed. Nice. Okay, come on. How many of you are there? Just one. Okay, cool. Well, the big thing is that it feels like a Sonic game, because in Sonic games, if you're skillful, you can stay on a top path, which will usually go faster, but take more skill to stay on. But if you're slow, you'll fall down and suffer. Oh, interesting. So there are... Let's try not to fall. Where are you? Hmm. All right. All right. Epic Iron Passage moment. Oh well. Hi. It's like that, and do not want to deal with your crap. 
die. And those spotty guys can't even reach me. Nice. Okay. Pick up the item, quit some water. Don't need that. And then we just go around it. To the other shortcuts. Nice. Oh, the other upper pass. Okay. I was surprised I actually made it through that. Thought they would have slapped me or done worse. Hmm. So what is there's something? Oh hi! Die. Die. Do not enchant, do not enchant. Okay, good, you didn't manage to backstab me. Come on, come on. They're basically just as much assassins as they were sorcerers. That's fun. Die. There we go, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. So what is this going to do? Comes up with that and then. Oh, cool, you have to run again. Oh, interesting. Okay, cool. Hmm. So it's this way. What is this way? Hi. Just punch. One, two, one, two. What, what? Okay, die, die. Out of my way, out of my way, out of my way. Please just. That's just up. Okay, so it is literally. Run past various Iron King soldiers. Sometimes you get a crappy item. If you kill them instead. Sometimes. Yep, you can't trigger that multiple times per, and you have to try again. Okay. Hmm. I mean, it's just... Nothing. Yeah, see? That crap isn't worth it. Then... Now this... area is just certainly something. Five torches. Yay. Then, anything else? We got nothing. This is... Okay. By the way, yeah, flashlight pre-run is going to be useful. This the second run wasn't quite as bad. It's just high roads, high roads, and high roads. Some of them higher than others. There is... There is... Oh, this is actually pretty decent. Let me go over here, so... The amount of shortcut you get is determined by your speed. Your determination. Your resolve. Oh, and another one. Oh, please. Die. Out of the out of the way, out of the way. Please, please. That's the stuff, that's the stuff. Switch that and power stance. Die. Die, 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 die. Die, die, die. Okay, cool. You're dead. Kill up real quick. What did you draw? Let's see. Do you got Oh, Black Hollow Mage, good. Oh, they're Hollow Mages? Okay, cool. Oh, and actually, if we just move out of the way, that isn't hard to deal with. Okay, please. Just... Oh, well. I think I went for two that time. Alright. Come on, come on. Let's need to see what I can get from that over there. That item was. Please die. There we go. Okay, and... Run for revenge. With the Dusk Herb, and what is over this way? So this is just the end. That's the fog game, but yeah, the best way. Uh, the best way through this is very. Oh, they shot at me. Very plainly, and just go through both the shortcuts. Okay, that's actually really cool. Hmm. The DLC is definitely the most brutally difficult part of this game. But it's also some of the most creative and well thought out. They actually had some idea of what they were doing. And that goes a lot. Goes a long way. Just, just rush it. I'm um, rush. Hi. Roll. And just... There we go. Oh, but I'm, I'm too short for them to actually hit me with. That's so funny. The cannon won't hit me. It just goes over me. It's insane. Die, die, die. And none of... None of that hit me. It's so funny. Well, oh real good. I gotta heal. Mm -mm. Do not... Okay, there we go. Punch. Oh, that still hit me. Whatever. Well, we're gonna have to go through another shortcut. Alright. Alright. This sure, let's put another flash sweat on. Big thing is that oh well whatever. Hi. Oh come on, just what oh and what? That's a thing you can do? Okay, cool. 
And just punch. Oh, roll. Not like that. Do not like that. Punch, 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 punch. There we go. Enjoy death. Now let's go through to the other shortcut. Ah. Gotta run. Fast as we can. And then we just run. Oh, no, no, no. Now it's, now it's going down. Now it's going down. Now it's going down. What the? Oh, good God. Okay. So, it has more ability to hit me, and among other things, I really need to go after rolling under. Going through enemy attacks. It doesn't help that I don't really have any poise right now. Hmm. Okay. Maybe a poise ring could be nice, but eh. I don't think it'll really be necessary. Okay, cool. Yeah, I... that won't make a difference, but whatever. Come on, come on. Just gotta go through, we gotta run, and just... When do you... Go, oh, roll, roll, oh, what? Roll, roll, keep on rolling. There we go, we lived. We lived. Ever so barely. Nice, you die. Roll. Nice, kill, kill. Your shield is silly. I don't like your shield. Die. Thank you, go away. Mm. Alright. Thank you, take your tranquil walk of whatever off. I promise. In Dark Souls 2, it's promise walk of peace. Fair. Yeah, I guess, but... <sighs> you get used to it fast. At the very least, the big thing is just getting used to failure and trying again. Which is... I think it's a pretty good habit to cultivate. So, we're gonna put this back out. We're gonna run through here. Try our best to not get hit this time. Let's get my blood stain, maybe. Hi, just out of the way of that, and then just out of the way, and come on, come on, just roll, 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 and there we go. Nice. We, oh, we. I thought we would be. We couldn't roll under. Dumb, dumb. Whatever. Okay. Bye. Did the store to take longer that time, or was it just me? It's not like my ADP could have gone down. Mm. <clears throat> Might be human after your time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's not that much difference, but okay. <clears throat> the more health we have at maximum, the harder it will be for Blue Raspberry Smelter Team to one-shot us. So let's take advantage of that. Oh, and the funny summon signs are showing up again. Whatever. Hmm. <laughs> Okay. You know, if nothing else, no matter how badly this goes, I have Arlequino drip marking tomorrow to look forward to. Come on, just roll, 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 roll. Keep on rolling, keep on rolling. Just keep on rolling, and that's the thing. Thank you, thank you. Oh, hi. Just stay out of the way of that, bro, don't you? Out of the way of that. Oh, but you're slowed down, too. Hi. Just die, die, die. Die, die. What, what? Oh, please. That kills me, I swear. Please, just... Out of the way of that, and thank you, thank you. Die, die, your boy's broken, and now you're dead. Cool. The only thing left is gonna be... I gotta kill the... Fume Sorcerer in here before it ganks me. Hi! Hello. Die, die, die. And just roll. Before you backstab me and kill. Kill. There we go. Okay, cool. Up a little. A little bit more than we probably should have had to. Well, I... That would be nice. But... To quote... Forget who, whose lot was, but... The purpose of a system is what it does. So if saying die, die, die makes me die instead of my enemies die... Then I've actually wished the other thing into existence, no matter how much I might, uh, might like to deny it. Hi, okay, and just punch you out, punch you out. Oh well, die. Oh, one more, one more, one more. There we go. It didn't even send the lightning down. Astrologist gauntlets. What is, what is that? Let's see. Astrologer. Astrologer's gauntlets. Are they hitting me? 
I don't think they are. Astrologer's Gauntlets. So much stuff. What is that gonna say? All the way up here. In Melfia, magical power, special heavenly alignment. Can't pull magic out of the sky, new and very useful magic devices. I guess. Maybe. I'm not sure it's making much of a difference. We'll see. Let's go down here now. Let's actually just check real quick to see if there aren't any other pathways to go through. Yep, that's it. Okay, cool. Actually, what I should do is... Got a chime. Put a great magic barrier at my earliest convenience. Here we go, for offer dash. Yeah, basically. Well, hi. Hello. Left a butthole. Oh, because you have to go left to... Funny. Come on, come on. Just out of my way, out of my way. Die. Die. Just away from that, away from that. Die. Oh, oh, please. I should dash back and then quickly... And quickly flash slit, I guess. Cool. Come on, come on. I'm getting cornered. Don't like that, don't like that. Not good, not good. Come on, just out of my way, out of my way, out of, out of the way, out of the way. Punch. The big issue is that they're just so unpredictable. Anytime they attack, they can really go for one, two, or three. And if you don't go immediately after they finish their attack, they'll just hit you again. You really have to be smart. Which is not my strength. Okay, well, let's go down here with the... Oh, well, we got that. Hi. Three magic barrier and... Let's see. Oh, bro. that hit me. Oh, good god. Let's go through. Can I do it? Can I do it? I can. Okay, good. Raspberry smelter. Raspberry. Oh, please. Oh, this is damage is quite good, actually. Oh, come on. The funny thing is, is that his tells are all wrong. This one's tells are all wrong. It's supposed to mess you up from fighting the first one. Luckily, my damage is good. You can also get a blue smelter sword this way. Gonna explode, or...? Okay, you only explode initially. Good. Hi. Interesting. Come on, come on, come on. Please. Hit! Oh, come on. Just die. Well, that didn't explode. Good. Oh, but we've also got got some healing. Oh, well, I should break magic barrier again real quick. Come on, come on. Just... Oh, but... What? Alright. Please, please. Oh! Out of the way. Out of the way. Out of the way. Ooh, ooh. I'm not even sure he's dealing magic damage. Come on, come on. Thank you, I'll try. No promises. It's getting hard. Explode, maybe? Maybe. Oh, you got a half. Mm. Alright. Just... Please, please. Rock might not be such a good idea. Not be such a good idea. I just one, two, and a slam. Let's just punch you out, punch you out. A few more hits. Come on. Ooh, okay. And just... Oh, and it's kind of going in a swirl. Oh, that's cool. Oh, nice, nice, maybe. Come on, just die. Ooh, we're out of magic barriers. Oh, please. Just... Oh, is that going to explode? I hope not. Chug my Estus. Okay. Only got a bit left. We just gotta be smart about this. Not my strength, not my strength. Okay, just punch. One, two. Oh! Oh, there we go. Come on, come on. What are you gonna do this time? I don't think you can burn out, right? There we go. Oh, but. Is that gonna explode or. No, good. That's good. One, two. Nice, and roll and slam. There we go. Cool. One, two. Come on, just roll. That was narrowly death. Nice, and die, die. No more hits. Just got to roll to the side. And there we go, and roll. Roll to the side, and just punch, punch. There we What? Huh? You were one hit away from death. Oh, you're kidding me. Stupid. It's the dumbest thing I've seen all day.
Well, so I gotta be aggressive and also no magic berry until he's at least actually buffed himself. annoying thing is honestly just <clears throat> how the sorcerers cast tranquil promise walk piece on you literally just to waste your time no other reason come on just out of my way out of my way out of my way oh what what please 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 just roll, roll. what what the? oh kill yourself the actual hell chips without using your hands is hard. <clears throat> it's just... The big issue is just I ran out of Estes. And... Uh, so I had to go in without full health in that one final phase. Is that... It was a hard attack, but it wasn't an actual one tap. I would have survived otherwise. Hi. Guy. Can't run. Can't run. Uh, I die. Go away. Mm -hmm. So they're Melfians. So they aren't using miracles, or at least they shouldn't be. Hi. Punch. 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 There we go. Easier than I expected. Cool. And just that out of the way. Okay. Gotta roll, we gotta run. Ugh. Shouldn't be too bad, but still. Alright, just. What, what, what? Roll, roll. And just go down, go down. Didn't get hit too much, which should be fine. Where's the other. Is there another one? Was there even. Oh, it would have been the other way. Okay, cool. So now we just run. Don't have to deal with anything else. Oh, I should have just. I should have used a life gem. There was no reason not to. Oh, what? Okay, whatever. Come on, come on, just die. Die. Cool. Now we just, we Estus up and then we punch. Cool. Hi. Talzer, alright. I thought you were right. Can't do an explosion yet, but just. No, you can. Okay. Weird. So that attack is not safe. Hmm. -mm. Come on, come on. Let's pop it. Pop it. Just one. Punch. Just a couple. Oh, well, alright. That delay's not fun. Oh, well, okay. Good time to magic barrier, I guess. Cool. Okay. Come on, just. And, oh! Heal and punch. Nice. Okay, well. Even if the telehab is really annoying, I can at least actually deal with that response. Hi! Just do not need to stay on your tail if you're gonna blow up like that. Hi! Then we gotta... Yep, stay aggressive. One, two. One and two. Nice. One. Let's see if this stamina wave an attack. Oh, okay, well, alright. Just pass this again then. Nice. Well, maybe that was a little too early. Hi. Launch. Roll. Roll. Okay. Slam. Stay out of the way of that. So you don't explode and kill me. Yep, see? Okay. Cool. Actually, I could get one hit in and run away, probably. Hi. Nice. And launch. Oh, please. One. Two. Two. Oh, okay. Nice. Launch. One. Two. Strike. One. Two. And... Oh, okay. That delay was... So it's a variable delay, too. Oh, that sucks. Hi. Run. The thrust is the easiest to counter by far. 
and just one punch roll or I guess you don't stay too long I don't have to worry but still oh I needed to I need to use spell cords come on let's actually equip that spell cords plus no 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 spell cords plus three cool nice there we go okay all right that was that was what I was missing the entire time and punch. Okay, cool. How much more Estus do I need? This could be a good time to heal up a little. Come on, just... Ooh, not a fun spot to be in. Hi. Hello. Blueberry. Blueberry. Punch. Roll. Oh, well, alright. Come on, just... You did, yep, you did explode. That probably would have gotten me if I hadn't pulled away. Just gotta do this, gotta do it. Punch. Did take a decent amount of poise damage there. Could have gone for a few more. I should have gone for a few more. Punch. Two. Okay. And just whoop. Nice. Explode. Thank you. So this is an opportunity to punch, actually. Punish the explosion. Oh well, okay, alright. You explode, we'll punish your explosion. Thank you. Cool. One, two. It's gotta be smart about this. I do not want to be greedy. Well, dumb, dumb, dumb. Come on, just out of the way, out of the way, and heal. Well, oh! That was agonizing. It's just. All those delays. That's dirty. Having fought him before was hardly any help at all. Well, okay. Really no bloodstain to worry about anymore. In its own way, it's freeing. In its own kind of way. Go through, no summoned help, I'm not a cheater. Well, it's not cheating, but... It's not my style. <clears throat> okay. Well, alright, and just... Hello, hello, and just roll, 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 roll. There we go, actually. That was nice. Hi. Punch. 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 Don't hit me too much. Goodbye, enjoy death. There we go, goodbye. Okay. Hopefully we'll get another bonfire after this fight. That would be nice. It would make the existence of this place justified. I'm almost certain there is, but can't be sure until I actually see it, you know. Show me. <coughs> so after the second buff is when we need to go for it. That's when we need to go for it. Oh, what, what, what? Oh, please. Roll, roll, what, what? Oh, roll. And if I get hit by the final one, I'm just dead. So I can't go anywhere near the center, center lane. Okay. Seal protection might honestly be more useful than spell quartz, actually. We'll see. But actually, Vanquishers, soldiers. Actually, I should just put Ring of Blades in there. I don't need Royal, Royal Soldiers Ring when I'm not wielding any weapons. Alright. Vanquishers, we got Spell Quartz. We're alright. Mm -hmm. Just gotta avoid that center aisle. That is what lets the thing hit me. Come on, come on, just out of, out of, what? Okay, we got through, we got through. It was very narrow, it was very narrow. Come on, come on, just... If that kills me, if that kills me... What? How did that actually kill me that time? What kind of RNG is that? Smug walk. Go to hell. Ah. I 
every time you die, you lose a little bit of your max health. Mm-hmm. Okay. We are just gonna go through. We're gonna try our best. Try again. I at least need to beat Fume Knight today. I really do. I mean, an hour left or so. <clears throat> We're right. We have access to Alonzo armor. Shouldn't be that bad. Can't imagine it'd be that terrible. I just... There we go. And I think... I think I could actually roll under. Even if I couldn't normally hit. We'll see. I just... There we go. And just out of my way. Out of the way. Do not need that to hit me. Hi. Just... And of course you got the blinding bolt. Die, die. Good. If that had still managed to hit me even though I killed him. <sighs> okay. Let's just... Hit the fume sorcerer. Come on, and just roll. Roll, backstab. Okay, cool. One more time, one more time. Got more crap to deal with. Okay. Oh, but actually, no, that's that's much later. Honestly, I should just take more barrier. I can't actually use magic berry for anything. I mean, great for anything. What the? Kill yourself! What is even going on? I thought I wouldn't be able to go through you. How do you line up like that? Six like left is the only option, otherwise they'll flip off and block you. It is insane <clears throat> that the two worst boss runs in the game are both Smelter Demon. You wouldn't think it'd be possible. Alright. Oh, we got... No, nah, no. Nah. No, thank you. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. As on the first try, we actually got really close. And then it just only got worse. Hi, hi. Roll, roll. What, 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 what? Oh. Kill yourself. Just kill me already. I don't care. There's no good way to stay out of the way of a fireball. I guess I'd have to time a roll or something, but still. <clears throat> this is... Iron Passage does not need to exist. Why does this place exist? Honestly, I might prefer trying my luck doing the normal boss run. Going all the way. Said that would mean having to deal with dodging that... Believe me, smelter guy from even farther away. It's not fun. Come on. What? How do you block me like that? Oh, kill yourself. How did it hit me on the other side of the wall? Well, I guess it makes sense. It's a fireball. should be able to go through the walls, but it's just... It seems to be so much luck involved. You rather actually line up in a way that you can actually get past it. So stupid. Just, why? Why? At this point, yeah, it's just, the shortcut is a nice concept, but if I can't actually make it, I'm better off not trying in the first place. Come on, just go through. Don't need that bloodstain. Die. And I think that's increasing attack damage cost, maybe. Okay, die. Well, at least we didn't die. Well, oh, and it wouldn't let me switch correctly because the... Oh, they dropped Kythus gems? That's funny. Whatever. If I actually die to one of the... Come on, come on. And just roll, roll. If that had got a backstab off of me and killed me, I would have not been happy. Okay. Well, whatever. Splash foot again. Pull that. Go left, go left. Keep rolling. Just... How am I supposed to... Go through this. What? Oh, you're kidding. What? What? You're... Nonsense. Nonsense. What? I don't... care anymore. 
I am not interested in the shortcut. I'm just gonna run past the, past everything and probably not repeat this fight on New Game Plus. Oh, but the issue is, is that I actually exchanged the other smelter sword. So if I wanted two, I'd need to uh, kill it at least one more time. Go to hell. Well, whatever. Time to go around the long way. Cause I'm not good enough for the shortcut. It's not lucky enough. What the? Uh, kill yourself. Oh, and we're oh, and they've actually they're they're slowing me down. They're deliberately slowing me down. Stupid sorcerers! Who let you who let you do such a thing? Come on. Just how can it hit me from so far away? It's not something you can do, right? Ah, uh, stupid. Don't go through there, they'll slow you down and try to stop you from even entering the arena. So nice. Yeah, but yeah, still protection might actually be a better bet than... Oh, no, not even power stance. Come on. Stupid. One. Two. Didn't hit. Oh, but Ring of Blades is actually making a very big difference. That's nice. Yeah, because they're not strong hits to begin with. So, Ring of Blades is really good. And just punch. Yeah, that that's good. Come on, come on. And then we are going to Magic Bear once you buff a second time. This one buffs a lot earlier too. That's the thing. I just roll, punch, roll. Actually, going for that is probably a good idea. One, two, and overhead. Slam, roll, roll, run, go back, hit. There we go. So the strategy's more or less worked out. Okay. Cool. Get a buff again, or. Let's just heal up. Okay. Come on, come on, are you gonna buff? We are going to buff. This would be a good time to magic barrier, just in case. You buff so quickly and early. Dumb. One, two, and... Oh, well, alright. Punch, roll, just in case. Punch the explosion, if you do the explosion, but you didn't do the explosion. Alright, one, two, and overhead, slam, whatever. Dumb. Heal. Just before you do something else. Hi, one, two, and roll, and punch, roll. Oh, well, that knocked me away, but it doesn't kill, hurt me, actually. One, one, punch, roll, and oh, well, that actually, oh, so it's about iframing it. Okay, cool. Nice, and one, punch, one, two, one, two, there we go, and one, two, and roll. Punch. Nice. This isn't bad, it's... The boss run is by far the worst part of this. That's just magic barrier up, and... Cool. Nice. One. Two and... Punch. Come on. One. Oh, what? How am I just... Not hitting anything? Yeah, that roll is... The dumbest part of this game by far. Roll. Oh, well, I tapped it too early then. Hi. Nice, and just roll. And hit. Come on, come on. Oh, that's gone. Okay, cool. And roll. Oh, well, whatever. This shouldn't be a death sentence. Hopefully. Come on, come on, just... Let's... Oh, nice! Let's actually just life gem it up. Life gem and roll. Ooh, ooh, come on, come on. Spell Quartz is making a big difference, but it's not going to save me if I'm not smart about it. We need to S this up. Come on. There we go. One, two. There we go. And one, two. One, two. One more. One more. One more will do it. Oh, what? Okay, cool. Kill, kill. There we go. Finally, Blueberry dead. 
Alright. Another smelter demon soul. Tears, yes. I did it. Me too. Hard to believe. Defeat, but hurrah for victory. Hurrah for victory. Pointless, but hurrah for bravery. Yeah, it's just, is there another something past here? Well, clearly there's something here, but Pharaoh's Mask. Pharaoh's Mask. Let's see. What was that? Kind of like the... Oh, okay. Pharaoh's is contraption. Trenching its wearer. Perplexing to reason men. This mask is no exception. Oh, so that actually keeps you permanently wet for the sake of... For the sake of... And what should I also... I guess steel protection could be good. That and blades... This fume knight's gonna be mostly physical. And some dark and fire, but whatever. But apparently drenches you with water, which could help with resisting fire. Yeah, whatever. Just gonna Oh, but it's already down. Okay, cool. Come on, come on. So where are we gonna go? Where are we gonna go? Oh. Well. If they were nice, they'd give us another bonfire. And I did it. Victory visions of pointless, visions of fatigue. Bravery, hurrah for victory. So, is this... Wait. I did it. Where did this send me? Oh, wait. There was literally nothing? Oh, you're kidding me. Okay. Well, we got another smelter demon soul, and we can... Level up with those souls, I guess. I just, I guess it just existed as a bonus challenge. It's not horrible. Well, it's just a bit more attunement, no more slots, one more HP. But, but, we can. Let me see, how much to level? We need almost 60,000. Okay, well. One soul of a great hero, and then one soul of a proud knight. That should do it. Oh, actually, we need let's use another. This should be level two. Your side focus fully wired. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We need more strength, and that will slightly increase my physical power. Very slightly. Okay, cool. Let's go back to the room tower. Back to the foyer. The bond foyer. Then go kill Fume Knight. I think. Fighting him barehanded is bad enough. I don't even know if fighting him with The idle up is even going to be possible. Should get two more once. It's one more once it's done. And then. How many soul fragments do I have? I have eight. And I have two more wedges. So we'll get some more from somewhere. Somewhere. Mm -hmm. Alright. Okay, so that's over there. We got more stuff over that way. That was. One of them was a way to Iron Passage. This was it. This was the way to Iron Passage. I spent so much time getting ganked, I've lost all my sense of self and knowledge. But no, seriously, at least Cave of the Dead gave you a shortcut to Dark Greatsword. Iron Passage was just, I hope you enjoy dying and then getting spit out where you came from. The definition of insult to injury. Apparently even stayed on there for any time. Whatever. We're just gonna run past, we're gonna run past him, we're gonna go down to the bottom. We're gonna fight Fume Knight. I'm gonna try it one time with the idol still up, and if that doesn't work, I'm just gonna use it and say screw it. Say screw it. Again, fighting Fume Knight with literally just hands would be bad enough already. I don't need to make my life any harder. Come on, come on. 
Alright, so now go in circles, go in circles, go down here and... Hello, hello! What? Oh, interesting. Let's just... Let's see all the way of you. Let's just run, run, run. So I guess the final bonfire is just gonna be close... Close fume night. Makes sense. But yeah. Old Iron King is gone, so... Rain became the fume night. Hmm. So we gotta bring this back up then. Funny lever. Oh well. How far are they gonna come over here? How far? Please, please. Got a decent amount of life gens, a good amount of Estus, and... So they stop at this elevator room. They didn't want to make the... Did not want to make the boss run any worse than... Oh, I think the reason... It doesn't really matter. Maybe it was different in the original DS2, but... Since they raise it up, you can kind of juke them around, and... Maybe that was actually make it harder for the player. Eh, whatever. In that case, we're just gonna head straight for Fume. We have we need four more Ashen Idols. Whatever. Enter the mess. Hello. Hi, Fume. Hello. Nice, funny sword. Interesting. The ones on the side of the arena are the ones we have to deal with. Oh, actually, that's not bad. Oh, but the... Oh, the... Come on, come on. Just... The Estus in there is... Oh, you are crazy. That healing effect is not great to deal with. Come on, come on. We just gotta... Oh, come on. That'd be very aggressive. Super aggressive. These two attacks are pretty well telegraphed. Come on, come on. Out of the... Ooh, ooh. Nice. Heal. Oh, you are... It's not horrible. Now your sword is broken, which actually... Yeah, I can't do this. This is not going to be an option. Hi, heal. Come on, come on. Just out of the way, out of the way. This is already back to full. Only a truly heroic level of aggression would allow me to do anything to him. Okay, whatever. Hi, just out of the way then. Okay, goodbye. Cool. Alright, Sam, so just... Thank you for your mind. In that case, yep, we are gonna go around and use my remaining two smelter wedges on the ones outside the arena. Okay. Okay. Hmm. So that means I must have missed one somewhere. I'm not sure where that would have been. So there are... Decent number of pieces left. Oh, depending on how many I used, I might have. Oh, I might actually have to deal with a slight warmth effect. Big thing is that it seems that the more there are around his arena, the faster his effect will proc. So getting rid of the ones I should see should hopefully help, but we'll see. Hmm. After few night, then it would be Sirlon. Then next time it'll be all the pain and suffering of Ilium Royce. All right, all right, cool. Just gotta keep on rolling, keep on going down. Make sure that you don't fall all the way initially. Hi, okay, cool. Come on, just how are we gonna do this? Well, luckily, if we just run past you, you can't attack fast enough to really be a threat. But there has to be another bonfire somewhere. It could just be the one from the yeah, post fume night one, but still. Hmm. Alright. Go down here, we're gonna pull up the lever, and. Okay. Come on, come on. Honestly, I've got so many Twinkling Titan Knights. I should honestly just upgrade my armor pieces. I've got, I've got 36. That would be a very serviceable amount. Okay, 16 and then. I got five more. Taking charred waste at least. Taking it a plus four would be more than serviceable for what I need it for. It's about waiting for any of the right crown and then maybe upgrading with that. Hmm. 
Okay, cool. You're over here, and hi. This is the one right by the arena. So are all these ones going to heal him, or... Well, we'll see. Goodbye, goodbye. Nice. Oh, but I think... I think that... That one's got a warmth effect, too. Hi. Oh, well. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, I might have messed that up. I think I messed that up. Because if there's one more soul left... One more left. Okay. <clears throat> yep, because I think that one over there was the last one I needed to get, so I've just been silly with it. No, actually, I think... Oh, but there is one more. There is just one more. Oh, this? Wait. Oh, but there's a bonfire right over here. Cool. Okay, nice. It's just lowermost floor, lowermost floor. Oh, well, I got a... It's hardly a boss run at all. Okay. Mm -mm. Yep, I'll get another smelter wedge at the end, but for now, I'm going to need to actually fight with... <laughs> one down. That is... Certainly something. I was not as prudent at saving my smelter wedges as I should have been. So I guess this kind of counts. This is going to be Fume Knight while well, Fume Knight has healing. Ah, uh, whatever. Whatever. It's such a hilarious thing to thing for them to do too. Item ahead and solve a brave war. If only it was a smelter wedge, then they would really love me. And I would really love them. Oh, okay. We're gonna go in and we're gonna fight Fume. We're gonna get our butts pounded in repeatedly. And he's gonna have some healing. Yep. Okay. Cool. Nice. Alright. Hold on. Hold on. And just whoop. Whoop, whoop. Just one. One. Oh. Oh. Come on. Just out of the way. Oh, but it's about spacing. If I space too correctly, I don't think it'd be an issue. Two and punch. Yeah, you have to get close enough to Make that work. Oh, well. That's one heck of a hitbox. Hi. Okay, interesting. So very obviously, that attack is triggered by me using... Using a... Using an Estus Blast. Hmm. Well... Time to use an effigy. It's one boss down at least. <clears throat> Seriously. Iron Passage is goofy. It's not expecting that much pain and suffering. I expected it at least to leave me somewhere useful. Didn't. Oh, we can summon Garhelion for this? Oh, that's crazy. Wow. This is going to be the end. This is going to be the final four. We can punch him out and just... Hi. Nice. Interesting. He was kind of moving around. So if we keep you over here, we should actually be able to deal with this just fine. Nice. And... Oh, thrust. Hi. So slow and steady wins the race here. Nice. Oh, okay. He actually rolled under that. Fine. Oh, okay. Fine. Let's just S this up and just heal. Heal. Nice. Catch him in a mid attack animation. Don't have to worry as much about him punishing. Oh, please. Come on. Keep him over on this side of the arena. You don't have to deal with healing. So I guess this, this was kind of the intention that you would have to deal with him doing a bit of his healing. Cool and just nice. Come on. This is a hard fight. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you're gonna buff, buff, maybe. Heal, heal. <clears throat> gonna dash at me or. Nice. Cool. 
One, two, one, two. Come on, come on, and just <coughs> out of the way of that. Out of the way of that. One, two, oh, oh, okay. Fun. Nice. Punch a bit more. Oh, interesting. Now you're buffing. And of course, the nature of your buff is getting rid of your small sword. Fun. Nice. Oh, Toho. Come on, come on. Oh, oh, oh. Don't like that. And just heal. No. Oh, that was narrowly not alive. Ooh. Oh, wow, that was fast. Alright. So we know what we're doing now. I just have to be very, very conservative. Well, I gotta stay on him, but I gotta make sure that... I have enough stamina to dodge a full string of attacks whenever he does anything, really. Well, we're in the end game now. Big thing is just going to be making sure that he stays away from the one idol that will actually heal him. Hello, hello. Come on, come on. Run in, run in, punch. There we go, cool. Did a bit of damage to you. Nice. And oh, right, that, that smack. Which will keep you from going into your other phase. What? What? Huh? That's some aggression. Heal, heal. What are we gonna do now? One, two, punch. One, two. And that was it. Cool. Come on, come on. Big sword, small sword. One, one, two. Come on, come on. Imagine if I was fighting him up. You're getting plus. Oh, okay. Big hit. One, two, and there we go. Uppercut. Did not like that. Not like that all that much. Hi. Roll. Roll, and that was it. Kind of, or... Okay, well, whatever. And that's an opportunity to heal. As in his parry stance. Yeah, you just heal. Come on, just... Ah, oh, none of those hit. Weird. Come on. Swing's the big attack. You can only do that once. This in phase one. Come on, come on. Life gems might actually be better, but I can't release them. What? That hit me? Come on, heal, heal. Nice. You're gonna charge here. One, two, and roll. Nice. Two, and one. Two, and what? Ooh, whatever. Um, okay. Crazy fight. Heal. So much just out of my way. Oh, 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 please. Come on, just... What are you doing? What are you doing? And just... Well, okay. Come on, just out of my way. How did that... Okay. Insane fight. Most people do agree that this is the most difficult fight in Dark Souls 2. Okay. I'm just doing this with without even having a weapon. Just your hands. And your hands suck. And also, they don't always even hit. <sighs> okay. Alright. That blood stain doesn't really matter. What matters is punching. Hi, okay. Not a bit down. It's just, maybe going for the strong attack might actually be better. Hi. Uh, it's not. It's definitely not. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Cool. Punch. Just... Oh, hello. Oh Let's just heal. Good opportunity. Decent enough opportunity. A little bit of extra fire damage from that. 
attacks. The disjoint on that attack that screws me. Come on, come on. Roll and heal. Oh, well. I didn't actually get that input off. Hi. Heal. Okay. Come on. It's just the timing of everything. Can we... Oh, well. That didn't do anything. I mean, it makes sense that you can't really guard rate with the sword. Hi. What? Oh, please. Just... And that still hit me. That's what happens when you step forward, I guess. Easy. Honestly, I feel like... And this might not be the time to talk about this. I feel like there's a high chance... of Capitano being Varka, because Capitano looks like the Fume Knight, and wielding greatsword with a longsword in a way similar to the Fume Knight is explicitly a Knights of Avonia spine style. I mean, just, just look at him. He's pretty Fume Knight coded. Come on, come on, just one, two, one, two, we're actually, okay, one, ooh. In a way that cannot afford to get too aggressive. This is when we heal. Oh, all right. Oh, we actually got that off. Oh, come on. What the? Oh, heal. Mm, I cannot afford to waste these opportunities and just roll. Nice. So he always goes for two sword attacks. And that still hit me. Dumb. Just heal. That did get me good. Using up my Estus so fast. Hi, more on two, and no extra attack after that. Can only afford to go for a couple. Hi, and then just what? Okay. So after the thrust, he always seems to do a big slam. Okay, cool. Two, and punch. Oh, what? Whatever. Come on, just. Okay. You are insane. One, two, oh. Oh, I rolled under that somehow. Hi. Hello. Hello. Still on this side of the arena, cannot actually use the entirety of the arena in this fight. Otherwise, I'll get absolutely slammed by that attack. Hi. One, two, three, and. Are we barely out of the way? One, two, and here we are. Come on, come on. One, two. One, two. And. Oh, oh. So he doesn't always do that slam, but this time he did. So we're at half Estus. Oh, don't like that. Come on. Are you any stronger in how? Oh, okay. Luckily, dodging actually isn't that bad here. Oh, okay, cool. Nice. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do now? Familiarizing yourself with your new moveset! New moveset! Okay, heal. Mmm, okay. Nice. Oh, well. I have to roll around that. Heal. Ooh. Now you're... something. This is certainly new. This actually isn't bad. Always break. Hi, and just. Oh, come on, just out of the way of that. Thank you, thank you. I'm over here. We're actually rolling under it immediately. Works pretty well. Nice. Roll towards the thrust. One, two, and one. Ooh, okay. Please, please. One. Nice. So actually, you can't really roll through all that easily. Two, and... Oh, please. We need one more. One more. And one more. Oh, we rolled the wrong way. But hey, we did pretty well. This is indeed a very, very difficult fight. Hmm. Well, actually... Any buffs? I should cast Great Magic Barrier. 
That's what I should do. The blood's at 34%. Okay. Okay. Alright. So it's there, and there aren't really any other buffs that come to mind. I guess actually, you know what? Flash sweat. Flash sweat would work good. Work pretty well, because it. <sighs> do wonders. Because it. <sighs> I wonder how much of his buff is dark and how much is fire, and that's the thing. Because if it was mostly fire, then flash would be really good. If it wasn't, I wouldn't be able to do all that much. The splash would be good with fire, but it wouldn't do anything for the dark. <clears throat> Magic Bear would do some for all of it, but not all that much. Why? Right. Okay, so. Punches, punches. There we go. Cool. That destroy. Oh, hi. What are you gonna do? Hi. Roll and just heal. Honestly, the speed on phase one kind of makes it harder, in a certain sense. It's just resource management and attrition. And only one of those hit, come on. Please, and now you've actually delays phase two. Oh, that sword is up. Hi. Come on, just... Oh, hold on. Oh, what? Right. Come on, just... Please, please, you Crazy fight. Crazy fight. Oh, that hit me anyway. I didn't- I rolled too soon. Nice, nice, and what are you gonna do? Hi. And you're gonna do that again. Is that gonna last? Oh, oh, okay. Oh, we still got a good amount of healing. Nothing crazy, but still. Hi. And then just... What are you gonna do? One, two, oh, or... Alright. Come on, come on. Heal. Oh, well. Thanks. There we go, and... Three magic barrier, and... Nice, we can just do that. Hi. Okay, cool. Magic barrier, and... Oh, please, please. Roll, and heal. This is... Could be good, depending on how long we have. Hi. Punch, punch. Interesting, and... Go out of the way. That wasn't bad at all. Roll. One, and how many more? Oh, we can do that. Nice. So while you're healing, we can do that. Oh, okay, so there's actually a shockwave there. Did not know that. Hmm. All right, and just roll. Roll or not, or not. Come on. Come on. One, two, and... Okay, actually, that was fine. Hi, and... Oh, please. Do not keep getting healed. Do not keep getting healed. You need to stay over here. He's got so much of his health back! Uh -huh. Come on, come on. Just one! And hit. Uppercut was not great. Please. One! And let's see how much of a combo we do. Luckily, it's somewhat slower. Somewhat. One! Two! And heal. Okay. As long as we can bait his attack, we can heal decently. One. Okay, nice. One. Two. And punch. What? Okay. Ooh, so that, that isn't a safe punish. We mm. this West left. Nice, we can roll under that with very precise timing. One. Nice, and... Mm. Come on, come on, just... There we go. One, two. Ooh. Nice, and... Mm. The timing on that is... awful. Please, please. Oh, please, it just... What? how that hit me? Are you kidding? Well, we did well. If he hadn't gone to the healing spot, we, we might have won. Maybe. Tom. <sighs> okay.
No matter how bad this gets, and mind you, it has gotten pretty bad, I am not summoning. I have to win or lose under my own power. It's going to be funny to see how hard Sirlan is. I am not going to be able to do the no hit. Okay, okay. Good thing that at least most of them are gone. Hi. And just out of my way, out of my way. It's just one, two, and what? And swing, punch, one. Okay, cool. Only one hit in for combo. Everything else is completely unsafe. Oh, I should have seen that coming. One, two, and punch. Come on, come on, and one. Roll, roll. And when you do your counter stance, we'll just... Oh, we actually beat that. We did not beat that. So your counter stance, there we go, cool. Good time to counter with a heal. We're done. Oh, oh, okay. One, oh, please. Okay, nice. Oh, but you're gonna... Not easily. One, two, and heal. There we go. Should have healed a bit more, but whatever. Whatever. And just one heal punch. Ooh, ooh okay. Come on, just one. One, two. Uh -huh. One, two, and. Are you gonna go for another one? Well, either way, we didn't have any stamina. Roll, punch. One, two, and. Punch. Maybe. Oh, bad. Bad time. Bad time. Oh, and I need to roll through that instead of away from that. Dumb, dumb, dumb. Should just let me crouch. Hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. I kind of love throwing hands. Okay, so we got at least the butt scenes here. There's barely anything there, but a few free hits, a few free hits. Nice. Come on, come on. One, and there we go, and punch. One, two, and out of the way of that. Not you get hit with the, with the fogs. An ultra great sword. Hi, one, two, and punch. Uh, miss, dumb. Punch. Still, still protection, but ah, oh, it's mostly dark. Whatever. Come on, over here, over here. One. Okay, nice. There we are, and one, two, what? Okay, please. Are you gonna? Counter stance or... Oh, please. What are you doing? Come on. Ah. One. Two. Oh, dumb, dumb, dumb. I need it to actually work. Heal, heal. Okay, cool. Nice and cool. So that triggered that stab. That stab is actually easy enough to dodge. Mm. So actually maybe rolling away might actually work better? Possibly. Actually, well... That's a left. That's a left. Come on, heal, heal. Okay. Please. Fume, fume. Hate you so much. Actually, it's a cool enough boss fight, but... Well, okay, cool. Nice, and... Run out of the way. Thanks. Let's just heal up with... Well, never mind. That was a bad idea. Ugh. Go over here. Not get healed up. Please. Please. And heal. Heal. Okay. Whatever. One. Two. And... Oh, well. Alright. Please. You gotta... Hi. Roll. And heal. Nice. And are we gonna stab? Are we gonna... Are we gonna be normal? Nice. Punch. Yeah, the particle effect makes it really hard to... Precisely dodge. Come on, come on, and just roll. Okay, cool. 
We went for a two. When you go for a slant, we know we can punish. I don't expect that. What? Two and heal, heal. One, two. What? Oh, watch. Okay, so I can never, ever, ever go for two chugs. Never. Hmm, well, that was the best of John, period. Big thing is, I tried to hit him while he was buffing, instead of just trying to put up great magic barrier. I need to do that instead, and not be stupid. It's about, ah, uh, about... It gives me more leniency when I can actually buff like that. Nice, and here we go. Get over here. One! Okay, sweep. Nice, and one, two. We're gonna stab her. Okay, one, two. Oh, well, alright. And there we go. Mm -hmm. So away from that side of the arena. Cool. And just punch. Punch you down. Hi. What? Okay. This might be bad. Might be a lot worse. One, two, and oh. Go for a big combo, please. Come on, just what? There we go. Okay. As far away enough, we can actually bait that without a lot of trouble. One, two, and what? Oh, good lord. One. Heal. Okay. That's it. There we go. That's actually a decent attack to punish, so I don't quite hate that. One, two, and one. Okay. Actually, just moving to that one up. One, two, and. Okay, please. Got to be kidding me. Got to be kidding me. God have mercy on my soul. Well, we'll keep going. We'll stay aggressive. Well, oh, okay, so actually, rolling right. One, two, and punch. Oh, oh, ooh, one. Good lord. Stay over here, don't go to that idol. One, okay, punch, punch. This is okay. This is okay. Got a decent amount of assets at least. Hi. So just heal, then roll. Go out of the way of that and just punch. What? Oh, please. One. And we slammed. Okay, cool. And just do that and then we roll. Oh, we can't roll through that. Okay. Interesting. Punch. It's not that easily. And then just. We do have power stance up, which is good. Good. And one more. Heal. Heal. Heal and just. One. Roll under. So that's probably doing it too early. No, too late instead of too early. And just one. Punch. Do not talk to the idol. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Bait. Somehow. Somehow. And heal. Heal. It's just. There's no let up. It's not let up. Okay. Come on, dark buff, dark buff. And just forward punch. Forward thrust. One, and there you go. Oh, what? Didn't know you could do that. Please, one, two, and you're gonna... Oh, that was very close. And just slam, did it. Just fine. Oh, hi. There you go, and just go through. Okay. Decent spot to be in. Just a bit more cannot afford to get overconfident. Just any mistake could get rid of all my progress. Yep, okay. Come on, just one one heal. Heal. It's a good slow attack we can counter. Just roll. Okay, punch. Come on, just one. Uh, okay, big slam, big slam. One, two, okay, die. 
What? Oh, please. I cannot afford to punish that willy nilly. Please. What are you gonna do? Punish one, two, and one. Heal, heal, heal. We're close. We're very, very close. Okay, one more should do it. Can't get overconfident. And just punch. Oh, you're insane. We beat that guy. Room D smogs. Sold the Fume Knight, sold him to Donald, yeah. Should be able to get the final Smelter Wedge pass there. Draw for happiness. Oh my goodness. And is that gonna be, it's gonna be another Shadowy Soul, right? Fume Knight, Alana. So many souls that are so dark. I mean, that is the name of the game. Hers is bigger than his. Interesting. Fume Knight that guards the dungeon of the Broom Tower. I'm actually crying. It's just the contact acting up, but. Distinguished Knight Nefantuate, the Bride of Ash, settled in this land of smoke and fog. Soul this night, numerous souls will create something of great worth. Alright, so we should be able to get something. And is this Final Smelter Ledger? Or is it the crown here, too? Well, there's the crown of the old Iron King. But where are we going to get Faint Heat and Lingers in the Ancient Crown? Hmm. It's fortune ahead. Poor you. Cause me some trouble. Oh, please. There's a sun. Let's check out Crown real quick. Do need to go back and try to beat Sir Lon, though. But I wonder, where would that last smelter wedge be? I don't have any more. Old Iron King. I actually, this is a really good one. It restores your spell uses. Scorching Iron Bet, the one whose name must never be repeated, it became Ike Rister Earth. I would assume it might be the Witch of Isil, if maybe. There's the king's name, and now we have a crown. Funny. Actually, maybe I'll not keep that until I can actually ensure that I won't go hollow. That looked nasty. It's unflattering. It's just... And I'm all out of smelter wedges. Where do we get the last one? Well... Okay. And... Level up a couple of times now. Hi! Let's actually just go hollow. We don't need to kill those guys. Just need one last smelter wedge, and if it ends up being an. Let's say there's supposed to be one more illusory wall in Broom Tower. If it has the final smelter wedge, I swear. Walls, DS2. Got. In Broom Tower, Foyer Bonfire. Mass the Hollow Skin. Going up, take another elevator. Sound of a wall opening. That's simple. That's nothing special. Okay. I mean, whatever, I guess. Let's go back to Majula real quick and spend those, but then it'll be all about finding my back. Okay. Okay. Just need to see. Smelter wedge. Where do I get the other smelter wedges? Oh, and. Yeah, one after Surlan. Oh, come on. Memory of the old Iron King, and you need the crown. Defeat Fume Knight, Ash and Mistar, Tower Key from Broom Tower. Okay, cool. Whatever. Hmm. Well, then. Alright. Hi. Oh, well. Talk to me. Bearer Gruntu. We got a bit more dexterity, a tiny bit more. On our punches, so I mean, it's it's gonna be a bit over time, but sure, let's go and beat up Sir Alon. Let's use one of these. Lots of hero souls. I really do get generous in here. Hi. Level up. And then get a bit more ADP. Oh, I need a tiny bit more. Okay. Come on, come on. Let's go and. I wonder how bad memory the old Iron King is going to be in terms of getting through. Let's use one more. Okay. In that case, we'll talk to you again and actually level up ADP. ADP and then a little bit of poison, a little bit of poise. Yeah, my lightning damage bonus is still so well dumb. 
Let's go do this. I could actually probably use some of that to upgrade armor, but I don't really care. Is it sending me to Lost Bastille? Weird. Oh, Dringlight Castle. But what is going on? Maybe just because there's one more Ferris Lockstone in there, or maybe recommending upgrading armor. I don't know. Either way, we can go back to Broom. Floor over here will be. It's gonna be one more elevator. A Roostery Wall, but then after that it's gonna be. Memory of the old Iron King time for the extra fight against Strawn. Fine. We're going down there, and we will not be able to get up there in time, will we? We will, actually. One elevator, then it's going to be a different elevator, and... Come on, come on. It's supposed to be an illusory wall somewhere. Spam the interact prompt. Come on, come on. And, oh, maybe that's the seam on the wall. Oh, yep, exactly. That seam on the wall was, in fact, something suspicious. Okay, cool. Weird. Let's go down here and go inside, slightly over. And then we get a lot of water, but also hollow skin. Some kind of... Some kind of armor. Is the skin of a hollow? That's grotesque. Mixer's robes. Oh, but it's not in any kind of meaningful order. I guess maybe because some things might have been dummied out from base. Not sure. And hollow skin, hollow skin. Infantry armor. Some kind of vaguely alphabetical order that would only make sense in Japanese, maybe. Wait, what? So. Hollow skin. Hollow skin. I assume that would maybe be Reagan's possibly? Trick blood? No. No. My, maybe my head. I should just look at this. Oh, yep, it is a head thing. Hollow skin. Imitating the head of a hollow curse resistance. Easier to detect messages. Without the important stench, deeply respect what goes last to hollow me. Well, alright. I don't know. I don't think there would really be any weapons or any spells we could really meaningfully use against Strolon. Well, whatever. We got mostly at 99, so it'd be 30 to use a sword. So we should be able to maybe get there by the end of, end of the DLC. We'll see. Travel to the other bonfire in here. Thank you, thank you. Then, of course, we'll have to destroy the final Ashen Idol. Ah, uh, being past Strahan is so silly. The tower key, we have the crown, and we have the Ashen Mist Heart. Oh, new cutscene. Fun. So, um, what I'm wondering is will there be a bonfire in here if there even has to be one? Either way, there are going to be a lot of a lot of knights on the other side. Alright, alright. Oh, baby. Oh, it's. Alright! Rougher guts. Enemy ahead. I keep forgetting that. Memories are all grayscale and bravery required ahead, and let's see, let's see. Overwhelming, therefore, try dash. Cannot reside within memory for long. There's some kind of time limit then, or why? Or, oh, baby. Okay, ooh, don't like that, don't like that. Maybe I should actually, almost certainly, most certainly use stone ring for this, actually. In that case. Yeah, okay. Oh, and salamanders. Oh, come on. Just... Thank you. Smooth and silky stone, and... Human effigy, and... Hi! Okay. Interesting. Just gonna... There we go. Thrust, and punch. And... Okay, good! So now I can reliably, even if I'm doing slight less damage, reliably keep you still. Not have to deal with any of that crap. And is there anyone chasing me now? Or now there is. Okay. What? Okay. Oh, two, two. What? Oh, please. Just hit, hit. Oh, come on. What are you doing? Heal, heal. What? Rust, rust, maybe. Ah. Oh. So yep, I really cannot be punching these guys. Or if I am, I really, really have to. Really have to lure them out one at a time. Hmm. All right. 
All right. I guess it's time for more pain and suffering. It's not gonna repeat the cutscene, will it? Well, I can skip it. Okay. And I have to load every time I go through. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. If I can wear them out one at a time, should be okay. But yeah, I might actually like to do armor stuff. Oh, it goes from grayscale to color. That's right. And that, I couldn't dodge that. Dumb. It's actually maybe a light attack and a strong attack. Speed isn't really the important thing right now, but still. Hi. Hello. Okay. Okay. So, it would have to be running, but at least once I should actually check what's inside every part of this here. Well, that's still Katana moment. Come on. Just get a thrust, or come on, just punch. And then... There we kind of go, but what speed is really, really important. I shouldn't really do that. And we got any more in here? We got any more in here? Hi. So it all aims over there at the start. Okay, cool. Punch him. Hi. Just punch over here, maybe? Let's just punch, punch, punch. There we go. There should be one more coming. But where? Be around this way, or it's here. Pick up item, arrested coin. So how well will bludgeoning damage work, in, work against them? That's the question. Hi, okay. Come on, come on. Anyone here? Anyone here? Or, oh well. Just, oh, interesting. You're, you're right there. Hi. Just, well, oh, please. Punch, punch. Oh, but I'm not actually. No, I am. I am power stancing. What's nice is that... There is literally nothing stopping from just killing them once I've gotten behind. And the big thing is honestly going to be run through, kill them that way eventually. That okay? Pillar didn't block. Dumb. Weird. Hit. 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 Die. Okay. Cool. Got a few more. Just run along, Captain. Where are you? Where are you coming from? Hi. Oh, hi! Interesting, interesting. Die. Let's just uh, screw along with this little Estus. That might suck. Let's just find a way to get through without getting hit, getting ganked. No shield either. Another dead cell mm -hmm. Alright. So you over here are actually in just... Can, oh, well, it's not hitting them. In the way. Can we lure some of you out over here? Hi. Nice. Oh, interesting. Didn't know you had a quick draw attack. Please. Oh, okay. Interesting. Punch, punch. Oh, but we can... We actually can't quiz break you. Oh, he's... Can't... Stun lock you. Hi. Well, all right. Should be somebody in here, I assume. Then and then. Hi. Anyone there? Or... Wait. Punch, punch. This is really hard to hit. But strong attack is more or less making it work. Just wondering how many. How far do I have to go? And might I actually end up getting kicked out or automatically die if I stay too long in the memory? So, there, and then we go down a level. It's gonna be there. You're gonna get ganked? Hope not. What is this? Let's see. Hole ahead. And. Hmm. Try left and then whirring it out. Left and then. Wait. Oh, hi! Interesting. Break you. Break. Break. Oh, oh. Dumb, 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 dumb. Die, die, die. Ooh, heal, heal. For you. Do anything too rash or risky. One, two, one, two, one, two. Oh, goodness. It's just... Oh, I got a black steel katana. Not that that really means anything at this point. And I could wield it. It's just... Why would I? 
It's not that good. Oh, 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 shooting, shooting at me. Hi. You're over there, and... Oh, interesting. Oh, please. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Come down here, come down here. You gonna fall down, or how are you gonna get up here? So I assume you're gonna be trying to kill me. So, oh, oh, hi. Come over here. I don't bite, I only punch. Come around the corner. Don't try to, don't try to ambush me. It's my job. Hi. Just punch you. Yep, yep, there we go. Nice. Okay. Don't have that many flasks to deal with Sir Alon, but whatever, whatever. Where is this going to take me? This is Lyra Head. Yep, no. Illusory Wall. May as well upload that for the sake of, sake of the people. Public benefit. So wait, up there is, oh, that would probably be the way back. This over this way is, oh, a plus seven twin blade. I think I can wield the twin blade by now, but again, it's just, at this point, what would the benefit be? Come on, come on. This, to go around this way, or? I should just be using things other than as sister heal. Oh, what? Okay. Come on, come on, just die. Die. Die, die. Nice. Right, pick up item and it's gonna be another black silk tonic. Oh, nice. Hi. Oh well. Got your funny bow. Let's just run over. I'm gonna shoot and well we can just punch you. Thanks, thanks. Die. Oh, you're here too. Annoying. Ah. Oh, get out of my way. Get out of my way. And die, die, die. Dum, dum, dum. So little Estus left. I'm probably gonna end up burning through most of it just to kill Sir Alon. Well, you know, whatever. Two, three, okay. If I quit out in a memory area, I wonder if I would still be in the memory area when I got back in. That's the question. So I do kind of need to pee. Okay, well should be maybe two areas that lead me back up. Hmm. Still want to fall down. That's the question. This leads up here. Seems that most of them have gone down, actually. Oh, so they weren't Alon captains. There was only one Alon captain. That's good. That is... Is that the way? Let's see. So over here is... A tiny bit of fall damage. That's what's there. And over here is... What? Oh, just another way back up. Okay. I didn't want to fall down all that much. So we're just gonna fight him. I hope he isn't much harder than Fume Knight. Can't imagine what that would be like. Here. Clanking of armor. Alright. Guess we gotta do this. And there he is. Hi. Hello. So roll on. What a guy. Oh, what? Excuse me? Come on and just- what? Please heal. Oh, oh! You are fast. Oh, oh. This? This might require some pulling off. Well, yeah, just insanely quick. And you can do some kind of dark move? Okay, that EI slash is ridiculous. Huh? Excuse me. Heal, heal. Luckily... Uh, not sure I want to use a life gem here. Okay, so as soon as that tail comes out, you need to, you need to immediately just... Ooh, ooh, okay. Come on, just... And just... That... What? Huh? Okay. Oh, and that... That buffs him? Oh, you're kidding me. Feel... Insane. Alright. 
Alright. Well, now I know how this works. So really do not get hit by that thrust. The nice thing is that once you got a sword, you can actually do that buff yourself. But instead of stabbing someone else, you have to stab yourself. It's great. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, all we gotta do is run through and try not to die. Lots and lots of very annoying knights. Hi, just out of the way, out of the way. Come on, just... It's just out of the way of that, and... Come on, come on, just out of the way, out of the way. Come on, come on, just... There's a hole. Oh, we have to fall down the hole and not die, not die. Fall down the hole and not die. If you're gonna chase me, you're going to chase me, that's for certain. But, oh, but to kill the... Oh, you have to... Oh, oh, oh. Well, actually... You're staying away. Kind of. Kind of. Kind of. Kind of. Okay, cool. How far are you gonna go? How far are you gonna chase me? Okay, cool. Every single knight in this game is trying to kill me. Well, in this in this area, in this area. Not the game. That's that's an exaggeration. Come on, just Oh, every time we wanna fight Sir Alon, we need to run and just try our best. Oh please. We need to Sail away those bows and just go through and are we gonna get gotten? No we aren't. Okay, cool. Hi. Nice. And if you do your EI slash, we just Nice and cool. Alright. Decent about souls. Mm -hmm. Oh okay, as soon as he does that, he's gonna dash and it's gonna absolutely slaughter me. Okay, cool. Nice. Nice. And... What? Ooh, okay. So annoying. Nice, we can punch you. But it's... Oh, please. So sometimes he goes slow, sometimes he, he goes fast. Heal. Okay. It's the last this moment. Oh, no! I couldn't dodge that. Dumb. Okay, well, alright. More damage, more bleed, but... Uh, I mean, it will go away eventually, right? Mm, but so fast, I only deal a tiny amount of damage on any time I hit. Uh, can't reliably land multiple hits. Just jumps back as soon as I hit him. Please, and heal. You are. Oh, well, sometimes there's a delay. Fine! And heal. Come on, just... Alright. Okay. So fighting Sir Olan barehanded is going to really suck. Because not only is he just a very difficult boss, but... Oh, actually, actually, I shouldn't be using a power stance attack. I should just hit him with one hit. Because I can't reliably hit with two. Which means that as meager as the difference is going to be, I'm going to deal more damage hitting with one single smack than any other source. Hi. Let's what? Oh, please. You've gotta be kidding me. What? What? Okay. Come on, come on. Let's run, run, run. Run, run, run. Just gotta sail the way, sail the way, and get around this lizard to kill it. One, two. And then just... How are you gonna... Oh, please. You gotta be kidding me. Ah. Oh, damn you. Hmm. One big smack. Because <clears throat> it does honestly seem like a major benefit of... Oh, but... Right, if we're not... Ring of Blades would be good because I'm not actually trying to fight them anymore. Okay, cool. <sighs> Alright. That said, I... 
Oops. I hope I got my armor. My armor better could meaningfully help. We'll see. Let's pop a real big soul and see how much I can upgrade my armor. It's good stuff already, but uh, I could probably actually wear heavy if I really wanted to, just given how... What? Oh, what? Go to hell. I'm just going to go back and upgrade my aura set real quick. I cannot deal with this. <clears throat> Every little bit of health, every little bit of defense is going to count. This is intense. Me and my armor and... Let's go pop a big... Solve a great hero or something, but I don't think it'll cost that much. Shouldn't. But, whatever. May as well. Reinforce armor. Not the helm, but the armor. This. Every little bit helps. Okay. And just like that. Just like that. And then. Three more, so nine. Actually, Horus and. Leggings. You know, whatever. I'll get more later eventually. So this should meaningfully increase my defenses. Yeah, okay. That is. That's not bad. Okay. I'm gonna go back. <clears throat> back to the top. Back to the smelter throne. <clears throat> Kill Cyril on, God willing. My very last smelter wedge. Complete Nadalia's soul. Cry. Be done for today. <clears throat> you know, if nothing else, I'm just actually impressed with myself that I actually beat Feet Knight. I was not expecting that to happen as easily or honestly even happen at all. But all I had to do was just take it nice, slow, and steady. Steal of glory. Then, this one is from for like Glengle Glungle, the crown, swordsman Adel. Well, I don't, I don't need any help. Well, I probably do, but I'm too prideful. There, I said it. Uh, whatever. Come on, come on. Just out of my way, out of my way. Yeah, I could probably manage heavier armor. That's the thing. Out of the way of that and. What? How did... How, how the... How did it, it... Those homed in. Those had to have homed in. It's nonsense. Oh, dumb, dumb, dumb. Okay, well, alright. One, two, and... Just a couple more. I'm gonna try to kill something. So we're just gonna... Just gonna leave. Okay. Come on. Come on. And just... I can afford to heal once Alon shows up, but that's all we can afford to do. Hi, just out of my way, out of my way. Ooh, come on, come on, just... I'm gonna shoot, you're gonna shoot, but... No, no, no. Didn't hear anything firing, so... Gotta keep on running, keep on running. This is just like... It's like Smelter Demon. It's just like Smelter Demon. No one comes this close. Okay, cool. Yeah, just give me longer arms, why don't you? That would be nice. Nice, and hit... Actually, that's good. And can we... Oh, oh. That hurt. Come on, just... One, two, and step... Oh, what? All right, all right. One, just smack him, and... Oh, oh, okay. We're taking a good amount more hits, which is nice. Heal, heal, heal. Okay, cool, and... What? What? Okay. So, honestly... I can afford to take basically one hit. Wow. I... I beat Smelter, and I beat... I beat Fume with just my fists. It might not hurt to... 
try something else. Or maybe actually, if I hit him from behind, I might be able to actually connect him. Go with power stance attacks. This shit is just... The range is not nearly as good as I expected. I think I'm getting slightly pushed back every time I hit. Hi. Just gotta run, run, run. Run, run. The slices are not great to do it. Hi, just out of the way, out of the way, and run to lay on by. So we've actually gotten a little further ahead. Might be able to keep a bit more SS down one, maybe. We'll see. And so you are. I'm gonna go for a bit more, but we can just go down, wait for my stamina to recharge, and, well, go the wrong way very briefly, but hopefully not repeat that mistake. Is that the, the hammer? The hammer might be good. That's the thing. Hi, oh, just out of the way of that, and, oh, hi, thank you. So that great bow, how well is that great bow actually gonna work? We'll see. Come on, come on. Just out of the way. Oh, but I took time for that. Took time for it to let me dash. Dumb. Okay. Cool, cool. Oh well. And just what? Okay, nice hit. And one, two. Nice, but oh, Ooh. This is gonna be a hard fought battle. One, two, and not gonna go for your thrust. Oh, funny blade wave. Nice. And just punch. Okay, that actually worked quite well. Okay. To roll into it. Oh, okay. Come on, just... Nagamaki, Nagamaki. Just... Ooh, okay. Thrust. Mm -hmm. Initial defense is helping. Well, yeah, we even poised through the SS. Nice, nice. Oh, okay. Please. Hard fought, hard fought. Just go behind and... Actually, did hit with that. Oh, please. Come on. One, two, and roll. Heal, heal. Heal. Okay. Nice. It's gonna be slow and steady. Oh! The timing on that is god awful. Heal, heal. Not when you keep that buffer too long. What? Again? Okay, at least the damage is pretty constant. And just heal, heal. Oh, if you punish me, I guess I can't do that. Hmm. But the big thing is... If I get all the way behind him, if I attack his back rather than his leg, I actually can land both power stance hits. And... Damage is going to be very important. Okay. Hmm. All right, all right. Okay. All I have to do is go through and not get hit by the funny, funny shots. Hi. Okay. Lots and lots of defenses, but still. Oh, oh, oh. Interesting. And just roll, roll, roll. Oh, but we did get hit, but it wasn't that bad, actually. Just need to run, run, run. Hi. Okay. Hit. One, two, one, two, one, two, and... You're gonna go for another, probably, but... Oh, I'm stupid. Roll. Oh, good lord. Good lord, get out of my way. We need to heal. Heal. Heal, heal. Come on, just... Oh, nice! Come on, just out of my way, out of my way. But... If I'm not dumb, I actually do have openings in a lawn's fight that I can use to heal. This need to be very... judicious. Mm. Alright. So we just keep on running. Don't think they'll be all that good at falling over here. As soon as we get in, we heal up and... Crazy, crazy DLC. Okay. Oh, we had to get this. Fun. And go for your PI slash and punch. There we go. And nice. And go behind, punch. There we are. Punch. Oh, or miss. Oh! Weren't fast enough. One, two, and. Alright, well, okay. Cool. 
That's just what oh okay. Still heal bar. One, two, oh, and what? Oh. Mm. Cool sword. I didn't even see he was prepping an attack at that point. Die! Ooh, roll, heal, 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 and. Uh, absolute shooter. What? Okay, there we go. And punch. That's actually pretty punchable. One, punch. Mm. One, two, and. So actually, if we stick close to him, it's all about aggression. Aggression. That's the name of the game. One, hit. And just. Oh, okay. Well, actually, that was fine. One and roll. Ooh, all right. Come on. And start up. Start up is not great. Another hit and one. Oh well, of course you can delay your attack. Fun. And ah, noxious. Okay, heal, heal. Nice and go. What? Oh, all right. Ah. One, two, okay, and just, what, oh, okay, nice, come on, what, oh, thought you might have gone for it, boy, wave, but, oh, we're fine, and punch, punch, hold on down, oh, how many life gems are we going to need to use, heal, heal, oh, well, she did get our healing off still, come on, just, over here. One. Hit. Oh, okay. Come on, just one, two, and roll. Heal, heal. Okay, cool. Nice. And dodge. We are in trouble. Ah, uh, you are insane. Hit. And just one. Okay, nice. Punch. Ah, uh, absolutely. Absolutely brutal. I'm learning your moves. I'm learning your moves. Punch. It's a matter of what I go for. Roll, punch. And then just... Heal, heal. That was alright. Maybe a bit wasted, but... Oh, no! I went way too early there. Noxious. Almost half. Almost half. Please. And two. Oh, you can do a jump attack. It's fast. Okay. Yeah, they literally said, you know, what would the deadliest possible medieval warrior be? And they said, a samurai with European armor. I. I can't disagree. <laughs> kind of right for it. Okay. We're going to go back, we're going to try again, and knowing what we know now, we will hopefully not screw this up. Just got to look out a little and not die to that salamander. Mm -mm. It's, uh, using so many of these just for health. I guess if I really wanted to, I could come back. The easiest way to do this, or at least the least resource intensive, would almost certainly be just ensuring that I don't mess things up too much by essentially going and going getting Vendrick's blessing and putting on one of the crowns so that I don't actually lose any health when I die. And that would make things significantly easier. Significantly easier. But, uh, we'll see. Come on, come on. Let's just run. Keep on running. Almost back to full. One of the things about... One of the ways that Essus is just so much worse in this one is just... It doesn't restore nearly as much HP either. Not just a question of it taking slower, but it's... A lot less bang for the buck. Your time spent, you get a lot less health back. Well, whatever, let's go. You're going to kill you. You're going to kill you if it's the last thing I do. It might be. Hi. Okay, kill. Punch and... And... What? There we go, and... Punch. Ooh. Well... That's... A no-hit god. 
Heal, heal. Okay, and just one. Ugh. Ugh. Come on. Oh, absolutely just impaling. Okay, luckily, that's punishable. I can heal that off. Actually, the leg is not bad, but okay. So he attacks really quickly there. That is. We want to punish that. We need to be fast on the draw. Left side, not right side. Okay, so how can I tell? It'd be nice if he held it on a different side if he was going to punish like that, but nothing can ever be so easy. Come on. Just one, two, and... Uh, I need to be rolling towards him instead of rolling away. Just... Uh, uh, okay. Die. Out of my way, out of my way. I have things to do, maybe. That kind of delay? What? It's insane. Okay. Just roll. Roll punch. Or actually, we did not get the punch out. Ah, it's just. You are. Ah. Rolling the. Ah. Actually, going for the. Uppercut very specifically might be what I have to do. Just how did you... That level of delay is just... Roll, heal, heal, heal. Okay, cool, and just... What? There we go. Nice. Couple of hits, and... Oh. So you have to roll pretty much immediately, or you will not manage to dodge it. But if you... It's really just absolutely split second. Oh, but that still hit me. Come on. Nice, and punch. We're doing okay for ourselves. And just... Oh, and of course you. Go for the delay. Come on. So now we heal. Now we heal. Just... Oh, please. Still got a decent amount of health back. But still... Okay, come on. Just... So I guess if it's he's still holding in a pose, you can... Heal off that, but oh, please! If only I had infinite Estus, that would be nice. Come on, just out of the way. Yeah, they always said, give him a sword beam. We can't do that. We literally do not have that, even when we get a sword. Roll and can we punish that? Should have rolled towards instead of away. Oh, and just out of the way of that. And just, come on, come on. Oh, please. One, two, and out of the way of that. And Estus, gonna have to switch the life gems probably. There we go. At least we didn't get hit by that. And there we go. What are you gonna do now? Okay, cool. Oh, you are, you're in berserk mode. Oh wow. Life gem time. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. Oh no! Okay. That was a pretty bad way to go out. That said, it, I would have started using life gems, and by using life gems, and that died. That would have been idiotic. So, okay. A few more tries. Oh, I got. I'm already 36 over my intended time slot, so let's just. I'll go for 24 more maximum. It's not a long enough run. That should give me about 8 more tries, maybe, depending on how long it takes. Yeah, but it's just, there's nothing... There aren't really any spells I could use to counter him. He's not weak to any kind of magic in particular. He doesn't have any clear weaknesses. He's just a really fast swords guy. Oh, what? Oh, please. What are you doing? Ah, oh, I'm just... I can't really get over there, but oh, I'm already down a few Estus. This, this is gonna suck. Hi. Hi. Die. And one more, one more. Die. And just out of the way. So actually, if we move over very slightly as we go in, start punching the Salamander as soon as we can. It's just funny that every time you want to go do this boss fight, 
You have to kill the salamander. You have to. There's no way around it. It's so funny. Hi. Okay, well. Keep on rolling. Oh, goodness. Don't hit me. Don't kill me. How much farther are you going to go? Okay, you're done. You're done? Are you done? Please be done. Okay, you're done. Good. You know, they could have not done that. They could have made it worse that way. But they didn't. I'm a little thankful. You just... Ah! Uh, okay, out of the way. A little bit and... Ah! Uh, so... Please... I feel like every two deaths or so could be effigy time. It's just every little bit of health helps. Now the chance of living on one HP is too much to pass up. Welcome back. I'm fighting a... They basically decided, well, I beat Fume Knight. That's what happened. Which was nice. It was fun enough. And I was saying that one of the reasons I think Capitano might be Varka is that Fume Knight looks very, very similar to Capitano. The whole black armor, vaguely faceless look with sort of a kind of a screen over the face. And, you know, general vibe, I guess. But also, given that fighting with two swords is explicitly, well, the great sword and a long sword together is explicitly a Favonius thing. And that's exactly how Fume Knight fights. I think there's a decent chance of it. Of Capitano being Varka just because of that. Because you know how much they love references. Okay, cool, and just... Come on, just one, one, and another. one more, one more. There we go. So we just gotta go down, just go down. Yeah, it would be. But given that we haven't seen Varka yet, and don't even really know what he looks like... It, I feel like they might be doing that just so they can do a reveal like that without it being too crazy. Yeah, there was... The big thing that stands in the way of that is the fact that... What? Kill yourself. Is the fact that... In that old leak so many years ago... Well, about a year ago now. There were three tall male designs. Well, three buff male designs. And one of them... Was literally just Piero looked exactly like the Piero design we saw in that one animated trailer and another. The others, people said, were basically, okay, this is Capitano and this is Varka, which is a pretty fair assumption to make, given the lack of evidence, the fact that nothing had a label, and the fact that, well, you know, you wouldn't normally expect them to be the same person, but I don't know, I don't know. It's just... I think it would be cool. How did they... How did that salamander... Okay, that's definitely input reading. A lot of enemies in this game who shoot projectiles do do a bit of input reading. It's definitely input reading. Hi. I'm just out of the way, out of the way. Come on, come on. Yo. Keep on running, keep on running. Well... Maybe yes, maybe no. Because the entire thing is that... Uh, the only information we have about Capitano is from last year's Mondstadt Fall event where Mika talks about seeing Capitano with piercing blue eyes and a big Fatui army over in Cisnai where he went with Varka. But the only information we get about comparing Varka to Capitano is Varka himself saying something something, there are 11 Harbingers but only one Grand Master, I can definitely beat him. Which... Well, I... The entire point about Varka is that he's been gone. And nobody really knows what Capitano looks like, and that's the thing. Is that it would actually be a lot easier to pull that off than, than you might think. And to be frank, the Fatui would probably be deliberately keeping that a secret. So it's not like the Fatui would really mind. You know, they would have... They would have a mole. Just, okay, so actually, if I roll towards, if I roll towards him, the slash can be dodged one way or the other. Okay, cool. Go down, go down, and hmm. it's just. Uh, I think 
There's gotta be one real double agent playable character sometime. Or at least someone with... I feel like the fact that Fontaine had such a big theme of hidden identity has to lead to something else. Not just its own thing. But we'll see. Right now it's just wishful thinking, and frankly I think it's far more likely that it doesn't happen than it does, but... I don't know, we'll see. One, two, and... Go. Alright. Oh! Oh, come on. Yeah, but they basically decided that the most intimidating enemy possible would be a Western knight, I mean, a samurai with Western European armor. Oh, come on, just whatever. Die! Ah! Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Fair. Well, you were going to do that anyway, so I don't see the difference. I don't think that makes much of a difference. Heard me how. That I said that he was probably the most threatening thing ever? Yeah. The funny thing is, is that if you actually manage to beat him without taking a single hit... I wasn't saying that was a bad thing, I was saying that would just happen either way. You literally cry over every story quest, most of them aren't even sad. But, you have literally said that in the past. I am... Oh my goodness, but... Whatever. The big thing... The big thing is, like I said, you know, the two most overplayed things in fantasy, western armor and samurai swords, he's got both. Sure, but most of them aren't sad. And some of them make you cry tears of joy, but it's... <sighs> to be frank, some of them suck. Some of the story quests suck. And, you know, it's legitimate that you would cry, you know, crying makes you human, but... Some of the story quests are just really, really badly written. I mean, it's one thing to cry over the Dia story quest, because I was weaving bitter tears. Or the Baiju one, that one was good too. But if you cry over the Xing Chao story quest, the Xing Chao story quest, it's just, I'm sorry. I mean, that's not a bad thing, it's just a surprise to me. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. The Xing Chao story quest, it isn't bad, but it isn't emotional. It's literally just, oh, I'm hunting down for Tui. That's it. Oh, okay, okay. Well, Xing Chao didn't have a hangout. Xing Chao had a story quest. Oh, such an annoying. And if, uh, if he delays it, you. See? And I guess running away might help, but still. Okay, actually, yeah, running away. Running away is how I'm gonna have to do it. I mean, rolling away is how I'm gonna have to do this. Okay, okay, alright. And just roll. Okay. So anytime he prepares that attack, I have to roll away. Come on, just roll. And maybe heal, sure. Okay. Come on, come on, and oh goodness. Please die. Die. And whoa. Mm -hmm. Okay. I know you are. I mean, I know you do. Don't worry. It's just a little game we play. Just like Dark Souls. Well, actually, you don't play Dark Souls, so... Probably good. Come on, come on, just... Oh, 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 okay. Uh, just... Out of the way, and... Roll! Yep, actually, so that's not bad. He's only got so much distance, so if I roll away, he can't hit me with the uppercut no matter what. Nice, and roll. Come on, just punch. Fighting this guy with literally my fists is insane. I feel like a lunatic. Come on. Yeah, rolling away is what I'm gonna have to do. As soon as he brings the sword up, I gotta roll away. That thrust, it's very telegraphed, but if he hits you with it, he's gonna just sta impale you on the end of his sword and then buff himself, so can't really do that. Come on, just... Oh, please. Thank you, thank you. I've gotten better. This is a hard fight. It's... I don't know whether it's harder than Fume, but it's not easy. Either way, you have to beat Fume to do this fight, so... It's kind of the true secret final boss of the DLC. I guess. More like a worm skewer at this point. Come on. I have 
I think I've come to understand his moveset now. Just one. Oh, please. So actually, he can't move that far, so as long as I'm not done, I can win. Let's just do this. Oh, oh, oh. Exactly, as long as I'm not done. Well, I don't know. It's, it's factual. Okay. Oh, and I totally missed. Yeah, the range, the lack of the rub is definitely the big issue here. Luckily, that roll, that thrust is so fast, it actually makes it easier to dodge. Come on, come on, just... What are you gonna do? Come on, just hit, punch. Got one hit off. Please, please. Yeah, exactly, I had a worm infestation. And now the worms are me, and I am them. Please. Oh, you got out of the way. Come on. There we go, so you'll only get close enough to hit me no closer. Oh, there we are. Come on. And just... There we go, please. And just roll. Roll. More or less, yeah. Hopefully. Worm powers. It's just... Reminds me of those joke edits where they have Batman without the ears on his cowl, and they just call him man. It's a lot funnier than it has any right to be. Ugh, okay. Worm man. And just heal, can we heal? Nice, go, oh! So we got slap, but our armor's good enough that we can actually afford to tank a bit. Come on, just, as long as we don't screw this up too much, we can just punch him down. Come on, come on. One. Oh, please. Ah! Oh, this is skewer didn't deal that much damage. There we go, one, two, one, two. One more punch, one more punch. Okay, do not get me with that attack. One and do it. Do it! Goodbye! Never bring a sword to a fist fight. <sighs> okay. We did it! We did it! And I believe that meant. Did I get the last smelter wedge? I didn't, just, I didn't see. We got. Wait, where's. Where is it? This is after. Oh, so it needs to be in there. I didn't even notice there was a fog gate. I'm gonna go get the final Nadalia soul, and then that'll be it. That'll be done. So that... Okay, that's really important to know. It took me a while to figure out that you can reliably dodge his charge attack if you roll backward instead of the side or forward. But it does require a bit more of a defensive play style. Poor soul, her offer victory. Fine work. Examine. And we got our last smelter wedge. Which is important, because I had to fight Fume Knight. I didn't have to deal with him healing. But I had to keep him out of the part of the arena where he would heal if he had went there. It's just like Hollow Knight, guys. It's basically Hollow Knight. So we can go over, we can get the last wedge, and all the fragments of Nidalia's soul will combine into one. And that will be the end of everything in Crown of the Old Iron King DLC. Oh well. That's all. That's all. Well, actually, I could level up a few more times, actually, so I should do that after all this. Thank you, goodbye. Pick up the item and sold Nadalia Bride of Ash, and... Can I get some kind of notification that they all combined her? Yep, okay. So this is a full version of her soul. Nadalia is no more true soul of Nadalia acquired. Got Sir Olan, Fume Knight, and oh, all of the dark... Ones are together. Sir Olan came from an eastern land and became the king's most trusted knight. Well, I'm gonna fight a couple golems with my fists, but then it's probably over for fists. This was just a goofy gimmick for this one stream. And to be able to say that I punched out Sir Olan, because I did. Okay, well, Adalia exactly transfigured a smoke to a residence came to be known as the Broom Tower. Hogger of Solitude. Alright, cool. Fair enough. Hi! So we got you over this way. Yeah, actually, finish this off once we manage to heal. Hi! Come on, come on. Come on. Let's like that and... Any more, or... Oh, please. Come on, just one. Two. And that did not hit me, and that's good. Ugh, oh, come on, just... 
What am I? What? Oh, please, whatever. Okay. So the last thing I'm gonna do is punch out these two golems with these funny spiky hammers, and then it will all be over. I will quit myself of this horrible place and never come back. This does mean that it'll probably be two more Dark Souls st two streams until it's all over, so... Because I have to deal with the third DLC, and then also... Then I have to deal with true endgame. Come on. That's just... Oh, funny. You basically did not hit me at all. Just... Oh, come on. Just... There we go. And... Punch, punch. Ooh, ooh, ooh. They really are. But, of course, I can just punch them. That's fine, too. And one more, one more. There we go. All right. Got you down. Got you down. And we also got the crown of the old Iron King at the end of... All of that over there. Past the Fume Knight Arena, which I could actually show you pretty quickly. Given that I don't think you got to see it. I need to reward your diligence. Come on, come on. Luckily, they don't have any kind of range attack. And that would really suck. Come on, come on. Just... Fire isn't doing all that much to me, but... Okay, and there we go. And it still hit me on the backswing. I should have dodged the other way. Hi. Die, die, die. And it died as it hit us. Cool. Let me see if there are any more in here. I don't think there should be. There were just two on that side leading the way of the bonfire. So I'm just going to finish things up here. Did get the items here, so there's nothing really to get. But see, end of the arena, and there were four or so. Yeah. Four of these idols around the arena, and all of them, if you not got close, it would heal him. And since I had all but one smelter wedge, and I forgot to save one for the end because I didn't know when I'd have to do that, I... Well, actually, very specifically, I thought I only needed one for the end. So... But yeah, over here there was one, so I had to basically keep him on this side of the arena the entire fight. But it worked. Ugh. And yep, yeah, this was where Nadalia originally was. Funny corpse moment. This is where I got the crown. So it's time to go back to Majula. Exactly, exactly. And I was told by a friend to try to do Fume without destroying the Ashen Idol. And even though he almost certainly meant without destroying any of them, there was one left. So I'm going to claim victory on a technicality, as I like to. So, get a little bit more. A little bit more. Intelligence. That didn't even increase my didn't even increase my magic bonus at all. We were getting very, very close. Guess we hit the soft caps. How much for another one? How much for another one? We need. 67631. Be about 300 more. Let's check out my inventory real quick and Silver Brave Warrior. So that would be. Ooh, interesting. I alright. Should be okay, but. <laughs> Got that. Let's just use one of these and see how close we get. 300 and we need. We need a good deal more. Okay, well. It's like 6-7. Six, 6-7. Seven, six, seven. Should be alright. Soul the Proud Knight and. Might need one more. Yeah, we need one more. It's a 500 size soul. Let's see. Name a soldier. Okay, cool. We are starting to run out of hard souls. In that case, well, let's swap up my faith and. Oh, so interesting. It seems that magic caps are lower and then lightning eventually catches up. In order to make it so that if you want to actually use lightning, you really need to invest in it. So that if you're just taking a little bit of faith for healing miracles, I suppose, you don't get too much. So, exactly, and our dark bonus is only climbing higher. It is insane. Well, there we go. Everything is at 29, which should mean... Should mean, let me see real quick. See my... Yep, so dexterity is 6. 
So I probably should be able to. The big thing is that you can craft a really nice sword with the soul of Surulan. And it enchants really, really well, but it infuses really, really well. So I think I'd like to actually infuse it with a lightning and then use it on the final boss, because the final boss is weak. Well, all parts of the final boss grouping, I'll say that much, are very weak to lightning, but the final final boss is additionally weak to slash. So we'll make a fun Nagamaki, which for what it's worth, Katsuragi Kiri Tataru... Katsuragi, Katsuragi Kiri Nagamasa, the Inazuma Craft will Claymore says it's a Nagamaki. It's not a Nagamaki. A Nagamaki has a long handle like the sword he had. But either way, I've talked too much about Genshin for a Dark Souls stream. Thank you to everyone for watching, and yeah, Sadaragon. See ya.